Hello YouTube and welcome to a very special Screaming at a Joypad and today we're kicking off spooky season over on Twitch with the original Resident Evil on PlayStation 1. Now it took us a little while to get everything sort of sorted with audio and visual but everything now should be absolutely fine. So we're going to start playing through it and I hope you enjoy it. You know how YouTube works right now, I don't need to explain it to you. You know what helps and what doesn't. So without further ado, let's dive straight in. Uh, new gam. This, um, you're about to see something very special, chat. This wins the uh, award for best cinematic opening of any game ever made in the history of mankind. And I will nerd fight anyone who says different. When I say nerd fight, I mean we both just sort of do that at each other. <laughs> Enjoy. Alpha Team is flying around the forest zone, situated in northwest Raccoon City, where we're searching for the helicopter of our compatriots, Bravo Team, who disappeared during the middle Chris, of our mission. You haven't found it? No, I haven't found it yet. Bizarre murder cases have recently occurred in Raccoon City. There are outlandish reports of families being attacked by a group of about ten people. Victims were apparently eaten. Bravo team went to the hideout of the group and disappeared. Look, Chris! It was Bravo team's helicopter. Nobody was in it. But strangely, most of the equipment was still there. However, we soon discovered why. This is awesome. Chris Redfield. Jill Valentine. Barry Burton. Rebecca Chambers. Albert Wesker. Fucking hair, man. Resident Evil. <laughs> Brilliant. <laughs> it never gets old. It never, ever gets old. Ever. <laughs> what is this? Wow. What a mansion! Captain Wesker, where's Chris? Stop it! 
Don't open that door! But Chris is... Point. What is it? Maybe it's Chris. Now, Jill, can you go? I'm going with you. Chris is our old partner, you know. Okay, let me handle this. Stay alert! Dining room. <laughs> Parrish is like a dining room. Like he's never seen a dining room before. <clears throat> Gritty green with the absolute truth bomb. This feels like what the people that made the Mortal Kombat and Street Fighter movies <laughs> made a, co a college assignment. <laughs> We're watching someone's homework. Meow. <laughs> Ooh, a clock. A dusty looking grandfather clock. Cannot move the grandfather clock. What? What, what is this? Good old Barry. Barry's got big dad energy. What really is has. it? Blood. Jill. See if you can find any other clues. I'll be examining this. Hope okay, this I'll see what I can go find. Blood. I'm sure I can find something. Can I get behind you to pick up this emblem? Thanks. Weirdly rhythmic grandfather clock. <laughs> hmm, I wonder what's around here. Only the most classic scene in any Resident Evil game. It's Nibbles McGee. All right, Nibbles. The loading weight there. Yeah, you just follow me, because I'm a pro, and I'm not wasting any of my fucking bullets on your sorry face. <laughs> oh, Barry. <laughs> Barry with his infinite ammunition and his magnum. Barry? What is... Watch out! It's a monster! Let me take care of this. What is it? Kenneth was killed too. Maybe by this creature. Anyway, let's report this to Wesker. for him, Jill. And don't leave this hall for the time being. Well, you say that. I got shit I need to do. Like, I need to collect this ink ribbon. This ink ribbon? There is no time to check it. Fine. Come on, then. I'm pretty sure I'll go upstairs first. I have a weird way of playing this, and I'm not I'm not sure it's going to be the same way other people play it, but you'll have to bear with me. I'm half remembering my old paths through this, so you'll need to just bear with me. I've got to search this hall first. Oh, fine. Was there not a, like a quick turn function? Nope, apparently not. 
Wait, was wait, hang on. Chat up. Hang on. Hang on. Bear with Mike. Bear with him. Uh not file. How did I get that help screen up a minute ago? <laughs> when I reset it earlier, how did I get that help screen up? The control screen. That's how I got the controls up. There we go. There's no quick turn. Quick turn, quick turn, quick turn, quick turn. Nope. Okay, cool. No quick turn. It's before the days of quick turn. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. I forgot about the tank controls. I've got to search this hall first. Okay. No, wait. Hang on. Doesn't, doesn't Big Bear Barry disappear? Well, I can't remember. Invaded by a cat, but I don't know where he is. Badunk, badunk, badunk. POV, you are a slinky. Ah, mate. Find anything, Jill? Nothing. What is this all about? I can't figure it out at all. Beats me, too. Now it's Wesker's time to disappear. I don't know what's going on. Well, it can't be helped. Let's search for him separately. I'll check the dining room again. Okay, I'll try the door on the opposite side. This mansion is gigantic. We could get into trouble if we get lost. We should start from the first floor, okay? And Jill, here's a lockpick. It might be handy if you, the master of unlocking, Take it with you. The master of unlock. I forgot about that. <laughs> Thanks. Maybe I'll need it. Listen. If something happens, let's meet up in this hall. Yeah, sure. Why not? No space to run around in. This time, I'll be there. This time you'll be there. Oh dear. You would assume, Greedy Green, you would definitely assume. Oh, good job. I now have a lockpick, even though I am already the master of unlocking. Right, so. No, I'm sure I. I'm sure there's something up here that I want first. I'm sure there is. Yeah, 100% percent i It was always a good idea to split up in horror settings. Always. Spooky mansions. Very well lit mansion, though. Let's be honest. Fucking, I mean, no spoilers, obviously. The electricity bill for this place must be astronomical. I used to love the, um, oh, hello. I used to love the, uh, Resident Evil books that were made, um, that were based on the Resident Evil lore, that explained, like, the mansion's architect and how he had, like, a nervous breakdown whilst making the mansion. Come on, steady rain. Steady. Get off, you slug. Thank you. Fucking hell, right? Okay, get off. Off you get. Come on. I didn't mean to press that. I have a feeling that's going to be a running theme throughout this. Well, you guys can fuck off. Let's go the way I know, the way I remember playing in the olden days. Not So I'm mixing up strats at the minute. I'm mixing up the way I would normally play it versus the way I would play it if I was trying to get the the achievement for, I say achievement, before achievements, the achievement for completing it in under a certain amount of time.
Darcy Sue, you're absolutely right. I've, I've always found that. Or at least, you know, be nice. You notice the zombies weren't on the balcony when I was in the dining room. Two out of ten. Uh, right, let's go down. It's locked from inside. If only the master of unlocking could unlock it. You have used the lockpick. It is broken. <laughs> how dark this game was a fine grand piano what else is it is it just the grand piano i think it's just the grand piano unless there's something i really cannot see because darkness oh no there we go oh how exciting secrets is this a map? It's... No, it's music notes. Oh, caution. We might want to use our fade spray. There we go. A fine grand piano. Oh, yeah. Use. It's Moonlight Sonata. my jewelry off it's clattering on my microphone how exciting i don't think we can do anything in here yet I've been wrong before. Gold emblem, please. Gold emblem me. Oh no, if only I had a replacement emblem. <coughs> Excuse me. It's a hollow that the emblem was in. Oh, yeah, sorry. I forgot, games of this era didn't hold your hand much, did they? Let me just... Good. I also need to just remove my preview because otherwise I'll just keep looking at my lovely face. Uh, okay, so gold emblem. Now. Now it can start properly. Now it can start properly. So much so I'm going to put my feet up and everything. Oh, lovely. Right, let's go back over here. No, the mansion key. Cool, I got a skeleton key, even though I'm already the master of unlocking. Stuff's coming back to me as I'm playing it, and I'm like, I'm sure that's there, and I'm sure that's here, I'm not sure. The problem being, I'm very old. So I get, I get confused quite a lot. Right, second floor. <clears throat> go this way. <laughs> Let's just take some two at a time. Absolute legend. Oh, this controller is so small in my hands. I can't quite get over how tiny this controller feels. Wow, this is a dark room. Holy shit, this is a dark room. 
I can't see if there's something there's something there and I can't see it. Aim. Fire. Die. Can I stamp on it? No, I can't. But that's the, the carving of armor. Dark game is dark. Uh, a carving of armor. Hi there. See ya. Oh, wait, there's a door. It's locked from inside. Juicy Law Nugget. <clears throat> Botany book about medicinal herbs. As you may know, there are many plants that have medicinal effects. Some ancient, Since ancient times, humans have uh, been healing wounds and diseases using various plants. And uh, my assumption is not very, not very well, because the average age of death used to be like 27. In this book, we're going to sample three herbs that grow around the Raccoon Mountains that give their outlines as examples of those plants with medicinal properties. Each herb has different colors and different effects. Cool. We we mostly we know this, right? Like we know we know what the herbs do. They heal. One heals, one boosts, and one does something else that I'm not reading. That's a lot of words. It's a lot of words. You unlocked it. Congratulations. Jesus, this is dark. <laughs> Cannot quite get over how dark some of this is. Uh, it's well arranged. How would you know? You can't see it. Nothing uncommon. Apart from all the zombies, obviously. Other than that, yeah, nothing uncommon. Wait, does this lead me back to the thingy? The, I think it's leading me back to the bird corridor. The corridor with the... Um, Keith Kenneth. Oh, hello. Ah! I'm out of bullets. And you're out of time, friend. Oh, fuck. Oh, no, I unlocked it. That's good. Right, awesome. I think I went the wrong way. All the zombies are gone. That must be such a good shot. I killed all of them with only two bullets each. Except now I'm out of bullets. So I'm dead. Like super duper dead. Yeah. <laughs> PlayStation is going fucking bonkers in the corner. <gasps> There's spots of blood here and there. And everywhere. I'm probably gonna die. Hey, Barry. Easy, Jill. mate. Jesus. <laughs> Don't scare me. That's what I was going to say. Aren't you supposed to be going over the first floor, Barry? Yeah, you're right. But just take a look at this. Oh, dear. It's forest. Oh, my God. Not bad, mate. It's awful. I'm going to find out what caused Forrest's death. Well, let's loot it that body. It looks like he was killed by a crow or something. Can you look around the first floor, Jill? I was having fun on the okay. second floor, but. 
<laughs> hey, okay. Jill. Bye. This must have been Forrest's. You don't have a weapon. Take this with you. Yeah. What's what's this, by any chance? Oh, good. It's a bazooka. <laughs> and that, kids, is how you get the bazooka at the beginning of Resident Evil. <laughs> Beautiful forest scenery. There's something else up here as well. I want to say it's a story item that I need. Don't make me use my bazooka on you. Bazooka? I don't, don't even know. Only just met her. I think I want to go this way. Okay, well, I definitely want to go this way because I want to get this gem. If I can, like, pull you guys away. Get you both with one bazooka shot. That would be. Oh, can I nip past you? Can I? Can I nip past you? No, I can't. Curses! God damn it, Echo Alpha! Twenty-four months in a row. Goodness me! What's wrong with you people? Thank you so much, Echo. Thank you. I appreciate that. Right, come here, you two. I got. I need to bazooka you a question. There's not many bazooka-related puns I've noticed. Have you ever know? Have you ever realised that? There's axe-related puns. There's not many bazooka-related puns. Can you two please group? Wait, you in the back? Fine. I'll just. Fuck it. I'll do it myself. Very much appreciated, Echo Alpha. Thank you so much. On this, the month of our horde, uh, October, Spooktober. I appreciate all. Uh, I appreciate milking this floor as well. Fucking vandal. I love that you don't have a weapon. Take this. What is it? A bazooka. Uh, Barry. Classic Barry. Just, just find just find yourself a corner somewhere. Um, uh, um, fuck off. <laughs> fuck off. Wait, those are stairs down, aren't they? Yeah. Still can't turn around quickly. That's still not a thing. It's locked. A carving of a helmet. You're a carving of a helmet. A numerical key panel. You don't know the pass number. I bet I fucking do. <laughs> bet I can remember it. <laughs> oh, I can't. I don't run downstairs automatically. I keep forgetting. Keep forgetting. Badump. Badump. Ba -dump. Ba -dump. Oh wait, hang on. Check. Check the key. It's got a picture of a shield. It's the shield key. I forgot I had to do that. Nope. Nope. I'm going to go to my save room. You guys can piss off. Piss off, zombie. Oh, the beautiful save room music. Delicious. What have we got? Vitamins and serums. Oh my. Vitamins and serums and ampoules. Oh my. What have we got in our thing? We've got some clips. Lovely. Uh, just get that. And then we get that. And then put that away. And that's that's it. That's all I'm going to do. Get out of this. Combine. Reload. Reload. 
drop. What is this? The fuck? Oh, it's an equipment. Got it. Okay. I'm like, I'm searching the bed. What's going on? I'm not going to save yet because I'm a true gamer. This is the worst mistake of my life. The worst. Boop. Yep. 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 What's this door? Give me this door. God damn it! Carving of armor. Whoa, bye. I love half remembering how to play this game. Ah oh, yeah. You're right. There's gonna be a little around this corner, isn't there? I oh, know there's not. <gasps> no, this isn't where I think it is. This is not the Joe Sandwich Delicatessen. Oh, I oh yeah, I'm not going this way. No. Hard pass. An old pump. Water seems to be sent from here. The lid is open. If only I had a chemical. Yes, it is. Joe Valentine away! Joe Valentine away! <laughs> Fuck off! Fuck off, creep. You have used the lockpick. Lovely. I feel, I kind of feel like I'm just getting my bearings in a minute. Like I'm, oh hello, what's this? It's a clip. Huzzah! I'm at danger level, which is unfortunate. None of this looks useful. In an emergency situation, everything is useful. You can throw anything at a zombie and hope it kills it. Uh, it's, a, it's a very dark room. It's a very, very dark room, in fact. <gasps> Law. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, it's a cutscene. Oh, dear. Oh, no. No chances, buddy. No chances. Yeah. Go fuck yourself. What's in this closet? It's... Shells. How do I reload? Is there a reload button? Oh my god, there's not a reload button. It might be automatic when I run out of ammunition, but still, that's ridiculous. Old man complains about video games. Uh, keep his diary. <clears throat> May 9th, 1998. At night, we played poker with Scott the card. Uh, Elias and Steve, the researcher. Steve was really lucky, but I think he was cheating. What a scumbag. May 10th, 1998. Today, a high-ranking researcher had told, asked me to take care of a new monster. It looks like a gorilla without any skin. They told me to feed them live food. When I threw in a pig, they were playing with it, tearing off the pig's legs and pulling out the guts before they actually ate it. May 11th, 1998. Around 5, five o'clock this morning, Scott came in and woke me up suddenly. He was wearing a protection suit that looked like a spacesuit. He told me to put one on as well. I heard there was an accident in the basement lab. It's no wonder. Those researchers never rest, even at night. May 12th. Wait, did we miss a day? No. May 12th, 1998. I've been wearing this annoying spacesuit since yesterday. My skin grows musty and feels very itchy. Itchy tasty. By way of revenge, I didn't feed those dogs today. Now I feel better. What a dick! May 13th, 1998. I went to the medical room because my back is all swollen and feels itchy. Itchy tasty. They put a big bandage on my back and the doctor told me I did not need to wear the spacesuit anymore. Mm-hmm. 
I guess I can sleep well tonight. May 14th, 1998. When I wake up, when I woke up in the morning, I found another blister on my foot. It was annoying and I ended up dragging my foot as I went to the dog's pen. They have been quiet since morning, which is very unusual. I found that some of them had escaped. It'll be, I'll be in real trouble if the higher ups find out. May 15th, 1998. Even though I didn't feel well, I decided to go see Nancy. It's my first day off in a long time, but I was stopped by the guard on the way out. They say the company has ordered that no one leave the grounds. I can't even make a phone call. What kind of joke is this? May 16th, 1998. I heard a researcher who tried to escape from the mansion last, was shot last night. My entire body feels burning and itchy at night. Itchy tasty. When I was scratching the swelling on my arm, a lump of rotten flesh dropped off. What the hell is happening to me? I know, I know, I know. <laughs> Fever gone but itchy. Hungry and eat doggy food. Itchy, itchy Scott came. Ugly face so killed him. Tasty. May 19th, 1998. Four. Itchy. Tasty. Classic. Keeper's diary has been filed. Mm, lovely. Yeah, I'd, I'd want to touch that. I want to keep that in my bag. Delightful. Delightful. Bye. You unlocked it. Now where am I? Oh, I'm back here. Okay, so I'm now on the first floor. Oh no, poor headless someone. Get it. Get it, that's him. Poor headless. He's a mere shadow of his former self. Well, no, he's a corpse. Now, is this going to trigger the Barry cutscene? I can't remember. There's a cutscene where Barry is in the... Oh, good, I can get the gem. Lovely. Uh, I can get the gem and put it in a box. Ba -da -da -da. Blue jewel. I'm very injured. I don't feel like I deserve to be this injured. Only, I've only had like three bites of zombies, highly infectious beings. I think I should be okay. Barry? Barry? No. Okay. Let's go upstairs then. There is definitely something upstairs I need to get. I think it's that chemical for the thing. Pretty sure it's the chemical for the thing, for the plant. And I want to say it's this way. No, that's the way we swim. Silly sausage, Mike. Oh, wait, is there something this way? Yeah. Tank controls. Well, now I'm, now I'm more used to it. I'm fine, apart from dangerous situations where I'm like, I have no fucking clue where I'm going. Oh my god, it's so dark in this corridor. It's locked. A carving of armor. Is this does this count as armor? I don't think this counts as armor. No. Okay, cool. Get off up. Doing the door, the door squint. It's locked. A carving of armor. Right, this one's open, which I think we went through a minute ago. Is this alone in the dark? Fucking feels like alone in the dark. Hiya! You alright, mate? I'm in no mood, zombie. No mood whatsoever. Oh, maybe it's this way. Great. Hi. Bye. That's one getting up behind me. <laughs> What's in here? It's locked. A carving of armor. Of course it is. I'm going to go psychotic when I get the armor key. It's open. It's the blue door. 
Oh, has anyone played the new Alone in the Dark demo? It's not terrible. It's not great, but it's not terrible. Wood is put in the stove. A paper is on the wall. Good. Fantastic. A, an herb is in the corner. Will you take the green herb? Yes. Thanks. Bye. I'll also maybe eat the green herb. Wah. Oh, my Twitch chat just reconnected me. Have I disconnected? No. I don't think I'm fine. I think I'm fine. Sound off, chat. Sound off. It's locked. The carving of a helmet. You're a carving of a helmet. Great. I might just numb this herb. Didn't help. Didn't help in the slightest. No. Oh, I would have I assumed they were there. Right. Where am I where am I going? It's definitely something on the second floor. I remember it being the second floor. The door was broken. I just came through it a minute ago. Ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Who designed this place? A nutcase. That's who designed this place. It's the dark. It doesn't help that I've got the lights on, but it's it's it, I broke it, yeah. No, this is this is this room, yeah. There's oh, there's a door here. Did I find the door here? No, I did. Oh no, that is that room. Oh fucking hell! <laughs> ah, excellent. I'm back to the tried and tested tradition of not knowing what the fuck I am doing. Fantastic. I hope you all enjoying the show. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Meow. 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 my stream manager up. There we go. Right. What's this way? I'll try and remember now. I feel like I'm starting to get my bearings a little bit. Only a little bit, though. Don't expect me to know where things are. That's what I need you guys for. Right, this was this was Thingy McDuff, wasn't it? This was Crow McDuff. Just... I'm gonna eat my birds here, aren't I? I'm out. I'm certain there's something up here I need to get. But not here, clearly. Maybe I'm wrong. I mean, I'm misremembering most of this, so it's entirely possible I'm wrong. Is there nut there? Nyam. Not in that one. So let's try back in this one. Back with Wingus and Dingus. The two wonder zombies. It's so small in my hands. Oh, that's my eye. Do I stop my bazooka? No, I don't. Come on. See ya, loser. I realized how little items have descriptions in older games. But then I remember they didn't have infinite amount of memory, so. Right, that's in here. Which goes to here. Yeah. No, no, I've done it wrong there, haven't I? Kind of forgot there's no aiming system. You just have to kind of aim yourself. I'll be honest, I expected it to aim for me then. Carving of a helmet. No. 
and there's a numerical keypad on. Right, okay, cool. Uh, okay, oh, fuck off. I clearly don't know the thingy, which is fine. Right, it's got an end. Now, is there still a zombie over here? Yeah, he's just he's just chilling. Was there still one over here as well? No, I think I killed that one. No, no, apparently I didn't. Get knotted, mate. I'm out of here. Yeah, I'm gonna leave you guys to it. I can't remember now if these guys come back if I kill them. I think there's story bits where they will eventually come back. Ah, I think this is where I need to go. It's locked from inside, and it's not locked. No, that's the bar. I'm so confused again. I'm so confused already. <laughs> I've got my head so scrambled with this game. Yep, that's Kenneth, all right. It's ominously quiet outside. You know, apart from the murder dogs. Oh. Uh, is it not... There's the other side of the main hall that I've not gone through, is there? Isn't there? Sorry. I remember! I remember the entire lower wing of the mansion that I've not been through. That's what I remember. Dunk, 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 dunk. These doors. I forgot about these doors. I mean, in Venice, they're hidden. I mean, it's a bright blue door and a white background. So, you know, it's, it's understandable that I didn't see it. Where's me stairs? Where's me stairs? No, not that way. I'll soft lock it. No, stop. Stop it. Stop it. Give us me map. Oh, for fuck's sake, Jim. I hate virtual games. That's why I've got so many of them. Blah, 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 blah. It's a map of the first floor. Will you take it? You got the map of the first floor. Huzzah. No, no, no. Go down. Now, I vaguely remember there being a zombie in here. Uh, can I even move this? Like, is this a... Is this something? I can't move this out of the way. I remember this being a danger moment. Oh, you can get through that. Hello. Fuck. Nope, 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 nope. Back off, back off, back off, back off. Might be dead, you might not be dead. Let's just double check. Give you the old tippy tap. Yep, you're dead. Good. What was here? We got stuff here. I can't remember what. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? We got fucking name remember. Jesus Christ. More more secrets, please. What's going on here? Insert Zelda treasure jingle. <laughs> Various pictures. That felt utterly useless. Utterly and complete waste of ammunition. What? Oh no, don't push the stairs. Go this way. You have used the lockpick. I'm so glad she's got that lockpick. 
This would be a much worse game if she did. Oh, this is the dog hallway. I remember the dog hallway. Three, two, there we go. Bye bye. Bye. See you later, lads. I might have that. I might just get like an app so I can play that in my headphones whenever I'm doing something like really important. Watch out. Watch out. Sorry. Oh, it's the Jill sandwich time. It's locked. A carving of armor. Right. I don't think we want staying here too long. I'm pretty sure this might be the room I'm talking about. This is the Panini press room. Oh no, it's not. No, it's not. This is the this is the shower room. Clearly, pretty certain there's something horrible here. Let me just get my gun out with my two bullets. Oh no, we're fine. <laughs> it's just a toilet. Don't worry about it. Nothing useful. Well, I find toilets quite useful. I'm not gonna lie. So nothing then, nothing at all. Let's just—is there a map? I've I've, yeah, I've been stupid. Oh good, I'm so yeah. First of all, please thank you. Here we go. Okay, sweet. So I kind of wish it did the whole. That's just me being pedantic now. Oh, I wish it did the whole thing where it showed you if you still had stuff to discover or solve in that room by colouring the rooms a different colour. It's locked. A carving of armour. Yep, got that, thanks. I remember that. Ah, this is the room. Lovely. This is the Benini press. <laughs> I'm pretty sure we activate this by a tapestry. Nothing unusual. Um, by taking a shotgun off a wall? A shotgun off a wall. Nothing unusual. Now, I can't remember if this is too early to do this or not. I mean, I'm taking the shotgun. Now, should I... Should I... Yeah, I think I'll be fine. I mean, I've not saved at all, so this could be an absolute run killer. It's... I'm going to put it back right now. I'm going to cow it out. No, I think Barry saves me. I'm pretty sure Barry saves me. Because that's where the whole Jill sandwich thing comes from. It's locked. It's locked. It's locked. It's locked. Wait, is this one also locked? No, it's not. I don't think I'm supposed to do this yet. Oh, that, has that just reset or is that just sealed me in and completely? Uh, oh, I can't, I can't do anything with it. Okay. Oops. Well, that's me fucked. Oh, there we go. Will you put down the shotgun? Yeah, go for it. I don't need the shotgun right now. I'm badass enough. So I think I have to put something down there and it still lowers. But then both doors are locked and then Barry saves me. I think. I could be wrong, but I think there is actually a way of dying to that, that drop.
Uh, no. Shit. Double shit. You unlocked it. Good, go through it. No, thank you. Oh, there's a save room here. <gasps> there was a, there was a herb. There was an herb. Am I actually saving now? I might do a save to save. This is the most depressing save room I've ever seen in my life. That's what I thought I needed. I didn't realize it was on this floor. I thought it was on the second floor. It's not. It's on the first floor. Technically on the first floor, although you can get it on the second floor. You get to it from the second floor, I believe. Unless this is just me being mental. I, I, I honestly don't know anymore. Checking memory cards. This is where it's like, memory card does not work. Let's stuff some stuff. Let's stow some stuff. Like the gem and the ink ribbon. Can I? I can't stack the ink ribbons where they are. And the chemical and the shells. I'm probably gonna keep the key on me because I'll just keep the key on me. But at least with type it like you mean it. Type it like you definitely mean it. Type it like it owes you money. Now, can I get this herb before this thing tries to eat me? Yeah, I can. Will you take the green herb? Yes. Uh, can I sneak past this zombie? Whoa. Go! Go! Go, Jill. You're my only hope. God damn. Oh, it's here. Oh, piss me. Fucking hell absolutely stamping like she owns the place. Okay. Nope. I've forgotten how doors work. It's because she's so angry that the chemical we wanted was right there. Now. Remember, 25th of September. Do, 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 do. Ah, good. Do, 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 Oh wait, I still have a room I haven't explored. Correction, I have a room I cannot explore. This shield key is absolute rubbish. Absolutely crap, this shield key. Certain I've missed something in here. Maybe it's gets so dark. Can I turn the? I don't know if I can affect the brightness actually. I don't know if I should affect the brightness. How did I get the the options menu up? Does that have brightness on it? Config? No. Sound? No. Exit. Okay, sweet. Don't. I was gonna say, Jesus, don't like exit the game. Oh, my camera's a bit wonky, isn't it? Oh, sorry, Jill. Am I making you wait? Nothing unusual. Probably oh, corpse. Feels like a picture of the mansion. Okay. Is that an herb? Nope. No, it's not. Isn't that nicer? How does my menu look? A little blown out, but you know what? I'm okay with that. I am all 
alright with that. Did I just never go through this door? Oh no, definitely went through this door. That's, that's where the other Wingus and Dingus are. Every time I see, I look over at Darcy Sue's comment and it says Chill Jill, I just think it says Chili Jam. It's, it's literally all I think. I'm just like, oh, I could just go for some Chili Jam. Right, what's wrong with this one? It's locked from inside. We'll unlock it, you have a lock pick. Map. Map me, baby. Um. Right, so I can't get there. Wait, what's that big yellow splodge? Through here. What this? What this now I can see. Hopefully I can see anyway. It's something here. Why is it? You just want to finish the game. Ah, oh, thanks. I appreciate that. Oh, was there anything here I missed? Because I couldn't see a fucking thing. No, no, that's it. I think I might have, I might have used this room. I've spent this room. I'm all yours. I always loved and hated the door animations in this game, just because they were so arbitrarily slow. But obviously, I realise now they were a good, they were a good vehicle for loading screens. Um, but I just, I used to get excited when the doors were different. Like that double door is different, so I, I would be like. Ooh, there's, there's something different there. Right, let's go back to... Let's see if we can find that greenhouse and use that chemical so we can get past it. I think that's what you do with that. This is the most scary point-and-click adventure game ever, the Resident Evil series. You just go somewhere, but collect every object, and then just go somewhere else and use every object until you finish the game. It's the way I see it, anyway. Horror point and clicks. This is still a really dark hallway. What the fuck is going on? It's, just, it's always going to be a dark hallway. It's always, always going to be a dark hallway. It's never not going to be a dark hallway. I'm just going to have to live with this being the darkest of hallways. This is the dark souls of Resident Evil hallways. Going to get shit for that. Uh, I don't know if this is where I want to go. I can't quite remember where I'm going now. Let's consult the map. Second floor. Let's go. Which, where am, where am I standing? I'm standing there. Okay, let's go over here then. I like that I gunned them down earlier and they've actually gone gone. Like, but there's there was no reason for them to have gone gone. <laughs> like, I'm pretty sure they're still alive. Uh, right, so this was just a pointless room. Picture of a helmet, lovely. Yes, until I have a lighter, this is a pointless room. Got it. Understood. I just want to remember where the greenhouse is. Seems probably on the ground. Mm. I mean, it could be there. No, that's that's Crowface Death thing, isn't it? That's Croman. Uh, is it downstairs? How do I get out of this? That's how I get out of this. It. not see where I have not been. <laughs> I 
have been everywhere. Well, we know what we need to do, right? We just need to backtrack everywhere. Excellent. Cool. Cool. Just what we like. Just what we like doing in games. Pointless backtracking. It's locked. A carving of armor. Go fuck yourself, armor key. <laughs> but just about enough of your shit. Yep. That way. God, yeah, chili jam. Oh. Chili jam, some strong cheese, and some crackers. I mean, some, like, actual. Is there a door here that I didn't. I can't see? No. Some, like, um, Jacob's Green crackers. Because I'm not a peasant. I'm not going to have, like, Aldi crackers or something like that. You're going to have you're gonna have crackers. Splash out with the ones. You can get cheap cheese, don't get me wrong. And cheap chili jam, but. Don't never never buy budget crackers. Uh, right, ground floor. Yep. Bump, bump, bump. That way. Thank you all. Oh, was it through the dog corridor? The dogger door. It might have been through the dogger door. Oh, quick question: Is anybody planning anything for Halloween? Don't know if anybody's officially planning in for Halloween. I'm going to do a special stream at some point um, for Halloween. I'm not sure what it is yet. I'm figuring it out, but it's going to be a special stream. Either one or multiple streams. Um, I'm not sure what yet, though. If there's a big horror game you, you know of that you want me to go through, I'm happy to take suggestions. Visage has already been suggested. I know that's a big horror game. Uh, hi. Ow. Bye. Duck, dodge, dip, dog, and dive. Duck, dodge, dip, dog, and dive. There we go. Um, yeah, because I'm kind of, I'm happy, I'm happy picking up the Resident Evil games for a bit. Um, and I'm uh, more than happy going through the, uh, wait, where am I? <laughs> what am I doing? Going through the uh, indie horror games that we've started finding. So if I go through here, that will take me there, but if I go back in there that's the gun room so what about in here wait wait in here what's in here no this is the toilet i found myself in the toilet there was a ceiling fan in the toilet how rich are the owners of this mansion this is this belongs to scrooge mcduck Right, that's the that's the very danger room. So we don't want to go in that. Yeah, anyway. I don't think anyway. Oh yeah, I dove in here, didn't I? Because that thing bit me. There might be something along that corridor. I have not checked. Just hold on. Hold on, zombie. I'm just gonna check my map a second. Uh, yeah, there's, so there's three more doors along that corridor that I've not checked. Okay, sweet. Have we got any bullets? No. Cool. Have we got any health? No. Cool. Let's use that. What could possibly go wrong? What could possibly go wrong? Oh, good. This one opens. <laughs> this one opens to a much more deadly problem. Oh, it's the bird hallway. Oh, I remember this. Hello. If I get this wrong, you kill me, don't you? Is there not a plaque somewhere that tells me what to do? A picture of a young man. There's a switch below. Will you push it? No, because if I get it wrong, birds will eat my face. What's this? There's a message. Give me the peace of death, and I'll give you the joy of life. There's a switch below. Will you push it? No, because I haven't found the riddle. So I, don't, I can't remember. I actually can't remember the sequence. I'm pretty sure it's Cradle's Grave, but I don't know. Picture of an infant. There's a switch below. Will you push it? No. So a young man, infant. Picture of a lively boy. There's a switch below. Will you push it? No. 
And there's a picture of a bold-looking bold old man. Will you push, can you push it? No. And then this is... There's a message. Give me the peace of death, and I'll give you the joy of life. There's a switch below. Will you push it? No. Right. We can, we can try this. So let's go for... So what's this one? Is this young boy? A young man? There's a switch below. We really know. I'm pretty sure it's Cradle's Grave. So, of an infant. Switch below, you press it. Yes. And then of a lively boy. A lively boy. Yep. And then of a young man. And then of a bold looking old man. Yep. And now this one. There's a message. Give me the peace of death, and I'll give you the joy of life. There's a switch below. Will you press it? Yes. We fucked it. We got it wrong. We gotta go. We gotta go. Ow. It's not a good noise. <laughs> Well, that, that, oh God, get off. You absolute fiend. Ooh, a door, a special door. Oh, it's in the door to outside, that's worse. That's arguably worse because there's gonna be dogs here and I'm gonna get eaten because I'm, I'm on danger again, aren't I? Yeah. This is how it ends. Eaten to death by dogs. It's locked. Excellent. Fortunately, their vision is based on straight lines. <laughs> no, get off me! You bastard. I was just trying to sell you Girl Scout cookies. I mean, in fairness, that's what I do to door-to-door -door salespeople as well, so. Rip. Death count one. Right, we gotta find the plant room. So, oh god, I'm not sure what happened there. Oh, don't give me a chance to reload or anything. No, don't do that. Press any button. Press the any button. Load. Resident Evil. Resident Evil. Right. Store room. Yes. Go. There. Error, I can't find the any button. Good luck, thanks. Cheers, game. That's not obnoxious at all. Enter the world of horror. Oh, that's a game I've not played for a while, isn't it? World of horror. We should play that again soon. We should play it for uh, spooky season at some point. Got to go back in here. I'm going to keep the chemical on me because we're going to try and find the chemical now, the chemical room. If I, I, although I can't remember what it is. Uh, so let's get rid of this. Let's get rid of this. Let's not get rid of that. Let's get rid of this. And that's fine. Keep my knife on me. Eat that. Nom nom nom. Go away, you bastard. 
So much of that herb. So much for that herb. Uh, nope. See ya. That's, I remember that corridor. That, that's the corridor I died in. I don't want that corridor at all. We've just saved it, so let's check this a second. I say we saved it. We've just loaded a save because we died. Let's check this a second. Dun, dun. I don't I don't think this works until we have like the fake shotgun. We'll find out in a second though. For science. Yeah, I think because I have control over her, I'm not supposed to do this yet, but we'll find out exactly. Uh, Barry? 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 Barry, are you there? Barry, can you hear me? Barry, are you there? <gasps> That's an unusual noise, getting squashed to death. And therefore, that room will always be known as the Panini Press Room. Anyway, that one didn't count. That's not that's not official death. That one didn't count at all. Checking memory card. What bam? Press the any key. What bam? So now we know what not to do. Do not, under any circumstances, take the shotgun without something to put there. Now you know. Now you know. Okay, let's try and find or re-find this um, plant room, shall we? And also maybe some ammunition while we're at it. Because we're very, very low on ammo. Like, dangerously so. As in, in, in terms of ammo, we have no ammo. Like, she owns the place. Uh, right, let's go through here. Where's the map? Where is the map? The map is here. I can't go through there. I can go through there. And I can go through there. I can't go through there. But I think that is... Wait, where am I now in relation to all of this? Wait, so that's the room I just came in. So the one above me is what I just came through. The one below me. So if I go around... Maybe it's the other side? I don't think it's the other side. I don't think it's on this floor. I really don't think it's on this floor at all. I think it's on this floor. I think it... That's the danger room. That's that room. That's the safe room. It's not in that. Oh! Oh! It's around there, isn't it? It's the other side of that. Oh, I get it now. I know where I'm 
going. No, I think I know where I'm going. Chat, how could you be so stupid? Uh, not let me go the wrong way. Uh, let's go round, roundy round. Let's go round us. How could this happen? I can't believe you have all done this. I simply cannot believe. Now, I'm about halfway through, so I am gonna just do something very dumb and change category. This is me doing shenanigans now. Don't panic. This is me trying to find um, more viewers. <laughs> more viewers, more money, more money, less worky. Less worky, more streamy, more streamy, more viewers. That's how it works. That's the, that's the, the math in my head. Meow. I'm going this way because I mean I'll be honest you've all failed me so I just need to take matters into my own hands now I'm sat here with a room full of retro gamers and not one of you has been able to solve this for me and it's not even hard <laughs> can you imagine if I was like that with people Jesus Christ I do like questionable results comment earlier of wholesome horror. I, I really like that. I don't know why I've never thought of that as a comment. Uh, right, so just going all the way around. Just go all the way around. Just go all the way around. Please don't eat me. I'm going to have to have this on now. Uh, could you... Can I just nip past you? Nope, apparently I can't. Get off me. Absolute savage. Uh, no! No, don't do that. No. Oh, you stupid. Fucking tank controls. I'm pretty certain it's in here. Pretty certain this is where I want to be. Yes. This is exactly where we want to be. Have we bought the chemical with us? Who knows? An old pump. Water seems to be sent from here. The lid is open. Poison it. It's the blood of the ancients. No, Seymour, no. Good. Well, that's that dead. Uh, was there not like tons of herbs in here? There's a red herb. I'm not sure if that's now a red herb or it was always a red herb. I miss items shiny. Shiny items. That's what I miss right now. I miss uh, items showing you that they're there. <laughs> these these are also herbs. No, not me. We found the resource room. <laughs> the room we should have come to first. Got it. Right, let me just do another quick scan. Oh my god, there's so many herbs in here. Now, the red ones help boost thingies, don't they? So, if we combine that and that, will you mix the herbs? Sure, why not? And then take that. Now I'm fine. Cool. Now, if I combine that and that, will you mix the herbs? Yes. Oh my god. More herbs. I think the yellow ones do poison. Not do poison, like they cure poison. And I do poison to you. Cool, let's take this. Yoink. It's the mansion key. But it's not just the mansion key, is it? It's not just the mansion key at all. It is the. Check. Spin it right around, baby. Fucking armor key. Fantastic. Right. Let's go plunder some rooms. Gotta go, bye. 
Now we've got to find all the rooms that have the armor key or need the armor key. And then we can just start pillaging. Uh, however, I still don't have any ammunition. So I'm going to have to dodge you. What's this? Ah, oh, this isn't locked. I want locked doors, not open doors. Give me problems, not solutions. Uh, map, please. Map me. Uh, oh, that one might be locked. What's, what's this one? You have used the armor key. Armor key. That's a designer of keys, don't you know? It's an armor key key. Ooh. Exciting. Stuff. Is this a fake shotgun? No, but it is bullets. We'll take that. That's going straight in the gun. Stars locking doors. Uh, com com combine? Is this a... This is a fake shotgun. That's what that is. Right, it's broken shotgun, but... Look at this sad little... Sad snout. Good. Nothing left in there. Lovely. Law? The desk is locked. Will you use the lockpick? Yeah. You have used the lockpick. The desk has shotgun shells in it. You have no carrying capacity for shotgun shells. Mix the herbs. Mix the herbs. Mix the herbs. Write text faster. <laughs> Write text faster. Give me the gun. Give me the gun food. I've got blood food now. Give me the gun food. Thank you. Now I need to nip by a thingy. Oh, I still can't believe there's no quick turn. Fuck it hell. I need to nip by a storeroom so we can drop some of this stuff off, like the shells and the maybe the shield key. Not the sh yeah, the shield key. I don't think I need that right now. Um, I'm just gonna you just wait there, bobbins, because um, I need to know where on earth I'm going. Is that that's a save room? I'm right near one. Right, come right over here, mate, and then get looped. See you later, fool. Oh. Oh. I nearly overshot the door then. Oh dear. Almost overshot the door. Save room music. Ominously safe save room music. Uh, right, so... Well, then, uh... I don't think I need the shield key right now. I do need the armor key. Uh, I'm going to put one of those in there. And, uh... Fuck it, I'm going to put my knife in there as well. Because I'm hardcore, baby. Hardcore. That's how I roll. That's how I roll. Knifeless and lifeless. <laughs> uh, anyway. Alright, moving on. What were we doing? There was some... St oh, no, there's loads of locked doors up here. And they're going to have delicious... Plunder in them, aren't they? I need to turn this fucking contrast. There you go. How about gamma? Ooh, gamma's a bit better. Yeah. Right. Hey, is that blown out my menu? Nah, that's alright. That's why now we can fucking see. Right. Uh, it's locked. The carving of a helmet. You're a carving. Oh, of course, it's the numerical number. I bet I do know the number. I bet I remember it. Just give me the keys. Give me the buttons. I'll figure it out. Muscle memory is a real thing. Is this zombie still alive? Weird. Could have sworn that zombie was still there. Right where I left him. Does this lead back to the main hall? It does. Oh, God. Oh, great. Okay, back to these two fools. Oh, no, I think there's only one now, isn't there? And you are one zombie I do not need to kill. So, I'll catch you next Tuesday, friend. <laughs> catch you next Tuesday. Do you know what I might do? I might do multiple days over Halloween. I might do like a couple of days or a few days. Ah, where's the danger room? Where's the panini press? Uh, I've pressed the wrong button. Now I can't even find that room. 
That's on the first floor. Yes. Yes, that's on the first floor. Back. Go. It's there. Uh, do I need to go through the dog... dog -a door Oh, no, I can go up there. I can just go down that bit. Lovely. Lovely. Right, don't go down there. It's Robo Jill. Dun, 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 dun. No, everyone watching at home, I don't know why I get this one either, but just it's one of the many changes. This corridor is still pitch black. Jesus. Right, I'm not doing any of these right now. I'm going to get the shotgun and do the Jill sandwich section. Uh, go, go, go. I think it's her. Hair. I don't know. Oh, I might be wrong. No, I'm not wrong. I'm not wrong. I'm mostly correct. The best kind of correct. Correct enough. Oh, excuse me. Uh, now I'm lost. Oh no, now I'm going downstairs, Anna. Now I'm going downstairs, and then I'm right near the, the danger squishy room. Yum. She walks downstairs like she's afraid she's going to fall downstairs. I never know. Does she take the stairs down two at a time? Right. Everyone watching right now, what is your favourite... Um, no, that zombie's going to kill me. What is your favourite Resident Evil and why? If you had to pick one, if you had to just, you, ha you were only ever allowed to play one Resident Evil again, what would it be? And why is it? <laughs> I was going to say, why is it Resident Evil 7? <laughs> There's so many people who've never played a Resident Evil game. What the fuck? Hasn't played it. I've never played one. Kids today. Jesus Christ. What are you like? Didn't realize I'd, I'd, I was fostering a community of babies <laughs> who've never played a Resident Evil game. Although, in fairness, I would say don't play Resident Evil. Just watch me play Resident Evil games. That's, that's way better. Get the fuck off me. You, there was no way you had the dexterity to turn that quickly, you prick. I mean, I had the gun, the gun bullets to kill him, but I'm saving those for bigger and bigger, bigger prey. Uh, no, thank you. Oh wait, is it not? Am I not near where I need to be? Oh no, it's 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 through here. It's there. Code Veronica is the only one that I've played. Code Veronica is. Wait, is that the one with that really annoying character in it? No, I don't want to Code Veronica is not a bad shout. Code Veronica. I never played Code Veronica X. Is that the same one? Or is that a different one? I can't remember. There we go. Okay, now. Took us long enough. Jeez. Code Veronica is not a, not a bad shout. Um, I think for nostalgia reasons, Resident Evil 2? 3? 3. Nemesis. 3. Nemesis is probably my favourite. Um, because that made me think about gaming differently. It was one of those games that made me think about gaming differently. Because there's a point where you're in, I think it's, is it this mansion or the police station from two? I can't quite remember. And the nemesis, uh, sorry, the nemesis starts following you through doorways, which had never happened before in a game. Uh, will you put down the shotgun? No. N no. Will you put down the shotgun? No. I will put down the broken shotgun. There we go. So yeah, that kind of... Oh, the, the barrel's perked up a bit, isn't it? God, I can't... I can't believe we used to live with tank controls. <laughs> oh, good. That's now going to work. Oh, no. Now what's going to happen? Oh, it just, just doesn't happen. Oh, okay. Wait, when does the when does the Jill sandwich thing happen then? 
Like I don't I don't remember when that happens. I'm clearly making that up. Maybe it doesn't exist. Who knows? Uh right, armor key. Uh let's go. I think that's an armor key room. Let's go down here. Is it this one? You have used the armor key. Lovely. Oh, good. We're back outside. Oh, good. There's a dog. Oh, but I do have a shotgun now, so, you know. Fuck you, puppy. No, you don't. No, you don't. No, you don't. Oh, my God. Fucking die already. I'm not wasting more on me already. You're absolutely not. Three shotgun rounds. Are you having a joke? Tank controls, tank controls, tank controls. There. Wasn't wasting a shotgun round on that. Mm, more herbs, though. I'm just going to move this dead zombie dog out of the way so I can get these edible greens. <laughs> um, num, num, num. Just gonna, you know, just lift the dog corpse off it. It's fine. Brush it off. Brush it on your, on your star's pants. You'll be fine. Awful lot of healing items here. Oh, God, there's more. Thanks. Pocket full of green. Uh, let's go. Let's do some com combinatorial alchemy. Uh, come by. Come by. Go back. Is there more in this corner? No, good. But there's two there. What's here? I can't remember. A oh, rusty boiler. Nothing strange. This is literally just to get healing items, wasn't it? Yeah, this was this is healing corner. Okay, sweet. I'm fine with that. If someone were to turn around and say, Do you want to trade three shotgun shells and a bullet for like three full heals? Nearly full heals. I'd be like, yeah, of course I do. Will you mix the herbs? Indeed, I will. Well, thank you. All right, let's, let's go. Let's avoid you. Yeah, bye. <laughs> I have to leave now. I have things to do as I very slowly open the door. Uh, right, where else do we need to go? So we've done that bit. Let's, we'll go back into this danger room. We've got bullets now, which is fine. So we'll go back into the danger, danger room. Um, oh, we've got those rooms as well. I'll just have the main hall. So we'll do those two. But we'll go up here first. Oh, I'm not running for some reason. Because now we have bullets. And that means we're more reckless. <laughs> Hello. Uh, 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 I never knew the, the method of getting um, headshots in Resident Evil games. I never understood it. Uh, uh, get off. Where did you come from, you absolute rotter? Get it? Because he's rotting. Uh, All right. I've had enough of this. I've had quite enough of this, Tom Fulwoy. I think if I aim up, I'll blow his head off. Yes! Classic. Good. Now we're... Now we've wasted all that ammunition. Is this the thing? It's locked. A carving of a helmet. Fuck! What was around the other way? Oh, that was a long corridor to another room. Oh, no. Is that not... That's an out outdoor room, isn't it? I don't know what goes. I don't know what goes there. Um, nope, that's the wrong button. Let's go here, and then here, and then if we go, so that's. Oh, what's this room? Oh, this room's not. Wait, this room's unlocked. Why haven't we been in this room before? I'm sure we've been in this room before. Oh, we have. Bat out. Bat out. Get, get out. <laughs> 
That was the bird room. There is there is a clue to that somewhere. I just don't know what it is. I think it's written down in someone's diary, like the itch taste thing. But I don't I don't remember. I thought it was cradle to grave. I swear to God it was. I felt like I was going to look like such a badass then. Uh, right, back to the main hall. But I don't want to go through doggy daycare. So I need to go back, actually. But then I'm going to nip past Zombie Boy. But Zombie Boy's near a save room. Which means we could get rid of Zombie Boy. Zombie Boy. Uh, oh no, wrong way. Um, because he is cluttering up the save room hallway. But doggy daycare, we don't need to go through doggy daycare anymore. Hiya. Dope for now. Uh, right, what do I have in my inventory? Lots of Healy Bobs. Let's get rid of some Healy Bobs. Because we do not need these many Healy Bobs, let's be honest. We definitely do not need these many Healy Bobs. Not on us, anyway. We do need them, don't get me wrong. We definitely don't need them. We don't need them on us. So we'll put this. Oh, I hate this management system. Uh, put those there. Good. Good, good. Good, good, good. Also, nearly out of bullets again. We are skirting danger, people. Although we do have shotgun shells in uh, the box. So these two shotgun shells. We're going to play defense now. And these two shotgun shells are just for emergencies. Oh, we get the bazooka as well. I mean, obviously, we've got the bazooka. I mean, can't forget about that. Uh, now, if I remember correctly, it is to my right, towards me. This corridor, fun anecdote for you. This corridor is the game, is the corridor that put me off Resident Evil games um, for ages. It's terrified me for ages when I was younger because I killed a zombie here where I'm stood right here. And then I went this way. And when the camera changed, it stood up, but its face was right in the camera. And it made me scream so loud. It was such a jump scare. Um, yeah, it really, it really put me off Resident Evil games for ages. I just did not. I think it's one of, I think it's the only time I have thrown a controller. And it's the only time in my life I've ever actually physically thrown a controller. And it did, obviously, they were attached by wires, so it took the PlayStation like partially with it when I did that. Um, yeah, it's the only time I've ever done it. It's the only time I've something scared me that much. Amwaki. Amwaki. Amwaki here. Uh, I don't know either. Oh, good. Oh, I need to do this. I vaguely remember this. No, wait. Hang on a minute. There's another vent. This is what's known as a D&D &D poison trap room. If you don't ask the right questions, you don't know something's going to kill you. There are two statues in the, in the room. Something can be seen in the showcase. Okay, cool. Uh, oh, wait, no. Do I not need some? Do I not need something to open this with? There's a switch. Will you push it? Yes. Good dunk. Yay! Armor. And not a one person was gassed. It's the sun crest. Oh, that's for outside. I remember now. Give me a minute.
Yep. So let's close my window. It's raining. And I also had to grab an orange juice out of the fridge. Okay, so... Yes, there's another door just down there. Good. Uh, which I think is this way? Yes, it is this way. Good. Oh, I wonder if it's going to do it. It's not going to do the thing that most modern games do, where it's like, you've used this key to completion. Now you can throw it away. Throw it away? Question mark. Oh, this doesn't look very safe, does it? This has got pointy angles in it. I'm going to stand on this side. Oh, hello. Richard, what <gasps> happened? Richard. Dick. Oh, Jill. This house is dangerous. There are Don't terrible say. demons. Ouch. You're wounded. Voice acting on point. What kind of demon attacked you? It was a huge snake. And also poisonous. <sighs> poisonous? Oh, no. Richard. Hold on. There is serum. How do you oh, no. know? I should have brought some with me. No problem. I'll go and get it. Thanks. He's very calm for someone who's literally missing. Like he's got a massive chomp in his in his side. Like half of his body has tooth impressions in it. Uh, so you just tell me where to go now. Okay, sweet. So we're going there. Okay. Okay, I, I get it. I have to cancel that. Cool. Can I go back in there? Yes, I can. Oh, wait. If I go back in here, is he not dead? Hey, I go out for Happy's Booktober. We're going to be playing um, Resident Evil games in order on original hardware for Spooky Season. Um, but I'm now thinking, in my normal fashion of thinking out loud on stream and then having to uh, um, do the things. Oh, I've got to go guess. Oh, okay, cool. Uh, and then do the things that I say I'm going to do. I'm thinking of doing some longer streams at Halloween. Uh, but I'm not sure how it works, because we've got a hockey game on Halloween night. Um, so I'm not sure how it's going to work. But once again, once I become a big famous YouTuber slash Twitch streamer, um, I won't need to worry about that, because I'll be able to do this all, all the time. Uh, let's combine this. Yes. This needs checking, I think. Nope, no it doesn't. Carving the stuff. Fantastic. Outstanding. Cool. Right, what's the best way of getting wherever I was supposed to go now? First floor, wasn't it? That room? And where am I right now? So I need to go back to the room. Basically back the way I came. Uh, oh, hang on. Does that avoid doggy daycare? I think that avoids doggy daycare. No, it doesn't. I will go the other way. It's easy to go the other way. It's much easier to go the other way, actually. Why was I thinking of anything different? Go here. Is this a bit with Barry? There's a bit where Barry gives some ammo at some point. I can't remember what it is. Well, so far, I'm cursing myself now. So far, I think the stream has held up quite well with the retro game. I mean, it is a proper shantytown setup that I've got going on with it. I've got the PlayStation 1 linked up to a retro tank. I've got the retro tank plugged into the Elgato. I've got mm, Gato. Um, I'm trying to run it in 640 by 480, I think, and then upscaling it. I say upscaling it. I'm not doing a lot of upscaling, but there's a little bit of upscaling. Uh, 
I'm just basically stretching the image out. Yes, I'm going to write. Good. But, up those scales. Ooh, up those scales. Uh, but, I mean, I think we sorted the um, uh, audio problems out quite quickly, which was nice. Uh, how many bullets have I got? Not as many as I would like. You are really in the way, though. So, let's see if we can do a headshot. Come here. I'm this way. I'm... Nice. There we go. Lovely stuff. Uh, have I been through that door? I have been through that. I haven't been through that door, though. Because this door had that full poster outside of it. Oh, this is the yeah. Okay, cool. This is where I put the gemstone. I forgot. Yeah, like the architect for this place was specifically told to put just really weird, elaborate puzzles in. But then, if the law, if, if the uh, fan fiction essentially what I read is based anywhere in truth, the architect started losing their mind halfway through making it like making the plans so they were like they got really paranoid is it this way i don't think it is this way i think i've just gone the wrong way i have not gone the wrong way lovely yeah they started to like lose their mind halfway through whoa no thank you and just started like setting up elaborate traps and different um locking mechanisms and hiding plates and pallets and things like that in different corners is this where i'm gonna find the serum is this yes serum will you take the serum why sure why not now i know i don't need the thingies yet the crest keys and i'm gonna put that away Ooh, should we save? I think we should probably save. It's an old typewriter. If I had an ink... Oh, fuck! Not one word. I can save my progress with this. Would you like to use the ink ribbon? Yes! Yes, I would. Right. Jill, why do you sometimes look like uh, Lara Croft and other times you look like you're made uh, you belong in Roblox? There's a 50-50 chance. Like, when the camera actually zooms in on her, she either looks like she's made out of Duplo, or she looks like an actual video game character. Uh, oh, fuck. Where am I going now? Am I going back to where I was? I am going back to where I was, wasn't I? Which was... Oh, shit. Where was it? Oh, it was there. It was the, the angling room. Got it. Yeah, I get it. Now i got to avoid this chucklehead. Fuck off. Uh, this way. Bye. Can anyone actually hear the PlayStation in the background? Or is this microphone too good for them? I think it's that way, I don't know. No, it's not that way. Wait, do I not have the Oh no, it's that's locked from the inside, isn't it? Oh I'm oh I'm just going back to the main hallway now. That's what I'm doing. I forgot. Yeah, my guess is that the PlayStation disc drive noise 
isn't sending people insane. He's not sending me insane, but I'm wearing big old headphones. And I'm so excited to play more retro games. Retro horror games as well, I think is, is, is really, uh, uh, I'm going the wrong way. This is what happens when I talk and don't think. <laughs> yeah, retro horror games as well. Like I've got Clock Tower 3, I've got, <laughs> that's, that's fucking it. <laughs> I don't think there were many good horror games back in the day. Um, thriller games are probably better one. I think In Cold Blood is a bit of a thriller game. I think like Fear Effects and stuff like that, probably a bit of an action thriller game, but other than that. I don't know. Unless I'm wrong. Unless people know. Otherwise, I mean, I've not Googled it. I've not looked at, like, spooky retro horror games. Uh, oh, I forgot where I'm going. Again. Again, I forgot where I'm going. I'm going right in here. I am outside the door I need to be. It's this way. That was a test. You all failed. Your cartography skills are lacking. What do I even pay you for? All right, Dick. I've got you. I've got your serum. Here's the serum. Richard, hold on. I'll give you a shot now. Dick serum. Jill, here's my radio. You should keep it. I'm... Bleeding heavily. No! Hand off your Richard! Jill, be careful. Uh, uh. Is System Shock one a horror game? I thought it wasn't. I thought it was like a, just like an action adventure game. I didn't realize it was a horror horror game, like a horror game. Unlike a horror 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 game, which is a different to a horror horror game, which is also significantly different to a horror game. But you all know this anyway. I mean, I'm preaching to the choir, right? Uh, oh, radio, cool, let's, com radio. The battery is still charged, lovely. Can't, can't do anything with it. <laughs> Map. I'm at a T junction. You find yourself at a T junction. There is a bloodstained handprint on the wall. Oh my god! You absolute burk. Get the fuck up. My fucking villain origin story right here. <laughs> Resident Evil. I love virtual gaming apart from when they pull shit like that. Jesus Christ. I didn't make any mistakes. There I made zero mistakes there. There was no not one mistake was my fault. This is this is the problem with retro games. They just they take fucking pot shots at you like that and they just expect you to take the blame for it. It's not your fault. It's absolutely not your fault. What were we even doing? Right, we're gonna go gonna do a, <laughs> a dick shot. <laughs> fucking unbelievable this game. You can do one. You can deck off. Just in this in this arcade themed idea of oh, we need to make it harder, so we'll just uh, we'll have a gribbly just jump out of here in this game that's you know heavy resource management, heavy fucking health management, all this bollocks. We'll just we'll not only have it just fucking spaff acid on you, but we'll have it just reach out and bite you as well. Why not? Why don't we just do that? Fucking bellens. Absolute bellens. Capcom, I swear to God, you've not got any any better. Wee! Uh, hey, 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 I want to go home. Anyway. Yeah, 
getting comfy like a proper gamer. Got my gamer pants on. Read that as I'm not wearing pants. Right, let's just uh, ban, ban Greeny Green forever. You're, I'm also going to deny you access when I play Pokemon on Thursday, so go fuck yourself. <laughs> uh, fuck, I forgot where I'm going again. Why Why is my, my memory for location so shite at the minute with games? I'm normally really good. <laughs> Don't understand it at all. Having real problems remembering locations. I mean, I mostly blame you, to be honest with you. I think it is your fault. You are you are a constant distraction. It's only going to get worse. The bigger I get, the more people are going to be talking to me, the less I'm going to be focused on the game. I'm just going to be floundering around, and I'm just going to not... I'm not going to know what I'm doing. I know I'm just going to be a, a side Here's act. Here's the serum. That's what I'm going to be. Shut up, Richard, Jill. hold on. I'll give you a shot now. Cheers, Jill, thanks. Here's my radio. You thanks. should keep it. I'm very, no! very, very, very bad. Jill, Any consolation, Jill. Uh, uh, very unlikely you were gonna save him. Very unlikely. Right. Shall we try this again? Fucking eat that. Equip that. Come here. I'm ready for you now. This fucking game. I swear to God, this fucking game. You find yourself at a crossroads. Right. Come here. Suck a dick. Get good with that, eh? Get good with that. I better not die now. What the fuck is this room? Who built this room? What is out there? I don't remember this. I have I have no memory of this place. Uh, ooh, a clip! Yay, good food. This is normally where something jumps out at me, so I have to use all of the ammunition I've just picked up. There's something on the table. There's there's something on the table. The table's not that big, Jill. Just so you know. Is it an ink ribbon? I will not take the ink ribbon. No. no I'm not wasting the inventory slot. Is this slidable? It is slidable. Am I going to regret sliding it? Reload the gun. <laughs> Reload the gun. Oh no, it's just a cabinet. Sometimes a cabinet is just a cabinet. It's too dark to see anything. You are telling me. So I'm sorry. What? What do you, do you expect me to do about that? Take the a candle. Not one candle. <laughs> I was slid for a reason. <laughs> yeah. It was keeping something in, not keeping something out. Wait, that was, was that not the only... Oh, no, there was the door with the bloody... Well, the, that bit. The bit with the bloody handprint on. Is there going to be something at the top of the stairs? No. It's locked. A carving of a shield. Fuck. Back to the save room. Well, if we're going back to the save room, we may as well take the ink ribbon as well. Oh, God. I overshot the door. Get in the door! I love retro games. This is great. They're not frustrating in the slightest. I'm glad I'm playing this online. I, I think I would have stopped if I were playing this on my own. Not because it's bad. I think just because I would have, I would have thought to myself, like... Everything's just a bit worse than I remember. I'm still having fun, don't get me wrong, but everything's just slightly worse than I remember. Like, the tank controls are really tanky. Like, I didn't realise that. And I'm just not good. As as Greeny Green said, I need to get good, so... 
which is unusual considering I'm such a pro gamer. And um, I mean, sorry, I've got to take this MLG. Oh, MLG's on the phone again. Sorry, I just gotta. <laughs> it's yeah, it's unusual considering I'm such a pro. I'm such a pro. I could take a phone call without taking my headset off. Did you like that? Uh, right. I need to remember what I say, rumors, instead of just being fucking egotistical. Um, how do you save room? Where where do you save room? It's down those stairs. It's down those stairs. It's round this corner. Going up the stairs, going down the stairs, going up the upside down stairs. I think it's. <laughs> Don't worry, it's just a bit of this. Just a bit of the old TB. Nothing to worry about. Absolutely nothing to worry about. Wait, are those. Fucking old you. Uh, second one? Any of those locked? That one's locked. I wonder if those two are thingy doors. Armor doors. Armadas, even, one could say. <laughs> ah, good. Now Zomboy isn't uh, fucking cluttering up the hallways. Now we've not got shambling corpses cluttering up our hallways. That'll be a good thing, won't it? <sighs> oh, my camera's... I, I have moved, so my camera must move. I don't have tracking on it. I mean, it has tracking. I just don't like it. Um, shit. Right, go back here. If you can save your progress with this, will you use the ink ribbon? Why, yes. Yes, I will. Stay a while and listen to me hammer these keys. Give myself a headache doing that. <laughs> bum, bum, bum. Right. Dump that. Don't care about that. Don't care about that. I do care now about the shield game. How's my health? I'm fine. I'm fine. <laughs> Thanks, Echo. <laughs> I uh, openly encourage um, clipping on the channel because it's the only way I make TikToks. <laughs> That's the only way I gain any traction on social media because I can't be asked making them in Adobe anymore. I just can't be bothered. I don't I don't think they're any good in Adobe. I need the only problem is whenever I think I do something hilarious, I need to reach over and use my stream deck, right? <laughs> First of all problems, right? I need that pedal that they've got. So El Gato, and I know you, you pop in every day, you bob in every now and then. If you are watching, just just send us a pedal. Do you know what I mean? I'll say you're my best mate. That's how games journalism works, right? That's how streaming works. Just give me free shit and I'll say you're my best mate. That's what, that's what happens. In other news, this stream is sponsored by G Fuel. No, it's not really. <laughs> my new best mate, G Fuel. Uh, no, uh, I've actually, actually never tried G Fuel. Do you know, I think the only thing I would actually accept a sponsorship from is something I believe in and use. So, Lipton, if you're out there. <laughs> uh, oh, where the fuck am I going now? Um, there. That's not good. Yum. Like. Go out as a big one. Like, I get, um things like protein powder and stuff like that for free but that's because i'm a i'm a registered athlete with another company but that's i'm certain he stands up you know i'm certain he gets up at some point but i don't make a lot of noise about that on social media because i don't i don't need to i genuinely don't need to um, that's not part of the contract uh, you have used the shield key <gasps> this key is useless now discard it Hooray! 
it's actually got a slightly modern feature. Who'd have thunk it? <laughs> it's like a barn door. Does it slide and everything? No, it does not. They couldn't afford the slide animation. Oh no, this is the spider. Uh, the snake even. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Gonna need something bigger than this. Forgot that was the snake room. We're gonna go need a tool up. Sorry, folks. Sorry for the roundabout. Next stop, save room. Next stop, herbs and bazooka. This way. This way. This way. Now I'm getting it. Now I'm getting my bearings. Yum. Right. Is this an armor key room? Yes, it is. What's in here? Death. Dismemberment. Slow evisceration. All of the above. Dead deer. A really dark room. Oh, a ligator. Good. I'm glad we've got a ligator. Right, question. Is it weird to have a lighter if you don't smoke? And I mean like a Zippo. Like, is it weird to own one if you don't smoke? And if it's not, is it weird to carry one around with you? How else do you like candles? Matches? Uh, well, that's answered, that's answered that question. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks, chat. <laughs> right, us through here. Matches get worse. That's like the worst version of like snitches get stitches. Matches get worse. Oh, it's a bug. It seems someone has searched here already. It appears to be a switch. Will you push it? Sure, what could possibly go wrong? Ace. That's not weird in the slightest. What's the law? Give me the law. Researchers will. It's a letter. The top of the letter is missing. The remaining says... Yes, I'm infected. I did everything I could, but I could only delay the process by a few days. The most frightening thing is that I forgot more about you. I forget more about you day by day. <clears throat> so I choose a peaceful death rather than becoming the living dead. Within the hour, I will have entered my eternal sleep. I do hope you'll understand my decision. Goodbye and forever yours, Martin Crackhorn. Good old Martin Crackhorn. We barely knew thee. Anything else? It's well arranged. <laughs> All right, Jill, calm down. Uh, hang on. Is this? Have I bought this? No, I don't think I have. Do I need to move this here now? Move these this way. Move these this way. Move these this way. What? 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 I I am confused. Did, did. Oh, it's there. Oh, I needed to move that to move that. I got it. I think. <gasps> What's this? It's explosive R. Hmm. Like me after a curry. Uh, right. Let's go. Is there anything in this coat? Wow, I didn't think there would be. <laughs> Gotta got be honest, that was a surprise. 
Okay, so we've got explosive rounds. I can't, that's not for the bazooka, is it? That's for the thing. Uh, if I go back in there, was there a reason to empty that fish tank that I just didn't see? Can I move this without moving the fish tank? If so, there was no reason to move the fish tank. Oh no, I can't move it without moving the fish tank. I get it. I see now. And I can't repress that button. Got it. Oh, that's that room dead to me. Cool, cool. Uh, I've completely forgot what was in there. Oh, uh, nothing. Wow. Lovely. Uh, map. Where am I on the map? I am there, which is great because I'm near. Oh, what's that middle room? I wonder. I'm near a save room, which is good. I'm no longer near a safe room because I'm running the wrong way. Let's go down here. Donk, 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 donk. Go to the safe room. Drop off our crap. And then go back to that room we've not explored yet. I mean, I'm aware we're probably going to finish on tonight on killing the snake. But we are going to prep ourselves first. So, and part of that prep is figuring out some of the rooms we've not been in yet. Uh, right, let's throw this in here. Right, I'm going to keep that. I'm going to chuck this in there. I'm going to chuck this in there. And I'm going to chuck this in there. The lighter. We had a room that was really dark, didn't we? Where was that? Uh, a really dark room. It had a sideways bit in it. I think it was on the second floor. It was there. It was near the thingy room, the schneck room. Let's go and check out that big room in the center of the second floor east wing. And then we can go kill a snack, a sneaky snack. The most dangerous danger noodle. It's danger noodle prime is I think is actual name. I saw, a, I saw a post uh, the other day of someone saying every Resident Evil diary is like this. Entry one. Um, we've been conducting horrible visceral experiments on the animals for days now. Um, and Joe's been making fun of them and poking them with a sharp stick. And thank God they've got locks on cages and they're not going to escape. Entry two. They escaped. We're all dead. <laughs> and see... And, very similar to be honest with you oh it's locked it has a carving the helmet oh the candle the this here you go oh is this gonna be the map i don't think i need the map to be honest i mean i'll use it it might be the map it's the map that's i'm gonna get that at some point and it's gonna go up on the collection behind me of video game maps I'm going to get the Spencer Mansion map. Yes. Thanks. I appreciate the map of the second floor. I'm not sure what I'm doing with it. But... Yeah, it's not too dissimilar from what I thought it would be, to be honest with you. Right, let's go. Oh, hang on. Um, mm, no, that's a numpad, and that's the helmet. That's the helmet. I think... Have we reached the limit of what we can unlock with this right now? No, there's still those doors on the floor, the main floor. What are we doing, people? God, ask one simple thing. Investigate the Spencer Mansion. Can't even do that right. Uh, let's go this way. Yum. Yum. Jim. Oh. Jim. So, we have discovered the zombies do not come back. This is not the Dark Souls of Resident Evil games. 
Oh, they don't come back yet, anyway. They might come back eventually. Pretty sure it's this way. I'm hoping so now. I've placed pride on it. Yeah, there we go. Now, these are either armor uh, doors or they are helmet doors. I'm not sure. I don't know which one it's going to be. I don't remember what it said when I last investigated them, so we'll have to find out. Let's find out together, kids. That'll be fun, won't it? You have used the armor key. <gasps> the armor key is now useless. Excellent. Now, I don't want to equip my... Oh, my Beretta's already equipped. <laughs> I really should put that shotgun away. Although, we are going to go kill a snake in a minute, so... Oh, hello. Can I turn this off? No, I can't. Is that shoes? Various things. That all looks like slippers. Why have you got a collection of slippers, you weirdo? That... Hello? We can all hear that, right? I just pick this up real quick. Oh, look, a clip. Good. An object of art. That's me around a museum. I was like, oh, look, an object of art. Are you coming out, Captain Shuffle Pants? Or am I coming in? I'm coming in, aren't I? I'm coming in. I'm coming in. Dun, 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 dun. Various things. It's also what it looks like. The desk is locked. Will you use the lockpick? Yes. Excellent. More shotgun shots. She was born for this. She was born to have the shotgun. Uh, I'm going to reload that shotgun. There. Go for it. Just going to reload this. And just going to reload this. There we go. Lovely. Let's go over here. You seem to be bleeding through the parameter of the wall, friend. I'm not sure that's normal. I don't think you're supposed to be able to do that. Mm, good. <laughs> this is the dance studio. <laughs> Where we play our zombie avoidance dance. Get the herbs, avoid the bites. Oh shit. Be surprised how many times you hear that when of uh, on a Saturday night with people coming out of the pub. Was this? Oh, it's another fucking microphone. So can I go through here? You don't have the key for this room. Oh, good. Now, if I try and leave, what's going to happen? Oh, nothing. Cool. <laughs> Fair enough. Wait, why do I not have the key for that room? Like, surely, where am I now? I was there. Weird. Sometimes it says, you know, lock, you need the picture of an armor key or something. I wonder what that is. Oh, wait, is that another costume room? There's a costume room somewhere, isn't there? I think that's the costume room. I'm certain that's that. Uh, right. We need a save room, we need some stuff, and we need to kill a snake. So, I know, I, I can't remember again where the snake is. Let's go, it's up here, it's there. So we need to go there. I want to go there. 
I mean, no, I mean, that's that's a very long way around. I just go upstairs and then round. That's easier. Ooh. Let's go. Still can't get over the fact that people haven't played Resident Evil games. That's so bizarre to me. Is this personal preference or is this just you've never bothered? Like, do you not like them because they're spooky games? Or like have you just never you just never picked one up? Like I'm dead I'm dead interested to know why people haven't played them. Has it just never never interested you? It's always been I can kind of understand it. If I if if I was now getting into gaming, for example, I would think to myself the Resident Evil franchise is a big a big, almost impenetrable franchise, right? But God, I need to go do this puzzle first. Fuck! But, I guess being there when the Resident Evil franchise started, it, it's really not that big a franchise for me. Does that make any sense? I, I hope that does. But, I'm interested to know. Why, why never Resident Evil? Greeny Green, that's the fairest answer I could have asked for. The backlog is real, and I just don't like jump scares and busy playing platformers and JRPGs at the time. That's, yeah, that's fair. I never realized, probably until, weirdly, until Resident Evil 7, right, the most recent one, or one of the most recent ones, called Village, um, just how formulaic the Resident Evil games are. There is a really, really known formula to Resident Evil games. And it was only, like, obviously, no one liked Resident Evil 7. Like, Biohazard, everyone was scared of it because it was first person, it was spooky, it had lots of jump scares in it. And it was it was genuinely terrifying in places. What, this? I was going to say, if this is another ink I'm going to lose my mind. Acid round. Anything else? Nope. Okay. Um, and for the longest time, I avoided it. Uh, but Resident Evil 7 Biohazard. Or Biohazard Resident Evil 7. Well, whatever you want to call it. The one with the Baker family. Um, yeah, for the longest time, I avoided it. Because I thought it was too... It genuinely felt too scary for me. It didn't feel like a Resident Evil game. It felt like Alien Isolation with zombies. And I didn't... I wasn't a big fan of it. And then I started playing it. I can't remember why I started, but I started. And I got about halfway through. And I started to see, in my mind, I started to see all the little sections of a Resident Evil game. Like, oh, there's the exploration bit. And the, there's the plant boss. And... <laughs> There's the spider boss and all this sort of stuff. Oh, you know, there's the secret lab. Got it. Yeah. Okay. This very much feels like a Resident Evil game. Uh, I've gone the wrong way. I've gone the wrong way because I'm too busy flapping my gums. That's what I'm doing. But yeah, it feels very like there's a there's a definite formula to Resident Evil games. There's always, well, there's always a tyrant, as in big bad zombie. There's always a secret lab. There's always, almost always a train for some reason. Don't know why that is. Like an escape train. There's always a self-destruct sequence. And for some reason, fucking Jill Valentine's all over it. <laughs> she is a pretty badass character now. Oh my god. I've had some early ass meetings recently. I've been in meetings at like 8 a.m. So that's not me starting work. Like I start work at 8 a.m. So I've had to start work early. Woe is me, right? But I've had to start work early so I could get ready for these meetings and just be like, cool, this meeting is an hour, which inevitably turns into an hour and a half. Um, and then that inevitably turns into more meetings because that's just the way things go. So yeah, I've just been tired, <laughs> to be honest with you. Uh, I don't want to get rid of that. I 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 don't want to get rid of these. I want to stock up. Now, the bazooka. Talk to me about the bazooka. Now, can the bazooka take these rounds? Yes, no. Uh, check. 
Explosive rounds loaded. Okay, I'm I'm gonna take that with me. That's gonna make things very very easy. Cool. Yeah. Thank you. Will you mix the herbs? Will you mix the herbs? All right. Lovely. I I don't think it's gonna give us more grief than this. I think this is gonna be more than enough for what we need. And I think we get stuff in the room that it dro that it dies in. So we need to make sure we've got a bit of space. Otherwise, we then have to come back and forward and back and forward. So let's go kill a spooky snake, and then we'll loot the room. <laughs> loot the corpse, kill the snake, loot the corpse. Etch our save into fucking granite but while we're at it. Cool. Um, and then come back. Come back and save it. I probably, in fairness, I could have done a caution carry and taken a another thingy, another heal, but I think I'll be all right. The snake's not that not that bad. The spider, if I remember, is bad. So anyone who has a fear of giant snakes, this is, you know, trigger warning. Um, if I remember where the spider is. Well, I think it's pretty obvious where the spider's going to be. The spider's going to be where all the cobwebs are going to be. Um, but that's later on, so... This way? Oh, no, I'm stuck. Uh, yes, this way. It's definitely this way. This way. This is the way. Uh, yes, good. Don't eat me. Thank you. <laughs> you were a co-worker. I don't want to blow you to pieces. But he's my friend. Well, we're co-workers. Really. More like friends from work. Oh, I should have equipped the thing. This is where I'm wrong and it's the wrong room. But I'm pretty sure this is where you get attacked by the snake. Uh, bazooka. Walk forwards a bit. There we go. Big snack. Hi, hi. Turn with horrific tank controls. Which way are you going? Cheese. Oh, no. I appear to have been numbed. Uh, I'm poisoned now as well. Lovely. Well, that's nice. How many bullets have I got? I don't think I have any bullets left. Nope. Okay. Cool. Shotgun it is. Oh, run, run, run. Run, run, run. Shoot it in its snake ass. That's it. Go on. Bugger off. Oh, it's stuck. There we go. Right. Lovely. Not the last time we'll see the snake. Ah, good. Some more ammo. Can't believe it took five explosive rounds from the bazooka. Oh, I'm poisoned. Is there a herb around here I can take? Because otherwise I will die. Oh, wait. What's that? Tell me. What is what this? Tell me this. Is this... Oh, this is just a medallion. I don't need a medallion. I need poison cure. I think there's a third one as well. I think it's star. Sun, moon, and star. I need poison things. Please anti-poison me. Is there none? There's none in here? Are you kidding? Books and gadgetry. Nothing. Oh, fuck. So I'm dead then.
Oh, there we go. Oh. Am I poisoned? Yeah. Give me the serum. Wait, did we keep the serum? I can't, I now can't remember. Oh no. Should I have taken the serum with me? I'm not sure. Right, let's just quick, do a, do a quick jog to the save room. Just, you know, get our heart rate up, get that poison pumping through. Let's go, let's go. Pretty sure we're on an invisible timer right now. I think. I think there's lots of invisible timers in Resident Evil games. I think that there's an invisible timer when you meet uh, Richard as well. Because, like, if you don't go back to him in time, he's already dead. He doesn't talk to you. But I think you just take, you just take the radio. You're just like, I'm, I'm going to just take this. Did we keep the serum? I genuinely can't remember now. Run. Nope. No, we did not. Hate to say this, Joe. You might be dead. Uh, do we need to go where the serum is then? Because that is a long old track. I mean, we'll try, but that is a long old track. We will try our best. Absolutely no guarantees, though, <laughs> at this stage. Like, are you going to just, like, keel over <laughs> at some point? Oh dear. Uh, uh, hang on. I need to remember where I'm going. I am going... Not that way. I'm going this way. So now we just need to go down the stairs through the Kenneth bit. Unless Big Bad Barry Burton's going to help us. Oh, here's some serum I found. I'm certain he helped me in that room where the thing was going to squash me. Absolutely certain. I've, I've, I think I've mucked that bit up. not die, Jill. I don't want to do that fight again. Actually, I, don't, I wouldn't mind doing that fight again. I, I feel like I wasted a lot of ammo there. I wasted a lot of ammo and I got bit. So... So now it's right, then left, then through, then round. There we go. I'm getting my, I'm getting my game cartography brain back now. think. I'll find out in a second. I might have gone the wrong way. Uh, nope. I've not gone the wrong way. Good. Just make sure you don't get bit. I'm 
not sure if poison's a timed thing or if it's like a one hit kill thing. I can't I can't quite remember. Right, let's get is this serum? Good. There we go. Serum. Yes, and I will not only will I take the serum, I'll also take the serum. Use. Yay, now I'm just a danger. Good. Right, let's heal and save again. Fuck, that was a chore. Uh, mixed herbs? Mixed herbs. Clearly the yellow herbs don't exist in this game yet. <laughs> Fine. Oh, I need the thing. Beep, beep, beep. Protagonist reversing. Protagonist reversing. Uh, it's this. <coughs> well, yes, I will use an equipment. Thank you all. Glad you asked. Ah. All together now. So for the sake of YouTube, this is a different day for us, but the same uh, video for yourself. That fucking brightness needs adjusting, doesn't it? <laughs> Filters. Filters. Color correction. No, not chroma key. I'm not chroma keying the game. Color correction. Uh, is it contrast? I can't remember if it's contrast or not. Eep. A little bit of contrast in my life. A little bit of contrast and gamma. Tweaky. Tweaky deaky. There we go. So now I should be able to at least see where I'm going. Yeah, mostly. Good. All right. <coughs> so... For the interest of YouTube, this is the same video for yourself, but a different day for us. Uh, and we're trying to remember what I've done. So I think I've killed the snake. This mansion's full of huggers. Hey, Captain, how you doing? Uh, did I get a key? I can't even remember if I got a key. Let me retrace. It's locked. The carving of a helmet. You're a carving of a helmet. Let me just... I don't think I'll have put it in the um, box. This is what happens when I play Pokemon in between playing this episodes of this. I'm just like, what on earth was I doing? Uh, where is the snake room? I can't remember. It's not that room. It's, it's on the first floor? No, it is that room. I need to go past there, over doggy daycare, and then through that. Yeah, okay, cool. I, I do know where I'm going. That sounded almost convincing, didn't it? So yeah, so I wanted to chill out with everyone today and play some Resident Evil. And hopefully, everything's not too audio horrific. Oh, that's that's doubled. Let's do that. Please let me know you can still hear it. Uh, today's not surprisingly well and nothing going wrong. Kind of feels like a trap. That, uh, uh, yeah. Take a good karma day when you get it. Can you still hear the voice? Can you still hear the game? Can you still hear the game? I got this. Dramatic music. Yeah, well, it's either that or your life is fueled by dramatic music. <laughs> I find that sometimes. How do you run? How do you run? That's how I run. There we go. Either that or your neighbors are the loudest doctor ever. No, my my neighbors have the um, smallest uh, luchador training facility ever. Just toddlers chucking each other around. <laughs> yeah, so I've got today. I've just got a sore throat, so I'm going to try and keep the, the the throat sounds to a minimum. But yeah, I've just got got a real a real scratch. If that makes sense. Itchy, scratchy, itchy, tasty. Uh, that's my I don't know where I'm going noise. No, I do know where I'm going. I've just gone past it. That was all. Uh, there we go. Right, let's turn that down a bit, actually. That looks like it's on the cusp of being too loud for background noise. Right, past what's-his-face. Yeah, you know mate? How you doing? Dick, that's it. Bit dick. Because he's been bitten, and his name's Richard. 
Dick Bittington. <laughs> so I'm hilarious. Uh, work on the new flat has finally started. Fantastic. Congratulations. After months of delays, months of delays after delays, and in a few hours, uh, quite a good amount of progress. Was, oh, that's so good. That's so good. When you physically start seeing it happen, you're just like, oh, it's actually a thing. It's really happening. This is amazing. Oh, congratulations. I'm, I'm excited for you. Right, so we... Definitely. Oh, we got the crest, didn't we? That was it. We got the crest that we don't need yet. There was nothing else we could have gotten in here. There was a big spooky hole. Big snake came out of. Yeah, cool. So we got the crest. We got one of the crests. I think there's three, which goes to the outside area. There we go. It's all coming back to me now. And then I was I was bittened. We still haven't got the helmet key though. So let's see where I need to go. Uh, beep boop, beep boop, beep boop. Um, right, so that's all that done. Can't get into that room yet because it has a combination lock, which we don't know the combo for. So what's on the first floor? Let's go to the outside room. Maybe it only needs two crests, who knows, but we can go outside. That little room might be openable as well, and that room off the side of doggy daycare might be or just near doggy daycare might be openable also i don't know but they're two rooms we've not checked for a while so run 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 as fast as you can don't get caught by the dead flesh man oh yeah semi sorted out what i'm doing for halloween so halloween is a tuesday i believe and we have um, ice hockey on a Tuesday. This is the Halloween special. So actually on Halloween, I won't be streaming. However, to celebrate Halloween and all things spooky dooky, I will be streaming on not only the Friday and the Monday, but also the Saturday and the Sunday as well. So you'll get me for four whole days in a row. Can you imagine? You'll be sick of the sight of me by the end of that weekend. So the weekend of Halloween, I'll be doing Friday, Saturday, Sunday streams. I don't know what, I might, I might bite into something a bit meatier. Like, um, I don't know, like a, a big game, I guess. Suggestions are welcome. Not Pokemon Red and Blue. Not Pokemon Blue, James. I see you already typing it. That's, don't worry, that's still happening in November. <laughs> We're still carrying on. Uh, right, here we go. This door, what's this door? Pokemon Dusk. <laughs> Wait, did we not go in here? Oh, no, we did go in here. What was in here? Hang on. We never did the puzzle, did we? You don't have the key for this room. Fine. The bird room. We never did the bird puzzle. Which I'm certain we have the note for. And I'm certain we've done. We've, we could have done. Pokemon Red Plus Blue, so Pokemon Magenta. That would have been a cool. That would have been a cool one. Pokemon Purple, just for Ghost Pokemon. Uh, let's do this and then do now. Yeah, that no, map. That's what I wanted. Uh, so I can't do that because I don't have the key for that room. That's a non-existent room, which means I now have to go through Doggy Daycare, which is fine. Um, but I, where's the bird room? Uh, Where is the bird room? Is it there? No, that's the piano room. On the left there, is it? Where is the bird room? Oh, it's there. I'm going towards it now. I think. I think I'm going towards it. Well, we can go towards it and we can um, see, see all we can see, basically. This about to be something we haven't done. It's a Resident Evil game. Dun, 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 dun. Oh no, don't do that. Oh, oh. I had a, a weapons grade nap uh, at work. Well, oh, gotta go, bye. Don't bite me. I don't wanna be I don't wanna be bitten. And now my my eye is really goopy from it. 
and then I can't, I can't seem to clear it. So it's going to be like playing it with no glasses, like uh, with Pokemon. Right. Excuse me, wow. Mappy map map. Yeah, I don't need any of this. I think. I don't think I need any of this. What, <laughs> playing this with no glasses? Please don't. <laughs> I knew I should have edited those before the stream. Yeah, ban action, shoot. <laughs> uh, you need nothing. Drop your entire inventory. Oh, God. Unable to carry first aid spray. I'm going to drink hot tea and cold tea in unison because I'm a sociopath. Uh, right, this door, I think. It's locked. Carving of a helmet. Right. I'm not mixing them, obviously. I'm not a complete psycho. Right, cool. So. Someone help. Pass for some shooting up and engaging peace talks. This isn't Undertale. <laughs> Wait, hang on. Yeah? Cool. We done it. Yay, crest. Right, now I'm just going to get the crest. Very ominous music. Stars. All right, now I'm going to leave and none of you are going to attack me because I have an anti-bird stick on me. Mm -hmm. It's called a shotgun. Dropping a paint like that is vandalism. I would get kicked out of a museum for for an act like that. Um, this way. Hello, welcome back to old man. Oldest man on Twitch tries to remember how to play original games from when he was a youngster. Today I'm playing something with zombies in. <laughs> Cold tea now. I'm so fancy. Oh. Uh, right. Mon crest. Put that, put that away. Where's other crest? Did I enjoy the Pokeclips? I did enjoy the Pokeclips. They've, uh, they've been queued up for next, this, this week's, this week's, some of them have been queued up for this week's, um, uh, social media posts. So thank you for that. I appreciate that a lot. Sun crest. Right, so I've got four of those. I'm going to put that away because well, it's not what not. Um, and I need a healing item with me. Blue jewel. Did I get the red jewel? I didn't get the red jewel. Where's the red jewel? No, okay. Where is red jewel? Jill, red, jewel. Yep. No, I don't want to have it. Get fucked. Uh, exit. Skip. Just don't, no, don't unmute it. Good lord. Okay, it's in a it's in a room we haven't got to yet. Cool, 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 cool. Where's the helmet key? Helmet kite. No, a helmet kite. And uh, Okay, we haven't got there either. Cool. Let's close Chrome, because otherwise it will ruin our systems. <laughs> I upgraded my system recently. It's probably why nothing works. Right, to the... Arm your gun. There we go. <laughs> Turn it 
to the outside space. Arm um, your gun. Equip your gun. That's the words. <laughs> Plot twist. Some aren't really zombies, just overly enthusiastic huggers. Yeah. <laughs> They're just dirty. <laughs> dirty and confused science workers. That's what they are. <laughs> Help me! Physical contact is my love language. <laughs> I hear tippy tappies. Bye, tippy tappies. Oh, there's four? No! When the sun sets in the west and the moon rises in the east, stars will begin to appear in the sky and wind will blow towards the ground. Then the gates for new life will open. Got it. Gah! So we are missing something. Right, okay. Yep, got that. Thanks. Thanks. No, go away. Uh, however, stars, when the sun sets in the east, stars above, wind below. Oh, I don't even have to choose. Excellent. Lovely. Well, I may as well use them now, right? I guess I'm out of my inventory. Okay, back to the house. Bye, nibbles. Okay, so we've been there. The helmet key is from a different room. Uh, map. Map me, baby. So that we can't get in yet because it's got a picture of a helmet on. What have we not done? What am I missing? I mean, we've not done a lot of that, but that's a combination lock, and apparently I don't know the combination. What's that big room in the center? I can't remember where's what's there. Yeah, I can't remember what's there. Let's go check that out. So we go up those stairs first. That's going to be a helmet key as well, isn't it? Do you know, I sometimes wonder if the story of Resident Evil was all mapped out before um, they actually started making them. Like, did they have this grand idea of all of these... God, stamp up those stairs. Yeah, you tell those stairs who's boss. Anyway, did they have an idea of how many games this was going to spawn? Or was it one of those happy accidents where it was like, actually... We've we've made one and it's a roaring success. So we're going to make more and then we'll just make it up. Sort of like like Wiley Coyote style bit where you're laying the track as the train is running. Um, they're sort of making it up as they go along. Or do you think they had an idea? Hello? It's locked. Where did you two come from? <laughs> no thanks. <laughs> Don't know where they came from. Um... Yeah, I wonder if they had an idea of, of what they wanted to do beforehand and if they knew it was going to be so ridiculous by, like, game five where you have Chris Redfield punching a boulder <laughs> to kill a zombie. It's not even a not even a joke. That's literally that's a quick time event in Resident Evil 5. It's five or six, actually. I can't fully remember. But I realised I was playing it and I was like, I am... Fighting someone... It's five, thank you. Um, I'm fighting someone in a volcano and I'm thumping a boulder to get them. That's... This doesn't, doesn't feel right at all. You can go and go and fist and it's like, he really did! I'm just wondering if that was, like, deliberate or not. So there's definitely something I have missed somewhere. Come on, Jill, what are we doing? Come on, Jill. I do like that they, they referenced that in Resident Evil Village where, uh, is it Heisenberg? I can't remember his name. One of them calls um, uh, Chris Redfield a boulder-punching bastard or something like that. Right, what's in here? Is there anything in here? Did I get... I've, there's a lack of notes around, I'll be honest. There's not, not been a lot of lore 
Is there anything on this wall? No. Ah, still no quick turn. Tank controls. Gave us Shiva Olimar. Uh, was that the person who played? Was it? No, oh, I need you. What was her name? Oh, I can't remember. Hunnigan. Was that Hunnigan? Right. Map. Map me. Where do you go now? I must need that combination. So that's a later on thing as well. Mm -hmm. oh, do I need to trigger a story event? Wait. No, because I've been back to the main hall and everything. Oh, no, of course. Oh, I'm fucking stupid. Oh, my God. I'm such an idiot. <laughs> oh, my days. Right, where is that room? Lovely. There appears to be a fresh batch of zombies that's appeared. Fantastic. I knew that happened at some point. I just couldn't remember when. Clearly, after the last fight. This room. Yay. Right. It reads, some tigers have a red eye and a blue eye. So we go to our inventory, which I keep forgetting what the button is, and we will use this. And then this should turn halfway round. Giving me the fart crest. Hooray! Give me the fart crest. There we go. Lovely stuff. Now do you turn back around? Yeah, we are. The American version censored quite a bit, like the initial zombie reveal eating poor Ken. Japanese showed Ken's head dropping away from the rest of the body. Oh, did they? Is that why he's decapitated? Is that why the sprite is decapitated? Got it. It's not a huge surprise that they'd censor, they'd censor it. It was in the early days of uh, home console video games. I say early days, but like early days of that sort of um, graphical advancement. Now, and you go there, which means I don't want to go through doggy daycare, which means I'm basically going to go... Uh, wait, hang on. Hang on a minute. Hang on. I can do this from that way. It's much easier. Hopefully, my map brain is, is in better gear today. I can already feel it being like I kind of already know where I'm going. Uh, to be surprised, to be fair, I'm even surprised it was since that degree. The head thing, sure, okay, but smoking a cigarette, wow. Yeah, I mean, when was this released? Yeah, I don't know. It was probably because it was more impressionable to children because, it, the, you know, it's a game, it's a kid's toy. You can have a zombie with a head popping off or something like that, but not... Although they've censored that as well. Maybe that's to not show decapitation specifically, but you can have the sprite with its head removed. Maybe because they were a protagonist and they didn't want it to be like, oh, kids will emulate this. I mean, in fairness, what was the rating for this? I can't remember. Was it a 15? It's a 15, so... I was going to say, kids should know better at 15. I definitely did not know any better by 15. Or 20, <laughs> to be honest with you. Still making very poor life choices. Uh, so now I want to go all the way around, then down. Die Hard Trilogy, running people over with blood everywhere. Yeah, but still, I mean, this has got blood in. Do you know what I mean? It's weird how they... Is, what was the rating for Die Hard? I should know. It's over there. Uh, this way. This way. I think. But the... Uh, is it the BFCC or BFFC? I don't remember. What's it called? I think it's BFFC. They've been sort of revising lots of stuff for a very long time. Uh... Map? Where the fuck am I going again? I've completely forgot what I'm doing. There we go. 
I'm going there. Yeah, blood and goes everywhere is fine as long as it's not arse. Yeah. Zombie blood. I'm surprised. I'm actually very surprised that they didn't insist on turning the blood green. That's a, that's a censorship trick, that is. Because red blood, no, no. Green blood, fine. Totally fine. Don't care. Have as much green blood as you want. It's obviously, it's obviously not real. Yeah, good. Right. Let me just go save it. Uh, actually, do you know what? Let's, let's not. Let's see what's down here first. Famous last words. Or black and pretend the zombies are just robots. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> That's another thing you can do. I was having a conversation with someone uh, recently about retro games and I was trying to figure out, the question came up, isn't it how they sell it in China? Yeah, normally. Um, the question normally uh, goes to... Oh, come on. Thank you. The question came up, sorry, of uh, what's the best underrated retro game? Like, not like a dead well-known game, but like underrated retro game. And we were trying to think of uh, PlayStation and Mega Drive as well, because the two consoles, main consoles that we had. Oh, look, a thingy. Um, Criticom immediately, Echo Alpha immediately rolls into chat. It's just like Critic, it's definitely Criticom. That's on the list as well, by the way. Uh, even if I have to, I say if I have to emulate it, I don't want to emulate it, but nothing unusual. Can I move this, please? So I'm interested to know are there any like hidden gems that people played on older consoles that you're like, no one ever mentions this game? Did I, did I imagine this game? Mine used to probably be Dark Cloud uh, on PlayStation 2, but it's so dark, it's so dank, and the cutscenes are so glorious. <laughs> Camera change. Oh, look, a crank. No, you're a crank. Uh, yeah, mine used to be um, Dark Cloud on PlayStation 2, and then I realized everyone, everyone played it late on in life and I'm like oh that's actually a really well known game uh, yeah so I'm interested to know if anyone's got any hidden gems that they no one ever really talks about or if you played any and you're like that was a really good game but no one really remembers it uh, no I'm I'm okay thanks pup Pss, pups puppies let's have a quick There's bound to be, like, loads of herbs in there. Bound to be. Or nothing. I'm not sure which. We're okay for herbs right this second. Now, if I remember correctly, the crank spot is over here. Good. I don't think you automatically use the crank either. Baton and Kytos on the GameCube. Cutscene! Oh, mate, that looks right up your alley. What was what was it I came up with? Guardians Crusade on the PlayStation 1. That was such a weird game. Like, I genuinely, until someone reminded me it existed, I, I kind of thought I'd made it up. What's is ring down the opposite side. Good. It was just like an action adventure game, but with real time, uh, not real time, like with uh, turn based combat as well. And you were a knight in blue armor and you made friends with what was essentially a knockoff Kirby, uh, which is this giant pink bunny. And it just, for so long, I was just like, I half remember it. And then I'm like, no, I must be thinking of something else. 
Like, I must be thinking of Klonoa or something like that. Like, I must be thinking of something completely different. But no, no, it's it was a real thing. And it came back to me because I saw the box. Oh, good. Snakes. <laughs> Why is it always snakes? You can't get me. I'm in a cutscene. I'm in a transition animation. But yeah, then it came back to me and I'm just like, oh, that's actually real. My God. Oh, good. More dogs. Oh, good. A world... A, a world pool? A waterfall? That's not how water works. Oh, we can go here. Good. I'm just running around now. I'm genuinely just running around like a nutcase. Oh, herbs. Let's get these before I get munched on. All oh, these blue herbs, these are uh, serum herbs, aren't they? These are poison herbs. As in, anti poison. Yep, take that. Thank you. Uh, don't, don't eat me. Don't bite me. You can't notice me. And a green herb. Take that. Now, if I remember correctly, these have to be mixed with something. So the blue ones have to go with the green ones. So just before I do this, I'm going to smash the start button and go combine with that. Will you mix the herbs? Yeah, sure, why not? And then combine with that. So now we have two lines of poisons, which is lovely. And now I can... Ow! Which is awesome, because I now need to use my actual health. i just follow you, that's fine. Man. No, you don't. Ow! There was no way you got me. I, I call pixel bollocks on that one. There was no way you got me there. Oh, good. Um, I'm on a statue. And I'm on a statue I can push. Oh, I've forgotten this bit. What is this bit? And where the fuck am I? It's, I bet I don't have a map of this place. Oh, the guard house. Nope, don't have a map of this place. More herbs. 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 herbs, 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 herbs. More blue herbs. I should probably leave these here, actually, just in case I need to come back for them, but fuck it. I'm greedy, so. And we all know what that means. It's the greed what will get me. Because now I'm out of inventory space. Oh, Cooler World. Was Cooler World not, like, a pretty well-known game, though? Cooler World. I remember Cooler World. I don't well actually I don't know if it was well known. I remember it though. I remember it. I was there. Uh yeah, so I've just fucked my inventory. Only because everyone had the demo with it. Fair. Yeah, that's fair. I actually had to buy a demo disc uh for the PlayStation 1, um, because it had the demo of Metal Gear Solid on it, and that was that's a core memory in my head. What a tiny door. Let's go in here. I can hear shuffling. It's a core memory in my head. Me and uh, my best friend um, stayed up all night playing the Metal Gear Solid demo. Just over and over and over again. The bathtub is filled with muddy water. Will you unplug it? Sure, why not? You still have that one from the PlayStation, Mike? Yeah. It's here, actually. It is, it is definitely, like, a core memory for me because, I mean, the rest of the demos are Devil Dice, Cool Borders 3, Max Power Racing, Scars, uh, and God knows, um, and A Bug's Life. Um, but yeah, this one, this is a proper moment in my, my timeline that me and my friends stayed up literally all night. It's probably my first gaming all-nighter. First ever gaming all night. I can't carry more items. So it's because I filled it with herbs. I can't drop any either, which is unfortunate. Uh, nothing major. Uh, that blood stain looks pretty major. Or damp stain. I'm not sure what that is. Yeah, obviously when we left Blackpool, I lost loads of, the, lost loads of my stuff. But I'm like... And I, I had loads of uh, uh, demo discs. I'm still not sure how I afforded them. 
Um, but that one, I had to get that one back. But I'm actually going to have to kill you because you're right in my way. Right, do I need to reload this? No, I think it reloads itself. Good. I think it does anyway. Is that a map on the wall? Oh, come on. Who's going to give first? It's... It's... It's you! <laughs> really don't want to have to do this, but... Actually, I'm going to leave you like that. I don't think... Do they grab your feet in this one? I can't remember. The desk is locked. Will you use the lockpick? Sure thing. You have used the lockpick. Ooh! Gun food. I can't carry anymore. I des I'm in desperate need of, of an item box, I'll admit. One of the things I forgot is that items don't sparkle in this game. Like, I've no idea, like that book, that's a book, right? Not just a fancy pillow. I can't get I thought it was law. I, I thought I was gonna do a bit of reading. Clearly not. Hello, it's dark outside and I can't see anything. Don't worry, there's something you'll be in soon. Uh, nope. Let's just back you up here. Uh, nothing unusual. Really. Oh, no, it is actually nothing unusual. Okay. That was probably also my first instance of trying to speedrun a game, because we tried to complete that demo as quickly as humanly possible. So we went in that one. We're going to go in this one. If this is a save room, I have a theory. It is a save I think all the save rooms have the same doors. Which I might not be news to anyone. Um, everyone might have already known that it was just like, this guy doesn't, doesn't know what he's doing. But that's news to me. Also, inventory management. Oh my god, I wish I could sort this box out. I wish this box had a better layout. Right, I need the mixed herbs. And that's pretty much it, right? Oh, I'm going to drop the crank as well. I don't think I need the crank. Whatever could be out there, it's totally safe and empty. <laughs> Absolute famous last words. Ooh, stuff and things. Will you take the explosive R? I will take the explosive R. Thank you very much. Explode R. <laughs> All right, how can you reach the fade spray on that shelf, but you couldn't reach the crank on the other shelf that was just as high? Tell me that. Tell me that. I need to put these away, and I need an ink ribbon. It's all connected by wormholes, hence the item box being shared by many locations. I think there was like a... It definitely was fan fiction, but there was a theory um, explaining away. Because I thought the idea was brilliant, and a lot of people thought the idea was ridiculous of having like a shared box of items. And it's been used to death now. Um, but I liked... I really liked it, and I, I vaguely remember there being this weird theory many years ago that... It was like some sort of experimental portal tech, like a bag of holding, but for the modern age, the umbrella had created and just never patented. And they were just like, well, we'll just use it for the staff's, like, uh, 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 miscellaneous items. We'll just put it in the, in the staff rooms. <laughs> so then they don't need to move around as much. And it'll improve efficiency as well. Honest, I cannot remember where I heard that. It must have been in a book. It must have been in one of the, the fan books that I read ages ago. Guardhouse. Right, let's go do some ransacking. Good old loot. Loot that buddy. Loot that buddy. Loot that buddy. Right, red door. That's the danger door. Red means danger. We all know this. We've played enough horror. 
creepy ass music. Give me a yucky bath key. Will you take the sea room key? What is the sea room key? is such a chunk. He really is. <laughs> He's just like, I can't get out of the room. I can't get out of the room. He could. He just doesn't think he could because he's an absolute pudding. Uh, at the book as well. What was in the book? Because I think this is one of those items you just have to check. And then you can get rid of it. Unless it's a puzzle. Check it. Open. All pages are blank. What's it for? Oh. Nothing important. Okay, cool. Maybe it's not then. <laughs> loot that room, loot that room, loot that room. Okay. The two, yeah, that is exactly what the sea stands for, Captain. This is, this is taking a turn, this has. Uh, oh, this looks safe. Oh! Well, that's not very nice, is it? Where am I? I'm here. I just got noodled to death. Be aware of danger holes. Is that a danger hole? It's not a danger hole. Is that a danger hole? No, it's just bad lighting. <laughs> this looks ominous. There's like, oh, wait, no, this is where we meet Rebecca, isn't it? There's a thingy here. It's locked. Locked with what? There's a panel with number keys. Will you push the keys? Sure. One. Oh, wait. Oh, wait, I played this game as a kid. Oh, I need them all lit. Oh, God damn it. <laughs> right. <laughs> we don't need this animation. <laughs> there we go. Brute force and ignorance. That's what solved that. Brute force and having the game lights out when I was a kid. Oh, lovely. What is this? This like, live, laugh, love. Something is written on the wall. 1 plus 2 equals 3. 3 plus 4 equals 7. 2 plus 4 equals 6. 6 plus 7 equals 13. 13 plus 3 equals 16. G okay, good. Excellent. I'm, I'm glad we're doing basic numbers. They're very important. Uh, will you take the empty bottle? Not yet. <laughs> let's, just, let's just leave that stuff here right now, shall we? Wow, the capture range on me clicking is quite large. And this concludes the educational segment of the game. Yay! It's edutainment. Uh, a four set. Will you take the empty bottle? Mm, not yet. I'd like to like to know what it's for first. And is this a chemical or another empty bottle? Another empty bottle. Lovely. No, not yet. Thank you. Wait, what does this say? Something is written on the wall. It says, live, laugh, 
love, avoid being bitten. Rules we can all live by. Water is one, red is two, purple is three, green is four. Awesome. And is this another empty bottle? Yes, yes it is. Nope. <laughs> not, not getting baited into carrying four empty bottles. Not yet, anyway. Let's just... We'll just leave this where it is right now. We know where the empty bottle room is now, so that's fine. <laughs> we, got, we got that going for us. Uh, what's over here? Oh, hello. <gasps> is this a map? Wait a minute, that looks like a wasp nest. No, it's a key. A dorm key. That is a wasp nest. Run! Run, Jill! Not the bees! Not the bees! <laughs> Can I go back in there now and they'll be okay? Will they be alright with me? Or am I, have I completely screwed this room? Nah, they're fine. They've forgotten who I am. They're not those wasps that remember who you are. It's fine. Uh, it won't move at all. It seems to be obstructed from the opposite side. Oh, uh, yeah, I got it, chill. Not the bees. Oh, they're wasps. Oh, okay, that's fine. Wasps are way worse than bees. Way, way worse than bees. Especially those, like, hunting wasps. Plate says zero, zero, 003. Okay, wait, hang on. Check. The, the wasps with, like, a, a, a memory for your face that remember who you are. And, like, hold a grudge. Because they exist. Those are things. It's just the sea room key. Uh, let's go this way. So I don't think there are any more rooms out of here, are there? No, there's not. Man, you gotta get this. You gotta get these walls locked up. Uh, another ominous. Oh, the zero zero two room key. Nice. Voices are heard from the other side of the door. It can't be true. I've been told a different story. Mm. But it's not necessary for you to destroy stars. What about my family? Barry's secret burden. Herbs? I don't know if anybody heard that, but that was Barry talking to someone. As yet undiscovered someone, but someone. And it sounded like he was asking about his family. And someone destroying stars. You have used the 002 room key. Uh, this key's uses now. Just got it? Yes, please do. <coughs> Open, says me. Uh, hello. Hey, Barry. It's Hi, Big B. Jill. Hi, Barry. I heard someone talking. So you heard it too. I think I'm getting old. It seems that talking to myself is becoming a habit. Talking to yourself? Barry, something must have happened to you. Am I wrong? You sound strange. Well, it seems I made you worry, but don't. Maybe I have been a nervous wreck since all of these strange things started happening. Well, I think I'll go out and get some fresh air for a change. Wait. 
outside like where we were specifically told not to go outside <laughs> where all the zombies I told you, are don't worry i'll just go and get some fresh air and be eaten by a monster no don't do that barry please don't do that Yeah, old age can be can cause some odd behaviour. Well, talking to yourself is not one of them. That's not old age. A dormitory sketch. <laughs> it looks like a dick. You got the map of the dormitory. Uh, the desk is locked. Will you use the lockpick? You have used the lockpick. More gun food. Delicious, delicious shells. When I hold up a shotgun shells in my ear, I can hear the ocean. What's this? <laughs> plan 42 report. Four days have passed since the accident and the pla and the plant at point 42 is growing amazingly fast. It has been affected by the T-virus differently than other plants. The other plants have been and shows unique shape in addition to its size. Looking at the way it behaves, it is now difficult to determine what kind of plant it was originally. There are two ways in which Plant 42 gathers nutrition. The first one is through its root and reaches into the basement. Immediately after the accident, a scientist went mad and broke the water tank in the basement. Now the basement is filled with water. It is easily imaginable that some chemical elements were blended in the water that promotes the incredibly fast growth of Plant 42. Another part of Plant 42 from the basement grows through the duct and hangs down like a many bulbs, hangs down like so many bulbs from the ceiling of the first floor. Many vines come out of these bulbs and then they're a second resource for its nutrition. Once sensing movement, Plant 42 shoots its vines around its prey and holds it. When it starts sucking, then it starts sucking up blood using the suckers located at the back of its vine. It also has some intelligence. It blocks the door by twining its vines around it, especially when it captures prey or it's sleeping. Several staff members have already fallen victim to this. May 21st, 1998. Henry Sharton. I know it says Sarton, but Sharton was funnier. Plan 42 report has been filed. Cool. Uh, is that a shadow or is that a bullet? No, it's a shadow. Bulb. I said a bulb. Uh, right. Push this. Lovely. Push this. Thank you. Oh, look. It's a hidden hatch. There's a ladder. Will you descend it? Uh, sure. Why not? What is the worst that could happen? Tink. Tink. Oh wait, do I not have to push these around at some point? Death. Death is the worst thing. Yeah, well, when you're right, Catmus, you're right. Aha, I remember now. Push it. Push it real good. Spaloosh. It makes you wonder how anyone got past this first before this got flooded. Bulb. Now, do I need the third one? I do need the third one. Is that? That's, that's a tiny vent. I didn't sign up for stars for this. Ugh. This is your uh, sign to hydrate everyone. Oh, are there pop-up ads there? Oh no, I need to push it the other way first. No, I'm a dummy. Oh, no, I've trapped it. No, piss. So I um, disabled ads a little while ago. There's a ladder. Will you climb it? Sure thing. We'll come back to this. 
Now you have to restart the game. That's it. That's it. <laughs> roll, roll it back, everyone. Roll it back to one. What's in here? Oh, excuse me. Oh, hello. Box. Aha. You suck. Now, uh, no water is left. That's fine. What's in here? Uh, nothing special. Good. What's this? If this is bullets, it's bullets. I mean, I'm I'm taking more than I had, so that's okay. Nope. See ya. <laughs> Get duped. Uh, hang on. I just need to double check something. That's cool. It's cool. Rather than it being like completely. I don't think I get any revenue. Actually, I know I don't. I get no revenue for that. That's just Twitch ads. Um, but the ones I get revenue for, I have disabled. So, because right now there's no, there's no point. If people want to support me, they can support me by subscribing. But that's entirely people's choice. Uh, I have been in there. Oh, uh, no, I don't know where I am. Let's just run this way. Uh, no, it was... No, it was this way. I'm being mental. Yeah, because I definitely deleted... I've deleted. I've uh, turned off all that stuff. Uh, nope, it wasn't this way. I'm stupid. getting distracted out of the corner of my eye because my graphics card fans keep starting and stopping because it's not doing anything so it's just like oh i'm slightly my fan curve probably needs changing it's slightly above ow get off it's slightly above where it needs to be um so my fans keep coming on then going off and coming on then going off way better than those ads that replace. yeah well those are the ones those are the ones i've uh, i've disabled for the time being. Um, just checking if they're still alive. Where did... Oh, it's there. That was the room. Silly me. Go and dump some stuff. And don't forget, if you are on Twitch and you hate ads like I do, um, you can use exclamation mark ads to find a link to an ad blocker that I use. So... And it works on Twitch ads as well. So if you're watching a, if you're watching someone, then and you don't want ads, then that's absolutely fine. Uh, specifically, if you're watching me and you don't want ads, I don't mind. Uh, so blank book, cool. C room key and shelves. So let's leave those there. We're gonna go and um, let's go and collect those herbs first, because we can always do with a back stock of herbs. Oh, actually, let's have a sneaky peek. What's in here? this what looks like a library door i probably should have brought that book who opens well oh giant spider oh giant spider oh giant spider trigger warning for anyone who doesn't like spiders giant spiders it's broken cool cool cool, cool. ah ah Run the fuck away. Uh, I'm in trouble. Uh, bye bye. Spiders. It's better time. Time to nuke the side from orbit. I mean, in fairness, that is kind of what they do at the end. <laughs> the mansion doesn't make it. But that is a running theme with all Resident Evil games, is there's always a self-destruct at the end. Always. 
There's always a bomb that's going to go off. Uh, right, how's my healthy health doing? Oh, it's fine. But, like, it's fine, fine. So we're going to go over here to this statue, shove the statue out of the way, eventually. There we go. Shove the statue out of the way, which is good. Get these, what, I assume to be two, maybe three herbs? I'm not sure. Uh, there we go. To make sure there's no evidence naturally. Yes, absolutely, because Umbrella likes covering its own ass. Actually, I never understood, like, the board meetings at Umbrella. They're just like, so we're going to create a virus. Uh, you mean, like, the last virus that got out and basically ruined Raccoon City? Yeah, yeah, so we're going to remake that. We're revamping it. Cool. How much money do you need? <laughs> yeah, nothing says nothing happened here, like a giant crater of an explosion. Absolutely. This is the underground bit. Good. There's a ladder. We can descend it. Yep. Let's go do this. I've still got a screenshot of Cooler World on my other money. That's not what I want. Shove this to the end. Ah, oh, no, we don't. No, we don't. No, we don't. We shove it this way first. This is nearly exactly the same thing as the last time. Nearly exactly the same thing. Right, I need to give myself room to get past it and also push it again. There we go. Good. So now if I move this down here, now we play the waiting game. This is an excellent point to hydrate upon. Right, let's look up there a sec. We want to do this first. Oh no! Oh, so they're persistent. Oh, okay. So if you complete them, they're persistent. Got it. Good. That means I don't need to do this every time. I'm not going to get trapped if I go back and then come forward. Go forward and come back. Which I have a feeling I'm going to need to. I have a feeling I'm going to need one of the keys or the key that I just did. Uh, question: Who moved the box back? Zombies. Invisible zombies. Uh, oh, what's that? That looks like herbs. We don't need herbs right now, so I'm going to go there. I think there's something horrible in this room, in this place. What's in here? Forgotten a lot of this bit. This is the basement to the to the guard house. Uh, cool. Oh, good. Excellent stuff. Excellent. Don't think there's anything in here. I can get. No, you are a hundred percent blocking that. There is a bag here. Nothing useful is there. And spelush, spelush, spelush. That noise on my days. Spoosh, spoosh, spoosh. Oh. Oh dear. Cutscene time. Cutscene death. It's a shark! It's locked. There's no keyhole. No! It's locked. There's no keyhole. No! Get away from me! Ah! Immediate death. Being attacked by a shark is immediate death. It's locked. The door says control room. That's why I needed the control room. Here. 
There's a fucking shark in here. Why is there multiple shark? What is that chasing me as well? Is that a mini shark? I gotta go. My people need me. I'm too delicious to die. See ya. Right, control room, drain the water, kill the sharks. Sorry, sharks, but you are zombie sharks, so technically zombie sharks. I always like how they showed the herbs as a part of the plant, then after picking it up, they're just a folded sheet of paper ground to dust. Makes me wonder if they're carrying some sort of portable mill with them. Yeah. How did the sharks get into the fluid basement? I think they were in that tank. I think. Uh, there's a ladder we climb it. How did the sharks get into the fluid basement? By the ladder, of course. <laughs> uh, right. Box room. That's what we need. Uh, box room. Via Uber. But you've got to get an Uber XL, not just an Uber. Like you got to get a big one for, for like, sharks. Uh, oh, God, great. Another... Another bit of digital real estate I need to remember. Oh, yeah, Greeny Green, now, you, now you're getting it. They're the guard sharks. Get off, you absolute fucker. I don't even know if that hurts me or that just hinders me. I think it just hinders me. I don't think that actually does anything, like, bad. Uh, right. Box me! If I go in the box, can I not just come out at the last save point? <laughs> Is that not a thing I can do? Uh, I need the control room key. The control room key. I hate this interface. Control room key. Use that. Combine that. Danger. Danger. Danger, Will Robinson. We're good. We're good. <laughs> go back here get whipped to death by the vine does that actually hurt no why well, that one didn't hurt so Does, but not too much maybe maybe it's not too much to uh to actually register how much it is but like if you sit there and get whipped by it constantly it will kill you maybe it's like a percentage a small percentage of health who knows it's one of those ones that when you get out of just being partially eaten alive by zombie sharks you're like oh thank god there's no zombies in this corridor and then you get whipped by that and die that's just enough rage quit fuel <laughs> to make you want to hurl your controller across the room. I just, yeah, I've said this before, I've never understood how people can throw their controller across the room. I've never thrown a controller across the room. I think the closest I've ever come is, I think Dark, maybe one of the Dark Souls games got very frustrating and I, I just had to put it down for a while and I'm like, that's less about me breaking the controller and more about, I just don't want to play this one anymore because it's frustrating. Uh, can you go away, please? You're not. You're like an Animal Crossing fish. You have used the sea room key. I have unlocked the sea room. This is useless now. Feed it to the shark. Enter the door by default, please. <laughs> I'm in danger. All right, sweet. Mm, flashy red button. What does this do? Beep, 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 boop. Beep, boop, beep, boop. There's a lever. Will you move it? Yep. Oh, look at that. Whoopsie. May have killed the sharks. <laughs> she looks really bad. She looks really sad about it. You always look that sad about it. They are going to eat you. 
Nothing special. When you say this, there's a button. When you push it, sure. There was a sound from the next room door. Oh, good. I just unlocked the next room door. Lovely. Uh, I also do understand the tendency some people have for beating things for no useful reason, like punching a table when alone. Yeah, that makes no fucking sense. Like, punching a wall and stuff makes absolutely no sense to me. Well, I'd say I feel sorry for you, but uh, sorry, I really, I really don't. Unless you sprout legs and start coming after me, which I'll be, in fairness, in a Resident Evil game, you never, you never sure what to expect. So, mm. uh, they're all wet and useless. What the bullets? I don't think the bullets are all wet and useless. They're on a high shelf. Will you take the clip? Yes. Yes, absolutely. I will take the clip. Oh, excuse me. Is this... They're all wet and useless. They're all wet. But apparently this room has nukes in. So, you know, there's... Oh, hello. Spackley. Mr. Spackala. I'll take that. The dorm key. I wonder if this is room three that I needed near the beehive. Is this what I think it is as well? It's chocolate shells. Yeah, cameras. People are weird. People are well weird. Now I understand with that, like my screen protector will will crack on my phone, and if it cracks in a certain way, I will be uh, inclined to pick at it, but not like like the actual screen or anything like that. Are you guys gonna like actually die, or are you not? Are you just are you just flopping about? Check this key. I don't think I ever need to come back down here. Aha! Room three. Oh, uh, wait. Does that mean... Oh, no. There's still water there. Good, good, good. Good thing they're not doctors. Go there with a broken arm. They just use a sledgehammer to break the bones to dust. I mean, my physio used to feel like that, to be honest. I'm certain my physio used to use, like, an illegal machine on me. They used to hook me up to, like, a TENS machine. But when I... So I asked them about it, because it was good, right? But I asked them about it, and they were like, oh, you, you won't get this, because I wanted one. They were like, you won't get this um, available anymore. And I was like, oh, right, was it just, is it like a medical grade one? He's like, yeah, sort of, but they discontinued it. I'm like, oh, right, okay. Why did they discontinue it? Thinking, like, so, <laughs> should you be using it? Um, and apparently the, it was too powerful. It was giving people electric shocks. <laughs> like, really bad electric shocks. And I'm like, I don't think I'm going to come there anymore. But I do want one of these, one of these machines. <laughs> So I took it with me. No, I'm joking. <laughs> Hooked him up to it and put it to 11. Right, need to go dump some stuff in the box. And then... Uh, how's my health? My health is fine. whoop -ah! I also don't know if me wiggling my, my buttons and... Uh, ask a joystick. My D-pad and stuff actually make me release from that any quicker. I'm not certain. Uh, right. Just in case I need some to mix with blue herbs, I'm going to just leave those there. I'm going to take that with me. Whereabouts am I heading now? <laughs> I 
Hello, Bob. I love the bride said Bob Hooks. Hello, Bob. How are you doing? Come on in. Grab a drink. Make sure you're hydrated. Pleasure to have you. Um, now, if I remember correctly, and I never do, there's a way we can kill the plant without fighting the plant. We can poison it. Now, we can fight the plant, or we can poison the plant. I can't remember which. Um, oh, you would even stretch. Speaking of... Oh, yeah. <laughs> I love that as soon as someone joins, everyone's just like, posture check, stretch, hydrate. <laughs> oh, I do need to stretch, actually. Yeah, I believe we do something with those empty bottles, but I can't quite remember what. Ink ribbon me, please. Let's save it a second. And let's... Oh, there we go. And you can save your progress with this. Will you use the ink ribbon? <laughs> Hello, idiot. We are chat. Hello, chat. I are idiot. Uh, okay. Put the ink ribbon back. I kind of wish that I just had one ink ribbon per time I picked it up, so I didn't have to put it back constantly. But whatever. That's that's a me problem rather than a game problem. Uh, I need the key. That explains why that's there. I've just remembered. I said I've just remembered. Oh, no, wrong way. Thanks, tank controls. Thanks, tank controls. Oh, come on. Oh, you're getting stuck on the corner, aren't you? You fuck. I need to fix. Oh, that's fi fix. There's nothing broken about it. I need to make some new notifications for um, uh, followers and subscribers and stuff. Because I like the open and watch uh, noises and stuff. But. Uh, so they don't want to watch text. But I kind of want something animated in like the bottom right corner that just sort of pops up and says it. And now you'll never be a problem again. Mahaha. Uh, ha ha. Ba -ba -ba -ba. this you're telling me things i already know what's this give me this thing yoink was that something else as well nope okay gotta go by is this a giant herb no it's just it's just a plant Ooh, i don't know if that hit me or not i don't think it did a fucking ink ribbon i don't want an ink ribbon <laughs> go away I love it's little. This little vibe. It's broken. Cool. Lovely. A na a nine ball. It looks like a clock dial. Some kind of code. So 9.45. Wait, is it? A six ball. That makes no sense whatsoever. I do not understand that. 
What I do understand is these spiders are going to fucking kill me if I'm not careful. I'm leaving, bye. Uh, da -da -da. Like I might pop him up giving a Vault Boy thumbs up. <laughs> Come on in. Yeah, something like that. I originally, I was thinking like, you know the little ticket that appears in Papers, Please? When you do something good or bad. Like a little like... Like a little printout would just like come from this point And just sort of be like... <laughs> that sort of thing. And then just go away. <laughs> uh, right, okay. What am I doing? Let's go to... Beehive passage. That's in here. The beehive passage. I wonder how many our final aficionados at the time criticized this game for calling it a clip instead of a magazine. Probably a lot. That's not in here at all. I've gone completely the wrong way. And um, bananas nuts. Where is the beehive passage? I can't remember. Where have I been? I'm having a senior moment again. It's there. So I come out of that. I am. Um, wait, where am I? I'm there. Right? So I'm going back here. I can go back here. No, I'm not going back here. Wait, where the fuck am I? <laughs> I'm having a proper moment. Oh, it's through there. Oh, God. That is not proportionate to the size of this room. Not proportionate in the slightest. <laughs> that map is not representative. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> All right, let's go this way. my chat for a second then. Uh, right. Go in here. Okay. Sure. Why not? Will you put water in the end bottle? Yes. Awesome. I got the water. Now, hang on a second. So, now... Uh, yes. I think. I can't remember where these chemicals are. The chemicals that I need. Not <laughs> just water, but the water. The water. Uh, am I missing something super duper obvious? I don't think I am. All right, let's pick pick this up as well. Oh, I can't. I can't carry anymore. Because I'm still carrying that fucking... Oh, the ink ribbon. Still carrying the ink ribbon. How... How does that work? Maybe I need to check them. But they're all... I'm so confused right now. I'm so very, very confused. Uh, let me go back to the save room. Get rid of the... I wish I could just drop items. I, I would sacrifice these two ink ribbons for the sake of time. <laughs> right. Past here. Do a Yui. Put 
I don't know. Right. Cool. Uh, I do need that, I believe. I just can't remember. What, uh, no, well, let's go use that, actually. Let's go use that because that will get rid of that as well. Now, let me just check these a second. Uh, check. Check, 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 check. Just, there's water in the bottle. Okay. What if I check this one? Is this an empty bottle? Uh, a glass bottle to put chemicals in. Cool, cool. But where are the chemicals? Tell me that. Where are these magical chemicals of which you speak? Because I would like them. I'm not going to lie. I'm looking for some... Got any of them chemicals for anything? Looking for some chemicals. Got any chemicals? This is the secret hideout of a pharmaceutical company. I'm sure you've got one chemical. At least one. Is water technically a chemical? Right. Let's get rid of this key. Because that will give us more inventory space. You have used the 003 key. This is useless now. Thanks. This is useless. Cool. Okay. Off that screen. Open this. Next one, we'll have a spy. Do you know what I mean? We'll have a bit of a, a sneaky spy. This is... What is this? Uh, the desk is locked. Will you use the lockpick? Sure I will. It's... Oh, if you're an ink ribbon... I swear to God, no, I'm not taking it. Will you take the ink ribbon? No, I'm 100% not taking it. I'll, we'll remember where it is if and when we need it, okay? Why do I think there's going to be something horrible here? What is that? Oh, it's it's the it's the bedpost in the foreground. Aha, <laughs> uh -huh, a row of red books. There's one white book. Will you take it? Sure. Vigil, that's what it was called. It's like G Fuel. Uh, as I stated in my last report, there are some common features found in the cells of the plant infected by the tyrant virus. We also have another interesting fact, though so through some experiments. We found an element that destroys these plant cells rapidly in UMB number 16, one of the series of UMB chemicals that we used for that experiment. We named this UMB 16 as V-Jolt. In our calculation, it will take less than five seconds to destroy Plan 42 if we put the V-Jolt directly on the route. Why haven't you done it yet? <laughs> you need to mix some of the UMB series chemicals in a specific order to create V-Jolt, but the UMB series chemicals may generate a poisonous gas which is harmful to the human body. Extreme caution should be taken when handling these chemicals. Following are the types of UMB series chemicals and their brief characteristics. UMB2 red, UMB4 green, UMB7 white, UMB13 blue, stimulating smell. NP003 purple, yellow 6 yellow. VJOLT UMB16 is brown. We all, we all got that, right? And now our book is missing. Cool. Good to know. Good to know. Can I move this? This 100% looks like you can move, but I need that other book. The one I left in the fucking box. Oh, hello. No, get off. You absolute tyrant. Utter sponge. You utter, utter sponge. Just, just some fire rounds as well. Flame R. Uh, nothing major about this wash stand. I'm less concerned about the wash stand. I'm more concerned about the, any loot. Dust collecting inside the bath towel is dirty. Cool. Bye. <laughs> uh, bye bye then. So now if I go back in here, so now I have the characteristics of the chemicals, maybe now I can find out how to do it. Ah! Go. Go in. There we go.
Ah, there's an UMB number two. Will you put UMB number two in the empty bottle? No. Right. Okay, cool. So there's two. Will you take the empty bottle? Yes. Now, if we if we win this, we we win, and if we don't, we die. So nothing nothing wrong with that, right? There's no no higher stakes. Something's right on the wall. Water is one, red is two, purple is three, green is four. Okay. Something is written on the wall. One plus two is three. Vjolt kind of sound blah, 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 blah. I can't even talk. God, language is hard. Vjolt kind of sounds like the name of a cheap energy drink you'd buy at a corner shop that turns your pee green. Ah, I see you've had um, uh, smart price energy drink before, the 19p version. <laughs> it 100% does. <laughs> but when in doubt, when you, when you need it, like that's... I remember living on that when we moved house, to be honest with you. I remember the um, the local corner shop near us. They had the sort of, I think it was called like Max Energy or something like that. But they had the little cans that, that obviously were just a uh, Red Bull ripoff. But then they got the big cans just in time for us to move house. And I'm like, well, this is, this is just efficiency. That's what this is. I shave a bit of time off the end of my life in order to make this a bit more efficient. That's exactly how it works. Right, 1 plus 2 equals 3, 3 plus 4 equals 7, 2 plus 4 equals 6, 6 plus 7 equals 13, 13 plus 3 is 16. Okay. So there's UMB2, there's UU2 here. Will you put UU2 in the empty bowl? Yes. I will put UU2 in the empty bowl. That's UU2. So now I want to mix this and this, water. So now I have NP003. That was four. 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 Yes. One plus... Two equals one is water, one plus two equals three, three plus four equals seven. Three plus four equals seven, yeah. And now, wait. Two plus four equals six. So I need two and a four. And will you put uwu two in its bowl? Yes, go on then. I mean, that's uh, having a passing uh, knowledge of science procedures. That's definitely not what you would do because you would clean out the bottles properly. But whatever, we'll get, we'll ride with it. Uh, four, yeah, sure. This is how they make G Fuel, by the way. <laughs> Just so you know. Uh, combine, don't die. Yep, yeah, equals six. Good, 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 good. And I want 13, so six and seven. Six and seven, yeah, because two sevens are 14, yeah. UMB 13, right? So that is that, yeah. So, yep, yep, got it, yep. 6 plus 7 is 13. Equally as strong as a bioweapon. That's, yeah, you're not wrong. Um, 13 plus 3. So I need a 3, so I need a 1 and a 2. Right, so I need NP003. I need NIP3. Cool. So I need water and 2. There's that one. God, I wish that text went faster. You got Uru2. And ooh, water <laughs> from a dirty sink. This is very, this is all above. You know, their cosh forms are well up to date. <laughs> You've got water. So now, yeah, I need to mix those. Two and water. 
Combine that. And then combine that. And then I've got... Monster! <laughs> now I can destroy that ivy monster. Cool. The ivy monster you've never seen yet. And just for good measure, while I've been touching all these dirty chemicals, I'm going to eat some ground up plants. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> I can only imagine the fume based headache that Jill now has. <laughs> Uh, oh, it was in the... Oh, I'm going back to the thingy room, aren't I? The shark tank. So I'm going. Going back to the shark tank. Uh, this, this way. He says with questionable confidence. Very questionable confidence. Oh, yeah, good. I keep nearly using this as a fucking coaster. I need to move it. Uh, let me just very quickly chuck all these bloody bottles away. I kind of wish it was like, right, you've done that now. We'll just take those bottles out of your inventory. But I'm asking a lot of an old game. So that's, you know, this was their first outing. Now oh, they got to give them a lot. That this interface is unforgivable. Utterly unforgivable. I want to be able to organize this. Does anybody remember when I played Save Room? The, basically, it was this music, and all you did was organize inventory management. Fuck, oh God, that was good times. Good times. I missed that with this game. Uh, now I'm going back down to the basement, basement, aren't I? Wait, did I actually empty? Did I take? No, I didn't take the G Fuel out of my thing. This is guaranteed never to get me a sponsorship with G Fuel, which I'm 100% happy with. I've never tried G Fuel, just for clarification. I've never tried G Fuel. I'm sure it tastes lovely, but I'm just not. I don't want to be sponsored by G Fuel. No, thank you. Unless you offer me loads of money. I'm not a fucking idiot. Uh, I have tried Sneak. I quite like Sneak. I like the the blue raspberry flavor of Sneak, but it's not something I heavily advertise. It's one of those things I'm like, I kind of, I don't want another coffee, or coffee's not quite scratching the itch, but I want something that's not mega fizzy. I'll make some Sneak, uh, because it's just, it just go with, with water. And if I want it to be fizzy, it can go with fizzy water, but that's ludicrous, because it makes it explode. It's like putting um, popping candy in uh, Coke, which, uh, or Mentos in Coke, I suppose. It just makes it explode. Which is fun until you have to clean it up. That's, that's what being... Wow, your life expectancy out of water is amazing. They should have given you feet. Like, they really should have given you feet. I am not wasting the ammunition on you, though. Sorry, friends. Uh, it's this room. This is the Plant 42... The most dangerous hitman planet in the world, by the way. Oh, it's not this room. Shit. It was the room of... Oh, fuck. Let's just... I'll cut this bit out of the YouTube edit. Don't worry about it. <laughs> I'll make it I'll make it all look like I knew exactly where I was going. There'll be no ums and ahs or me just bibbling around talking to myself. Just for clarification, that's, that's exactly what people want. So, that's... I have gone around in a big circle. <laughs> Hi, Chucky. Hi, George. Not be doing any crime busting today, will ya? Now, do I open a second iced tea or do I not? I don't think I will. I don't think I will. Right. I'll give you a bit of a spritz. Can I get in this box now, or is it? No. Treat yourself. I'm going to treat myself. I'm, I'm going for another 40 minutes or so. Um, and then I'm probably going to have one. But I've got a bit of a sore throat as well. My my voice is normally a little squeaky on this. But <laughs> it's not. Use this. It's like one of those um, balsamic misters. Or like dressing misters, I imagine. Do you drop anything in this thing? Hmm. 
No, I don't think you do. But I do think... So that's not a... That hasn't killed it, but that stopped a lot of the attacks, I think. That's weakened it. I've got my weight uh, again. <laughs> Poor guard sharks. Thing is, what were they guarding? Like, how would they guard this space? Right, let's go here. Did I pick these herbs up? Yes, I did. God, the lighting in this game. Jeez. I should probably get a, at some point anyway, I should probably get a better upscaler because I'm currently using a RetroTink 2X. He says, looking over to see if he's right. I am right. Yeah. Um, I should probably get a better one because I think, I think my, my brain goes like, if I spend more money on the tech, it's better. I know that's not true. I 100% know that's not true because of half the shit I've bought in, in, in the past. But I'm like, are there different types of upscalers and that would give like a brighter image or a cleaner image? Or I don't know. I don't know. Uh, fuck, I've wandered and uh, I've, I, I've lost myself. I've lost myself. Guarding the trap door in the manager's room. Yeah. That's exactly what it was doing. Uh, ah, I've not lost myself. Good. Good old psychic direction ability. Fantastic. Right, I'm going to get this. I'm going to get... The Dragon of the Black Pool. Hello, how are you doing? Welcome in. There's a RetroTick 5X. Oh, is there? I bought the 2X, specifically for this, actually, ages and ages ago. I bought the 2X um, back when I convinced myself that I wanted all of the tech to do the thing. And then I just wasn't going to do any of the things. I wasn't going to play this online. I was useless. I was worthless, etc., etc. So now I'm just like, no, I'm doing this because I enjoy it more than anything. Now I think I want El Bazooka. Now, do these rounds go in the bazooka or is this just grenade launcher rounds? Oh, God, I need that too. Where is the bazooka? Is this... Can I just have explosive rounds in this? Is this okay? So yeah, I might get the retro tank 5x, but if it's not going to give me a better picture than this, if that makes sense, like I'd like to know the difference. I mean, there's going to be a comparison bit on the on the side, so I'd probably just have a look at that. There we go. Equip El Bazooko. Uh, it's another boss, so this is going well. We're ending each stream on a boss fight, which is quite nice. Uh, I need an ink. ink. If only I had that increment. How are you connecting to the 2X? Uh, the component cable, the red green, no. The component cable that's on the PS1 and then out via HDMI. You sound like you know what you're talking about. Blackpool Dragon. Be being someone from originally from Blackpool, England, I, uh, I appreciate your username. <laughs> hit it like he owes you money there we go so that now also should have used that spare equipment good yellow red and white cables hang on i'll have a look yes that's exactly what i'm using how did how did you know <laughs> where are the cameras Uh, right, to the... No, to... Oh, shit, where are we going? Oh, where am I going? No! Oh, I'm going 003. 003 is where I'm going. I had a complete brain fart then. Complete and total brain fart. Uh, uh, this this way? Is it this way? Yes, it is this way. We're going this way. Room to here. Hmm. 
Now, slot this in this hole, and you'll be fine. Take one of these and call me in the morning. Click. Who built this fucking place? I swear to God. See, see, she actually looks like a proper character there in this angle. But there are some angles where she looks like she's made out of Duplo. Thanks, Echo. Oh, good. Kapow. I missed! How do you miss? Kapow. Ow! Stop dripping acid on me, you fucker. Oh! <laughs> I just got punched by a plan. Nope, go away, please. Go away. Kapow! Wait, is it? The, the music has gone weird. Is this. Oh, I've run out of bullets! No! I thought six would do it! You. Oh, you absolute. I cannot believe I've done this. How's my health? Actually, I'm just. I'm uncautious. I'm fine. Can't move on feet. There we go. Sure. Oh god, it's all gloopy and undulating. I hate it. Right, what's in here? I'm pretty sure there is something in here. <gasps> it's a key. Can we guess what key it's going to be? It's no. Don't combine it. Uh, the X5 scales to images by five. Oh, okay, cool. So, oh, okay. That that makes a lot of sense, Dragon. To be honest with you. Uh, a carving of a helmet. You're a carving of a helmet. Um, if I touch this, am I going to die? No. Can I poke it? No. Can I collect some in a little bottle? Wait, there's multiple doors. Why was there a second door? Is this a second door? Am I making this up? Is this a tiny door? Oh, no, wait. We, oh, no, it's the double doors. It's the double doors that were next to that room. Of course they are. It's Wesker. Jill, so you're safe. Such cool That's guy. what I was going to say. Where on earth have you been? You this disappeared from the hall all of a sudden. I'm sorry, but I have my reasons. Perhaps mm -hmm. you guys have met them? It was all I could do to protect myself against those strange creatures. Is that right? Anyway, it's good to see you're safe. I met Barry, too, a while ago. I think there's something wrong with him. Yes, I agree with you. Sure was strange, wasn't he? He looks so tired. Well, maybe it's quite natural under these circumstances. Jill, our first priority is to get out of here. Yes, you're right. I agree, Wesker. It's just not a line I normally say. Now, there say. are a lot of rooms in that mansion that we can't get into because they're locked up. I have been looking around for clues. Okay, I'll go to the other house and see if I can find any clues. Will you do that? I'm counting on you. All right. Well, that wasn't weird at all, was it? That wasn't an awkward conversation. Oh, you were shooting giant killer wasps. Oh, God. Actually, that was quite satisfying. Let's do that again. Mm 
Yes! Wait, do I just click X on them? No, I just stamp around on them. There we go. You're not coming back now. <laughs> Hello, strange person who went on a helicopter ride with me in the middle of nowhere. I am Albert. <laughs> they knew each other. They're friends from work. It's fine. <laughs> They're friends from work. It's okay. Right, let's go back to this safe room. So now we have the helmet key. Now we can start unlocking some real doors. Not to say all the other doors were real doors. They were just figments of our imagination. Uh, I don't... I'm not going to need the bazooka right now. Oh no, wait, hang on. I might need the bazooka right now. Who is Helmut and why did you have the key? Because I'm a thief. <laughs> you know this right now. I'm a fiendish rogue, also known as a cold-hearted thief. Uh, I'll keep that... Something tells me I need the bazooka, and I can't remember what it is. I can't remember if the giant spider's nearby. No, I think I'm okay. The master of... Yeah, why do I Why do I need keys? I'm the master of unlocking. Like, I don't understand that at all. Right, so that's that. Oh, no, wait, let's see. Of course. Cheeky save. Half past eight. Half past eight save. Uh, Ingribbons. I'm gonna regret not picking up that last ink ribbon on her. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be like, oh, I'm out of ink ribbons. We'll have to do a bravery run at the end of this. I can save my progress for this. Will you use an ink ribbon? Sure, why not? Checking memory cards. Now, don't accidentally unplug it like you did last time. Not me. I didn't unplug the memory card. It just, it didn't, it didn't register the memory card earlier. So. Yeah, master of lock picking would be too normal. Exactly, the master of unlocking. Like that makes you sound really suave. Do you know what I mean? Like I'm the master of unlocking. Uh, let's get rid of this. Cool. That's good. That's good. Right now, I'm gonna go back to the mansion. I believe. I believe. Anyway. Unlocking with a regular key, totally normal. You got it. Da -da 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 -da. He's getting it. I'm so glad this microphone doesn't pick up the horrendous drive noises. Of the oh, hello. I forgot about this. It's radio. This is Brad. I know you can't answer me. What's up? Absolute legend, Brad. This is Jill. Brad? Oh, it's broken. Brad, this is Janet. <laughs> Five points to anyone who gets that reference. Right, uh, let me just check the map here. What am I doing? Oh, what's back there? Let's go back there. If we can, of course. Uh, hopefully avoiding... Uh, danger, danger pups. Danger pups. You're all going to be clustered in one area. Why are there no dogs? I didn't kill them. I didn't kill them. They're not <laughs> supposed to be in this corridor. Oh, good. You're all here. Clustered nicely. Um, okay. I'm still on caution. No, I'm, I've just gone from there. So if I go that way and around. Yeah. Meow. Yeah, bye bye. Oh no! Haha! -ha. You've got to get power to the elevator. Bollocks! Ow! Okay. Alrighty. Oh, I was the wrong left. Of course it was. Of course it was. Dog strike. <laughs> it always remind me of the Silent Hill meme. Where it's like, there's a dog house here, but there's no dog. And the dog is like flying through the air towards it. <laughs> Snacks! Snacks! Welcome to the Noodle Forest. We bring you... Oh, you're joking me. How do I get back? Oh, I can just drop. Oh, good. I'm like, how the hell do I get back here? I can just drag it before that one, sorry. 
the one time a character actually does something sensible. Just like it's like three feet. I can just slide myself down. Yeah, the constant call and response that they have in the background. Constant. Got any herbs? Got any herbs? What's this? What is this? Wait, is this the mansion? Did I just go the wrong way? Oh no, this is the shed. Good. Out of context comment of the day, Camus. <laughs> Dog called dog communication dot mp4 mp3 sorry <laughs> wasn't sure if that was an enemy noise or the disk drive moving in the PlayStation then fun scratchy boys yep it's time for the scratchy boys hey there we go I was like well there's a cutscene for all of them where's the cutscene Oh man, he's zooming. He knows how to use doors. I'm fucked. My only safety. And like an idiot, I used to turn around and try and find out what it was. I'm like, oh, I wonder what that is. Uh, <laughs> not my problem. Bye. One of them's even a cameraman. They're so smart. Baba. Now I remember why I wanted the bazooka. Now I remember. Because these are fucking annoying. <laughs> I'm just gonna. Oh, cool. Someone left me a gift basket. How nice of them. I oh, like a fade spray. I'll use that in a second. Freshen myself up a bit. It's just glue in a can. That's what it is. It's all fade spray. It's just glue in a can. You just seal yourself up with it and hope for the best. It's nothing fancy here. I'll take I'll take those as well. Thanks very much. I forgot about the, the little Santa packages that you can get. Uh, now I remember, though, why I wanted the bazooka. Give me my bazooka. Uh, I'm going to... Oh, no, I don't want to get rid of that. I'm going to get rid of this. Can I not mix these in? Oh, fuck's... This absolute Oh, acid rounds might be a good shout for them actually. Uh, no, I want the I want the Borzuka. Uh, it's a risky gamble, but I'm willing to take it. Uh, I'll use the fade spray. I'm now imagining what a found footage film would look like if filmed by one of those <laughs> film gifted hunters. It would just be a lot of dead people. Maybe there's just a couple of hunters trying to grind. What's up, guys? It's your boy, Hunty Hunty 7000. We're going to prank this lone woman in this mansion. It's just two hunters just constantly bait and switching. Can I combine these more? No, I can't. Okay. Acid rounds. I can't remember if acid rounds are good against these. I have a feeling acid rounds are good against anything organic. So I'm okay with this. They're just absolute chad YouTubers. <laughs> now, if I shoot you here, will I die? No. Ow. Mmm. Sizzly. I'll put some bullets in the back room. Use them in case of trouble. Battery. Got it. Thanks. Scratch that like button. <laughs> she looks like one of those pinup women too. God. <laughs> right. Where am I going? I've forgotten already. Oh my God. Uh, helmet. You're a helmet. Uh, I need to go out here. I'm not fucking around with these ones. I'm just going to kill them. I don't mind. Two acid rounds. Two acid rounds. Are you joking? Wait. Ow. Ow. <laughs> right. I. How am I fine? I just got hit four times by a hunter. How am I fine? You have used the helmet key. Who remembers the annoying fact that one specific move that a hunter can do can kill you in one shot? 
This can one-shot you. It decapitates you if they jump attack you. It's so annoying. Oh my god, it's so dark in here. Please tell me I can just pick up whatever I need from here. There's a switch. Will you push it? Yeah, sure. Well, there's lots of scratches on the wall, so I'm kind of expecting to get jumped any second. I'm not going to lie. Oh, law? Nope, it's Barry's bullets. <laughs> She's not fine. She's freaked out, insecure, neurotic, and emotional. <laughs> what? Oh, good. Will you take the Doom Book? Will you take the Doom Book? Oh, Bob! Bob Pooks, thanks very much. I really appreciate that. Thanks for the prime. Genuinely, really appreciate that. Uh, my even my phone's going mental now. It's like someone subscribe. Um, the Doom Book. Yeah, sure. I'll take the Doom Book. I mean, that sounds like a pleasant bedtime read. I'm gonna check it in a second. I just, I'm sure. Was there not something over here? I can only see moonlight and dense forests. Yeah, and all the fucking dogs. There's a switch. Will you push it? No, no, I'm good. Thanks. I quite like light. Uh, right. Check this. Um, a novelization of the video game Doom. <laughs> oh, now if it's not, I'm going to be really, really upset. Oh, thank you, Bob. I really appreciate that. It's always... Oh, it's the crest. Of course, it's the medal. I always appreciate, I know I've got some new people in chat. I always appreciate um, subscribing, but the best thing anyone can do is just interacting in chat, like watching, chatting, just being there, that sort of thing, totally. I mean, if you want to drop a sub, I'm d more than fine with that. That means that the more that happens, the more I can do it. Maybe one day I can do it full time, who knows? Um, but I'm definitely not going to be like, I'm never going to sort of incentivize it or force it, if that makes sense. Um, but when it happens, that means it's special, right? It means you're not doing it just for something uh, arbitrary. You're doing it because you actually want to support me. And that, that, that right here gets me. That gets me right here. That, that means the world. So I really do appreciate it. And I don't want people, I don't want people to just think like, oh, he's just saying he appreciates it. That's proper appreciation, that is. Uh, right. Anyway, enough sentimental bollocks. What are we doing? Um, I might need to run through doggy daycare. I don't really want to. Oh, no, I don't need to, do I? I can go upstairs. I don't even run through doggy daycare corridor. Um, I can just go upstairs through here. Is there not another? There's another helmet room up here, which I've forgotten about. Yum. It's Jill. Jill with her massive bazooka. It's Jill. I forgot she got the bazooka right at the start of the game. That's fucking mental. Uh, loading screens. Oh, wait, hang on. Is there not a hunter in here? Yep, there's a hunter in here. Alright, H. Is this going to reach you? <laughs> not like that, it's not. No, it's not. Shit. Well, that's a waste of two bullets, isn't it? Fuck. What an absolute waste of my life. Oh, come on. I wasted one. I absolutely wasted one. Absolutely ruined. Yeah, it's in a wall. <laughs> well, that's those zombies took care of themselves, didn't they? <laughs> the zombies we saw in here earlier, they seem to have just resolved themselves. See? That's how you deal with problems in life, kids. Just ignore it and they'll go away eventually. <laughs> if you ignore your problems, they'll eat themselves. Uh, what are you staring at over there? All she needs is one of those infinite ammo bandanas that Solid Snake has. God, I love that. You do, you can get an infinite ammo cheat in this. I say cheat, you can get an infinite ammo thing. I think if you complete it in under like an hour or an hour and a half, I can't remember. <laughs> Needless to say, we will not be doing that. Dunk. Oh, good. Oh, I forgot about this. Uh, all right, mate. 
I haven't got the bullets or the patience for this, so I'm going to go. I'm just going to leave Ali to it. It's fine. You, you were right. Yes, it escaped the Chamber of Secrets. I think, I think, I, I don't, I don't, I think they, I just, I just, just yeah, I'm going to. I'm gonna come back more better, more more better equipped. That's good. It's good language, isn't it? More better. So now, if we go up here, wait, is there another one over here? Oh, there fucking is as well. You you fuckers are everywhere. I was googling my mind when Snake pointed out the bandana from MGS2 and just said infinite ammo. You're not immersion breaking at all. Yeah, not at all. No! Bad. Bad Helmsley. I'm not even in line with you. Ow. Get off. No! Ah, shut up. For YouTube specifically. This is a different day for us, but the same video for yourself. And we're now going to go back to the mansion with the helmet key that we've just gotten from the courtyard, uh, from the guard house. And we are going to open the doors we haven't opened yet. So let's let's dive in. Oh, it is the canon name. Not sure if it's the any in-game text thing I want to go. Oh, yeah, I'm, I, I'm sure I know it from a diary entry somewhere, Katniss. But... I'm not 100% certain. It could just be the name they always gave it. Oi. What are you doing? Yeah, get fucked, mate. No. Are you going to come this way? I'm sure, but not certain. <laughs> You've been around long enough to know how my language works. English is hard enough. Ow. Ow. You draw this is what happened last time. Get die. Thank you. I think I'm now very injured. Danger. Danger, Will Robinson. Right, now we're fine. Right. And those are not a problem anymore. <laughs> and now we're going to go... Wait... Do we want to go up there? Do we want that one or do we not want one? And ambush makes can stand off with both parties waiting to ambush the other. Yeah, pretty much. That's what it felt like, to be honest with you. Do I need the other key as well? Also, hang on. Did I grab that book? Do you remember the Doom book? I can't remember if I grabbed the Doom book or not. Or we died afterwards. Because I'm pretty sure, do we not need to check that? Turn these up just a smidge. Just so you can see me a bit better. There we go. Um, let's run over here. See, this is way less stressful now that there's no hunters in this section. And we're going to be going through that, that corridor upstairs a, a, a few times, so... Did we pick up the Doom book? Beretta, uh, bottom, 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 flame round, ink ribbon. Right, so there's nothing that way. Mm, we must have picked it up and then died. Yeah. Oh. oh, wait, it was in that room, wasn't it? It was in the room with the light off. That's what it was. I've got another key that I need as well, I think. Well, maybe I don't. I've clearly used the other key. Who knew? Hey, Darcy, say how you doing? Not gonna lie, I said that as Doom book. Doom. Yeah, oh, it's Friday the 13th. I completely forgot. I keep remembering that it's Friday the 13th and then being like... It's just Friday the thirteenth. Like it's just Friday. Like I completely I completely forget it's Friday the thirteenth. Uh, uh, possibly the scariest, spookiest day of the year. And I do I completely forgot about it. You know what I didn't forget about? I didn't forget about Halloween because we're gonna be doing special all weekend streams on Halloween weekend. 
not the actual Halloween day because of oh, I've got the plants. <laughs> Soz. <laughs> is it this one? You have used the helmet kit. No, I think there's a hunter around that corner, isn't there? I'm pretty sure there's a hunter around that corner. Yes. This is what we want. The dogs. We've missed the dogs, right? Turn on the light switch. Where's the book? Was it here? Not particularly noteworthy. Jason Voorhees dropped by earlier and told him to return later when it's dark and spooky. Yeah. Fair. No, it's fair. Right. Is there anything else in here? Nothing uncommon. You say this. Magnum rounds. I'd say they were pretty uncommon. I'd say they were definitely uncommon. In there. I think that might be everything in this room. I keep bumping the microphone. Hang on. Might be a bit better. There we go. Hopefully you can still hear me. Um... Yes. So I'm going to go put these away. We'll check the dream book, see if there's anything special about it. I'm going to put it away. So how's everyone's week been? I think I've seen people in a couple of days. And obviously, if you weren't tuning into the Godcom channel on Wednesday, we played... Um, the Layers of Fear, the remake, the 2013 remake, and we completed the final note, the, the Inheritance DLC, and the final note DLC as well for Layers of Fear. And next time, which is going to be the 22nd, 22nd, 23rd, I mean, I've already said this, I've not actually confirmed it, but I've decided I'm streaming. 22nd of November, we're going to be playing through Layers of Fear 2, which is the actor's story in the new remake of layers of fear so what they've done is they've taken layers of fear right which is a great horror game don't get me wrong they've um oh i need to check that door they have remastered it completely new mechanics everything and they have included the dlc for uh, resident evil they've included the dlc for resident evil it's amazing um they've included the dlc for layers of fear and layers of fear 2 both remastered and they've made brand new content for layers of fear 1 uh, check how many layers are there so technically i think two uh, nothing important you say this can i not just open it aha i knew it there's a medal in the book got it i knew it a medal from a book the eagle yes yeah, yeah, yeah. from the f the first doom book the first book of doom and the passage E1M1 says, rip and tear. You hope for more layers with the purchase of the game, like 20 or 30 layers. <laughs> it's what I would consider to be a very good story, atmospheric story spooky game. It is not a good horror game. Like... It's a good psychological thriller. An uncomfortable one as well, which is sometimes, you know, that's how art grows, right? That's You face uncomfortable things. Two layers is just a bare minimum to be called layers. Uh, that's true. I mean, you're not wrong. It could also be zero layers. That, yeah, that, yeah, when you're right, you're right. Language is weird. Language is very weird. Uh, right. Which one am I going to go for? Let's go this way. Wait. This is my I don't know where I'm going face. Okay. Let's... We've got a fair bit of kit. Let's go see if we can kill Yawn. It shouldn't be that difficult, but if we die, then we're, we're dead. Like, we have to completely start everything over. Not everything over, but like, 
we have to recalibrate the audio and video and I really do, I don't want to do that so I want to make sure I'm fully stocked I've got no healing items which is dumb but I'm sure we'll be fine you've used the helmet game good 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 what is the worst that could happen if I just go through here blindly I just walk backwards that'll give me a better opportunity to run away right no apparently not I investigate where you come out of a hole opens in the fireplace it's called a chimney Jill <laughs> most people have them I can't actually remember where what I need for this like what I get sorry dunk are right, you on you're looking a bit worse for wear. Run! Ow! You've been bit. Am I poisoned? No, oh, I'm fine. Missed! You missed again, Jill. We did this with Plant 42. Right, well, now we can do this bit properly, right? <laughs> roll it back, everyone. Roll, roll it back to one. Let's go. <laughs> okay, so let's put the shotgun away. No, well, let's keep the shotgun out, actually. Um, I hate that my shotgun shells aren't next to my shotgun. I really don't like that. Uh, bazooka and two lots of acid rounds, please. So now we're going to do this. Equip. Equip. Go blow this thing's head of heart. Excuse me. Temporary audio desync for Twitch isn't that horrible. Best sleepy snack first for YouTube. <laughs> sleepy snack first for YouTube, then fix the audio for Twitch. <laughs> yep. <laughs> beat, 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 beat. Right, fuck off. Fuck off. Sucker bazooka. Uh, yeah, I'm fine, apparently. Blah, 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 right, we'll leave the Doom book right now. We know where that is. And we don't have a magnum, so we, we don't need it. Don't need it at all. Wait, what did I say? Is it a B? Did I say E? I don't know. My brain's all over the place today. It's progeny of Monty Python's plot nice. Just a flash wound, don't you worry about it, mate. <laughs> I wish this thing had auto aim. That would be that would be lovely. Especially when I'm fighting a boss. That would be fantastic. I'd really, I'd really like to be able to kill you. I'd, yeah. <laughs> what was it you called it? A reverse Mexican standoff where both people, both people are uh, trying to ambush each other. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna get her. Oh, I'm gonna get him. Oh, I'm gonna get her. Oh, I'm gonna get him. <laughs> All right, fine. Uh, what if I just run? I get hit. <laughs> oh. Oh, okay. Oh, okay, fair enough. <laughs> that actually worked better than expected. In 1996, are you mad? Are you insane, child? Uh... Oh. Mapo. I need Mapo. Where am I going here? Uh, so I've got the snake. I've got... Oh, that room on the other side. Let's go to that room on the other side.
stink feels a bit. Oh shit. Haha. Uh -huh. Bet there's another one though. Right, we ain't comfy. Better. Lovely stuff, right. I'll try and edit that out of the video, but it's probably not going to happen. Uh, I don't really want to go down there, I'll be honest. I want to go over here. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I want to go over here. Because there's a bit over here I've not been to. Do, 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 do. I'm pretty sure. Oh, that's the sound of a hunter. That's the sound of two hunters. Bollocks. Oh. Oh, wait, hang on. Did that one just hit? Just yeah. kill him? I have an amount of doubt there as to whether or not that actually works. There's definitely one in here. I can hear it. Where are you? Now, is this going to reach? <laughs> That's a move that can kill you in one shot. Right, we're out of bullets. Okay. How's the health? It's fine. Get out of the way. Thought I just heard another footstep then. Like there was two around this corner. You have used the helmet key. Yay. We'll see if I'm happy about that in a second. Uh, dead crow. Can't hunt a dying beast. Not in my house. What do we got? Orders. Top secret. July 22nd, 1998. 2.13. To the head of the security department. X day is approaching. Complete the following orders within the week. One, lure the member of stars into the lab and have them fight with the BOW in order to obtain data of actual battles. Two, collect two embryos per BOW type, making sure to include all species except for Tyrant. Three, destroy the Arkley lab, including all researchers and lab animals in the manner which will seem accidental. White umbrella. Dun, dun, dun. The plot, she thickens. Oh, more magnum ammo. Can't help but feel I'm going to get a magnum shortly. Uh, nothing unusual. Apart from this box of shotgun shells that I can see. <laughs> like, I can see it. I don't know why you can't. I can see it. I'm not even there. It looks like it's about to move. Oh, great. Nothing. <laughs> oh, hang on. Wait, what have I got to... Climb this. Is it the antlers? Uh, might be. Might not be. Uh, nothing important. Okay. <laughs> Cheers. Thanks for that. Go. Down, 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 down. So, wait. Can I get behind this? No. So, this can only be pushed left and right. So, uh, to... apparently, can't be pushed at all anymore. There we go. Uh, it looks like it's about to move. Wait. So there actually isn't anything? What am I missing? Looks as though it's alive. Uh, oh, hang on. There's a switch. Really push it. Yes. Aha, there we go. I have to turn the light off first. Got it. Let re reset the room, everyone. Reset the room. Leave and go back in. Reset the room.
I wonder if this is the red gem that I need. Uh, well, I'm going to need to turn that back on so that I can push this properly. Otherwise, I'm going to be able to see it. Hello. And then go back over here. Oh, beautiful tank controls. Will you push it? Yeah, go on then. It seems you asked nicely. Uh, nothing useful. Well, you say this. Can you climb the ladder, please? Thank you. Shiny, shiny. Yep, there we go. Will you try and take out the eyeball? Yes. Will you take the red jewel? Indeed. Now, back to the tiger room. I have a strange feeling something appears now. Let's switch where you push it. Yes. No, I'm incorrect. Honestly thought something appeared when you turned that back on. It would have been a good jump, I gotta I got admit. Okay, where is the tiger room? We had this conversation earlier, didn't we? It is... Uh, not there. That's where it is. It is not there. It is, however... There, that's where it is. It is downstairs from where I am. So, if I just go down here, this should be perfectly safe. I think it might be a, a round a corner. <laughs> Tiger's wrong game there. Uh, I'm gonna just leave you to it, and you as well. Ow and hopefully not get decapitated in one shot. Hopefully. Because that can happen. You can get your head cut off in one shot by the hunters. Good. Good. Bad. Bad. Ow. I think I'm injured. Danger. Ow. Fuck. Uh, reload faster. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay, maybe the bazooka is the way to go. <laughs> Is this what I think it is? It's the Tyrant Killer. Hooray. <laughs> oh, it comes with bullets as well. Oh, my God. <laughs> How amazing. Okay, so where else do we need to use the helmet key? Caution oh, uh, I wonder if that's the key for that room just to the south of me. Oh, I'm still on caution. That's not very good, is it? Uh, is it this way? I think it's this way. Every time I play this, my, my Resident Evil um, uh, map brain gets a little bit better. Oh, crap. No. Nope, bye. No. Fuck. I'm just going to take all the bazooka ammo. That's what I need to do. I just need to take all the bazooka ammo. Okay. Let's go kill a, kill a giant snake. Kill a ginormous danger noodle. Yeah. I wish, I wish first aid was a real thing too. 
That'd be nice, wouldn't it? It's just glue. It's just spray on glue. That's all it is. <laughs> Prick. <laughs> Happy through the chest? No, I have no problem. Just spray it away. Giant claw in the abdomen? Don't worry about it. Just spray it away. Lower the arms of my chair so it doesn't look like I'm like this all the time. I do have a neck, I promise. It is there somewhere? Gotcha. Lost an arm? Spray it back. You'll be fine. Yes, go through there. Thank you. Through that balloon door. Uh, right, let's... Yes, these are acid rounds. Good. And my health is fine. You've used the helmet key, which is good. Yeah, being able to auto-aim would have been nice. Or at least knowing I'm locked on, if that makes sense. Or knowing I'm aiming in the right direction, but fuck it. We can't always get what we want, can we? <laughs> nope, no thank you. No, no not today. Fuck! Nope, no, 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 Fade away. Fade spray makes your problems fade away. Gotcha. That's what I'm talking about. Piss off, you sneaky bastard. Right. Now, the only thing we actually needed was this hole. <laughs> That's what we needed. It's too dark to see anything. Oh, hey, Barry. Jill, have you found anything interesting? Yes, but I Other can't than the see dead giant well. snake. How about going down to check by yourself? I have a rope here. Oh, do you? Well, then I'll try to go down using the rope. The voice acted is awful. Wait. Barry has deployed massive rope. Oh, no, I dropped it. Hey, oh. what's going on? Now I've done it. Sorry, Jill. Wait. I'll go and get another rope. Barry? Barry? Right. Now, I am actually going to wait here because I have a suspicion. I've never waited here. And I have a suspicion based on a hint I read on Reddit that if I sit here for a, a certain amount of time, Barry will come back. And I've never seen it. So I'm interested to know if it's actually true. Yeah, exactly. Oh, I did! <laughs> hey! Are you there, Jill? Grab the rope! That was two different voice actors. He is surprisingly quick at finding another rope. Like, they can't have just been around everywhere. I'm sorry, Jill. But I didn't know that was going to happen. Sorry. Burn. I was really careless. Are you okay, Barry? Maybe you're getting tired. No, I'm all right. Don't worry. Jill, I found something. Ask number. Oh, eight. Wait, is that eight one zero eight three one zero? That's the number we need for the door that we've never unlocked. 
Thank you. I'll take this then. That camus, that's what I was wondering. Uh, I'm gonna go use this first, just in case I drop myself down that hole. Yeah, nothing, nothing unusual there at all. Wait a minute, what is this? Oh, that looks like a, an item on the floor. Now, is there anything in this fireplace? A hole opens up. No, okay, cool. Fine. But now we have to go through a number of spookies, a number of uh, thingies. Hunters. So we're going to go back to the save room. We're going to do a cheeky scum save, and then we're going to reload what we need. Oh, the sound drops and you have to fight him too, and he has more HP than yawn. <laughs> no! Oh yeah, I missed your message earlier. Uh, not gonna lie, the first time maybe wonder if there was two stair animations from floor animation, floor to in intermediate landing, and then from landing to upper floor. Yeah. Yeah, I wouldn't put it past them, just to lengthen the loading screen, the loading times. But there wouldn't be too much of a reason unless you had an entire separate floor just for mid landing. Like, I don't know if that would help the loading process of upper floor and lower floor. Who knows? Because that's all they are. They're just they're just fancy loading screens. No, they're not even fancy loading screens. They're just loading screens. Uh, right. So put. Let's get a thingy. Oh no! It's our penultimate ink ribbon. Shit. Sure. Go ahead. No, I don't want to save again. No, no. Uh, I'm not poisoned, am I? No, good. Good, good, good. That's what we need to do. I need the shotgun. Shotgun, 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 shotgun. There it is. Shells and shells. Yes. We'll take all of that. Thank you very much. Uh, combine them. Presto combine them. There we go. Now we're going to go around to where this code can be used and also get the red gem as well. Hopefully. What's the best way of getting there and not getting eaten to death by a hunter? Um, we want to go down. Oh, no, we want to go up, sorry. I want to get to that, that bit there. Best bit might be... There's at least one hunter in there. Yeah, at least one hunter. I don't think it's going to be a best bit. I'll be honest. I think... Oh, unless... Ew. I'm on the first floor now on us. Go out of here and then right. Oh, there's bound to be a hunter in doggy daycare. Oh, yeah, there's bound to be. I'll go the way I know. Yeah, I'll go the way I know. Well, this is dangerous. Ow. Because now I have to reload really quickly. Ow. Gotcha. Mmm, crispy. <laughs> and now I have enough to kill two more, and there's more than two to kill. So, there we go. No! Don't you dare! Oh! 
took my head clean off, you son of a bitch. I like the death animation. I, I'm even decapitating the death animation. The inventory box is looking a little slim, like for, for stuff. Just in all Resident Evils, from Resident Evil 1 to however high it'll go, not just the sequel to Resident Evil 100. <laughs> uh, let's see if we can go this way. Wait, hang on. Which way am I going again? I'm going the other way. Amazing. <laughs> right, so there's not one in here that we're aware of. Yes, there is. Surprise! Surprise, Valentine. <laughs> Quickly pause. Oh, there's something on the ceiling. That's good. I think that's also a hunter. Oh, no, it's a spider. Good. Vagina. So this is no longer doggy daycare. This is spider daycare. Go away. No, you don't. Thank you. Would you lie to us like that? Well, I did, because I can't hear it moving. <laughs> I didn't lie to you. The game lied to me. I didn't lie to no one. You ain't got proof. It immediately deletes the VOD. <laughs> oh. Thank you very much, Whiskey Pits. Thank you for the raid. Welcome, welcome. Welcome, Raiders. Uh, Brian, uh, my announcer, just shout screamed that in my ear. So I don't know if that came through. Hey, Whiskey Pits, how you doing? Whiskey Pits is now following. Thanks, Brian. I appreciate that. What have you been playing? You've been playing this for the first time. Oh, my days. Brian only shouts in my ears. Yeah, I think I may have, because I was streaming on the GOG channel when I played Laser Fear on Wednesday, I had different um, notifications set up, so I don't think I've activated him. Also, I'm not touching the audio setup of this because this is janky. This is Jankstown USA, so. Oh, the remastered version? You've been playing the remastered version. That's an excellent shout. I'm looking forward to re-replaying re re that now. Ah, God, I'm going the wrong way. But yeah, welcome in. Have you been enjoying it? Do you, do you play many Resident Evils? Is it your first sort of visit into the genre, into the into the series? I'm interested. Have a seat. Let me know. Just because part of the red zone. I hate the red zone. I hate. It. I do when they take something like Resident because they're not in. Uh, you played four, five, and six. Good shouts. Um, they're not in the original, right? <laughs> well, actually, that I remember. It's it's been a while since I played, but I um yeah I don't I don't remember them being in the original. But when I encountered them in the remaster, I was like, oh, so I've just killed a zombie and then it became a red zombie, and then I'm like, oh oh, this changes everything I think I know about this game. Shit. <laughs> in a good way though, I gotta admit. Right now we're we're at the point where we've just activated the hunters. We're at um. Uh, mansion revisited, basically. Oh, God. I'm out of ammo. Bad point. Bad times. Bad times. Bad times. Fire. 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 No. Kill it. Kill it with fire. And run away from the other one before it does a jump attack and decapitates us again. The LG one didn't have a Crimson's. I think they were introduced in the 98. Were they really in the 98 Crimson's Corp? I, do you know, I might have to see... I don't have the director's cut on my retro shelf. I might have to see if I can get a copy. Because I don't remember them. Maybe I didn't... Do you know, maybe I never played the director's cut. Wow, that would be wild if I did. Ah, <laughs> get him. Have your death animation and then pop off. There you go. Right, so uh, we're going to get the gem first. Because we have the armor key, uh, the helmet keys on. 
The gem gives us the magnum, and then we're going to use the passcode, which I personally have never used. I didn't know that if you just waited for Barry in that hole, he actually came back. I had no idea whatsoever. Oh, as a side note, whiskey pits, don't feel obliged to sit here and watch. If you've just been on a long stream, I know how that feels. So I absolutely appreciate the follow. I appreciate the raid. But if you want to pop off and do your own thing, you you do that. Absolutely no pressure, no judgment. Uh, there's a switch here. Will you push it? Aye. And now I need to try and remember where the ladder is. It's there. Now I'm going to... Is it a nucleate when you take the eyeballs of something, or is that blood? I can't remember. <laughs> I've watched too much Criminal Minds in the past. <laughs> or should I say enough Criminal Minds in the past. Uh, let's go. A nucleation, yeah, thank you. A nucleation is, yeah, is for the eyes. So I need to enucleate. Enucleate. Wow, that's hard to say. Enucleate. <laughs> Someone's going to come into chat now and just be like, what on earth is he talking about? <laughs> oh, thank you. I appreciate the lurk. Thank you very much. You need to get ready for bed for work. I completely agree. I completely appreciate that. I, I need to do the same as well. Pop in when you're streaming again. You have an incredibly soothing voice. Thank you. I appreciate that. <laughs> I really appreciate that. That makes, me, that makes me really nice. Thanks, Whiskey Pits. I hope you have an absolutely wonderful night. Thank you. Uh, do we need to pick this up again? Do I need to know the umbrella, why umbrella is going to murder a lot of researchers? As a as a researcher by trade, I don't particularly enjoy that prospect. Right, let's go out here. And then let's use this code. Now, according to the trustworthy Wikipedia... A nucleation is a removal of the eye that leaves the eye muscles and remaining orbital contents intact. What? Because otherwise it's just digging for gold? Uh, oh, there we go. The American keypad. You've entered the pass number. I have never done this in my many years of gaming. I didn't realize this was a thing. I've never been in here. Oh my god, now I know why. Oh no, wait. What, what is this? Zombie? Oh wait. That's. <laughs> Let's just take a breath. It's one zombie. Not a hunter. It's two zombies. It's one zombie. <laughs> Are you still alive? I'll waste one of these. I don't know if you're still alive. This is unusual. What on earth is this? Oh, get off! Absolutely. That's it. Goal. Sports ball goal. High fives all round. What's is there anything over here? No. Am I injured now? I'm on caution. Just use that. It's only got one green herb in it. It's fine. We'll top ourselves up. Let's just reload as well. Not that one. I've been dead for quite a while, you know? Kind of impaled in the team zombie. <laughs> kind of implied in the team zombie. Uh, that was like a spooky shadow on the wall up there. That was like a, a creepy humanoid shadow. I can't believe I've never been here. Oh, hello. Smile. <laughs> Thanks, mate. <laughs> Love the bits nearly hitting the camera. That was awesome. Ooh, herbs. Yum, 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 yum. Get out your grinders. I need to grind up some herbs. Time to crush up your leaves. Uh, combine those two. Will you mix the herbs? Imagine if the bits did hit the camera and stick their blocking vision. I mean, that would be okay for that one screen, but if it did it for the rest of the game, I'd be very unhappy. I've never been in this room either. I don't know where we're going. This is an adventure, isn't it? I This is new territory for me. Where even are we? <laughs> oh, we're here. How did we get here? So I've never been in any of this. 
This is wild. Cheese. <laughs> to left. Wait, oh, set time out. Where are we going? <laughs> I don't know what we're doing. This, this doesn't seem... I'm going to come back here. This seems very unsafe. You're supposed to be our tour guide. I, I'm trying. <laughs> this is just... Maybe this is stuff you see later. Maybe I've just found a, a shortcut to. Oh, wait. Let me see what the... Did the map just reveal something new? Because that will have been a room in the map, right? That will have been something. But I don't know where that would have been. Mansion basement. Oh, I wonder if that's the, a shortcut to the lab. Wait, wait, I recognize that that scene. Is this a thing on the ground? This is a thing on the ground. It's an herb. I actually don't have the space for it because I don't know if I'm going to pick up anything story related here. So let me just... Get back to you real quick on that. What is through? What? Oh, hello. Oh, I missed. Depth perception super hard. Uh, let's go this way. Uh, this way. Two point seven three out of ten. Horrible tour. Would not even return to the mansion. Would not return to the mansion. Steve wouldn't either. Be got eaten by the zombies. This kind of stuff. Uh. Pow. Right, where on earth am I? I vaguely recognise the library. Yes, because this is a disc, isn't it? No, it's a scrapbook. What on earth am I doing? Animal attack. Woman mutilated. Uh, May 20th, around 10pm. A 20-year-old woman's... A 20-year-old young woman's body was found by a passerby on the left bank of the Marble River in the cider district of Raccoon City. Raccoon police assume it to be a grizzly or other animals doing because there are teeth marks along her mutilated arms and left foot that show considerable power. She, since she was wearing a hiking boot on her remaining foot, it has been determined that she was attacked in the Arkley Mountains and fell into the river. They are hurrying to identify this woman. Monsters in Arkley Mountains. Some people claim they've seen monsters in the Arkley Mountains. The monsters are supposedly about the same size as a large dog and usually run in packs as wolves do. This may sound like a group of ordinary wild dogs, but these monsters are surprisingly fierce and hard to hurt. They say these dogs won't bother you unless you wake them, so the smart readers should so you smart readers should stay out of the Arkley Mountains for the time being. But if you're looking for adventure, check it out. You wanna try? The media. Oh my god. Mystery on Arkley Mountains. Mountain road blocked. Due to successive disasters in Arkley Mountains, the city authorities have decided to block the road leading to the foothills. At the same time, Raccoon Police intend to begin a search for lost people with the help of the STARS team's members. They expect great difficulty because of the vast size of the Arkley Mountains and the, prime and the primeval forest that covers most of the area. Uh, I can read, I promise. Um, also, people are still reporting sightings of grotesque monsters in the mountains. Cool. A scrapbook. Someone was collecting them. Most of them are on biology and chemistry. Makes sense. Oh, hello. I can move you. Uh... I've moved you wrong, though. I've done a bad. I I did it wrong. Can I move this this way now? Yeah. Oh, nearly. Oh no! I'll have to go out and come back in. 
Uh, also, I was wrong. Director's cut added new camera angles, clothes, and changed item and enemy locations, but no crimson heads. They were only added in the Game Boy, uh, Game Boy, GameCube remake. Do you know why I said Game Boy? Because I, I had a delivery from eBay today. Let me just pause a second. I had a delivery from eBay today of The Legend of Zelda, A Link to the Past on Game Boy. Come on, camera, you can zoom in. There we go. To play on Super Game Boy. And a really rare Mega Drive game called Soliel, which is quite difficult to get hold of, which is why it looks fucking terrible, because it needs cleaning. But... Yeah, it's a weird game where you befriend animals. I think Dark Saber 2K played it for a, what, his birthday recently, um, and I've wanted a copy forever. And I finally found one at a decent price on eBay, so I was like, "Purchase, just purchase now. It's fine." The desk is locked. But will you use the lockpick as the master of unlocking? You have used the lockpick. Congratulations, master of unlocking. Is it gun food? It's gun food. Yes, they stack. Lovely. <laughs> Uh, there was an attempt at making um, Resident Evil on Game Boy Color. Yeah, well, you say recently. Recently subjective, right? <laughs> His birthday was like two. He's like two months away. Okay, last birthday. <laughs> two months in the future. Ten months in the past. I still think COVID was recently. So, <laughs> yeah, within the last decade, I'm that old. I'm recently equals five to ten years old. <laughs> What? Oh, wait, I need to go back in. I really don't remember this library. Unless I have actually forgotten it and I get an important story item here. This may all be just bonus content that I've never seen. Missable content. Let's move this this way. Haha! -ha. We've got another door. Where are we? Uh... Oh, so this just this just goes to a secret room on the map. I have no idea. What's this? An ink ribbon. Yeah, sure, go on then. We actually do need that, so. What's on here? Oh, a clip. I can't carry anymore. So make a note, there's a clip in this room. Oh, this feels horrible. Uh, I can look over the courtyard from here. It's a helicopter port. If I could contact the other members from there. What? What? I've never seen that in my life. Okay, cool. Alrighty then. Good. Good room. We got an ink ribbon, and there's a clip in there as well. I think we might be okay for Barretta Ramo at the minute. <laughs> Excuse me. I'm not 100% certain, but I think we might be okay. Let's go check out the other mystery room. Which undoubtedly has shamblers in it. Oh, I don't like all these corners. Okay, what on earth? Is that a beehive? Is that is this a bust? There's a switch where you push it. I just got a notification from Brian Giselle the Cheshire Snail. <laughs> Firstly, I love that username, but secondly, thank you very much for following. I appreciate it. Welcome in. <laughs> I'm not pressing no mystery switch. I've never been here before. I don't know what it does. Let's just move this out of the way. What's over here? I'm gonna I'm gonna need that statue. I don't even know where it goes. It has not been used for a long time. Just like this room. It's a pleasure to have you, uh, Giselle. Thank you for uh, thank you for coming in. What is? Oh, is this gonna be? Wait, let's just find out, right? Let's, as they say, let's uh, wait. Let's think about this clever now. Let's try and be clever about this. What if I was to push this over here? Because it's obviously a movable statue, and there's something that looks interactable over here. So I might need this over here. So if I do that. And then 
Also, if this, if this like slides up or backwards or outwards or something like that, then, then something horrible's there. That might block it. <laughs> Who knows? Sure, let's press the mystery switch. Oh, it lit up. Oh, it's a space indicator. Oh, now I fucked it. Oh, no, I haven't fucked it. It's fine. Have I? Have I? No, good. Well, thank God, Jill. <laughs> you came on the raid. Nice and teeny, the spooky 13th. Yay! I kept forgetting it was Friday the 13th. So this channel, for anyone who's come on the raid or anyone who's found me sort of just naturally, this channel is dedicated to horror gaming. Now, we play various weird and wonderful indie horror games, mainstream horror games throughout the year. Um, but for Halloween, I like playing a theme. So I like I like it being a themed uh, game or streams. So last year, it was the Silent Hill games. We played through all the Silent Hill games, which was mwah, absolutely fantastic. This year, it's Resident Evil. So we're going to be playing this to completion. Then we're going to be playing uh, Resident Evil 2 on original hardware, 3 on original hardware up until the end of halloween and then wherever we get to we get to basically odd angle flapping after you pushed it being shown in front. yeah it was a bit weird wasn't it a switch i have my finger over the aim button oh, i'm okay i'm mostly okay i've never seen this bit before this is wild but anyone who's following, anyone who wants to check out the channel, it's absolutely fine. There's no pressure to do so, obviously, but I'm glad you're here. I'm genuinely pleased that you're here. I, uh, I like creating this space so people can enjoy horror games. I can't carry any more items. What, what even was that? That was a disc. Is that the M MD disc? MO disc? The master operating disc that I need at the end of the game? Have I just completely blanked this entire section? I don't know. You tell me, Jack. You tell me. Uh, let's go back to a storeroom. Because I feel like I'm spelunking into the unknown right now. Oh, God. There's more doors off of this, isn't there? There's more unknowns. There's more unknown unknowns. Yeah. Uh, ah, maybe that's a save room. That's a small room that we've not been in yet. Did we kill all the zombies in here? Yeah, good. Whew. That would have been embarrassing. <laughs> that would have been real embarrassing. This doesn't feel like a save room. This isn't a save room. A battery. Now I can move the elevator in the courtyard. Can't carry it, though. This, I clearly yeah. must come here a different way because I've never had that cutscene with Barry where he drops another rope down. What this? Talk to me. I can't carry any more items. Right, I need to do an item run. Much as I love inventory management, because um, I, I genuinely, uh, I need to go dump some inventory. I hate I can't move my items around. Like the layout really is really quite disturbing for me. Because like look, like. I'd like my, this ammo up here and usable items in the same space. That makes sense. I could use the herbs. I mean, I could. I ain't gonna, but I could. Uh, there's a blue herb there. I think we killed everything in here. That, yeah, we play football with that guy's head over here, which is good. Good. Nothing surprise. No, no hunter surprise, which is nice because the hunters absolutely fucking do one uh and uh, that's this room yeah good so where's the nearest save room it is downstairs but there is also two hunters down there as well so i'm kind of juggling my life there we, have, we haven't explored what's down in the left uh no go on we will equip this just in case i get caught just in case I get in a spot of bother and I need to set everything on fire because that, kids, is how you take care of your problems in real life. It's not really. Don't actually do that. <laughs> There's a lot of life lessons in this that you definitely shouldn't follow. When in doubt, set fire to it. Hi. You shitbag. You fucking... I hate this game. I hate this game. I miss auto aim. All of us collectively now miss auto aim. I'm telling you. Uh, right. 
dump. Oh no, we could use this and go get the magnum. Oh, that would be useful. We don't need to do that now though. We can do that when we've got more time. Uh, we'll dump this. We'll reload that. I think we still need this. I'm not sure why though. But when we don't need it anymore, it will tell us. We only have one flame round left, so that's pretty pointless, I gotta be honest. Uh, combine that with that. I was just thinking to myself if we could get, go and get the magnum now because we're really close to it. We could. We could. I don't remember how many magnum bullets the hunters take. Yeah, I can't remember how many magnum bullets. I don't know if it's worth it because they only take two grenades, but like three or four shotgun shells. So if I go out, I'll run back out. How many items do we need to pick up? One, two, three, four, I think. Right, let me put this away. Cool. And we're not going to need that right now, just in case I've missed an item. So we're going to go back to that that spot where we were a second ago. Uh, ooh, feels feels horrible without a thingy. It's Digi Inferno. I've got your sound effect. Digi Inferno. Wait, bear with me. Bear with me. It's Digi Inferno. They're not fucking playing. Ah! It's Digi Inferno. There you go. Only Digi Inferno gets that sound effect. <laughs> For no reason other than the fact that I did it randomly one day and I wanted to use the MLG horn. And Digi Inferno was the first person who said hello. So Digi Inferno now gets the MLG horn every single time. <laughs> oh, God! Stairs. It's always stairs. How you doing, Digi? How's your Friday treating you? Uh, it's this way. Being known as Hellcop says, it's the big feet. That's what does it. It's like Ed 209 from Robocop. It's like, I can't, can't do the steps. <laughs> Still alive. Already missing the scorching heat of the summer. I hope you're doing well. I'm doing all right. Yeah, it's been a good week. It's been a, it's been a solid week. So I'm doing really well. I've got some good, exciting news, people. I've got some good, exciting news. I've got, I've, I've rejigged my video editing workflow, and I've got so many videos to upload. <laughs> It's untrue. <laughs> so if you check out the exclamation mark socials command, you can check out. I currently upload to two YouTube channels. One is the Screaming at a Joypad channel, which is nothing but edited horror stuff. Oh, thanks, Digi Inferno. Um, nothing but edited horror stuff. And the other is the Peripheral Mic YouTube channel, which is directed connected directly to this Twitch channel. So all the raw VODs go there. And uh, there's also just random game streams and things like that. But yeah, I've got a lot of stuff queued up. Uh, including lots of shorts. Shorts, TikToks, Instagram reels, that sort of thing. Little clips from random games that we've played. Yeah, there's there's a lot. Uh, this way, I think. So if that's your bag, that's your bag. I've got you covered. I'm all over it. Uh, has been a bit all over the place and has a visitor from his best friend has a visitor from his best friend currently really cool you have a visitor of, oh, so like of your best friend is that what you mean that your best friend is visiting you that's cool my best friend visited me a little while ago it was really nice to spend some time with him we've not spent some time one-on-one -on -one in 10 years give or take like, it's been a long time, and just being able to chill out with him over the weekend, it was just super nice. And just do loads of nerdy shit. Like, we went to Warhammer World, and we were, I bought a, a new version of Warhammer Quest, and uh, we bought loads of stuff from, like, Forbidden Planet, and tons of retro shit. So, he's one of the people that, because um, in his part of the world, I'm not going to give you too many details, obviously, but in his part of the uh, part of the world, uh, he will look in uh, retro game shops for me. So, every now and then, I'll get, like, a random photo message off him on, like, a Sunday morning when he's taking his daughter out. 
um where he's like i saw this and i didn't know if you wanted it so i'll be like yeah uh, yes that one please thank you i will give you the money i'll wire you the money now if you if you are still nearby that would be fantastic <laughs> he's good he's very good people uh right let's get this disc i'm sure we had something else being picked. oh no it's the blue herb we picked up the ammo disc. so we do come here that's we need that right at the end is this notes for the disc Nope, apparently not. Okay, cool. I'm just expected to know what to do with that. Cool. Uh, check it. Check every item in a Resident Evil game. At least once. It seems to be a startup disc. Yum. It seems to be a startup disc. Do you not want to know what it says on the post-it on it? Because <laughs> I, I would. I know it seems to be a startup disc. Can I not zoom? Is that what I think? I do. It says boot boot disk system bootable bootable system that's what it says I think it says that I'm not sure uh, right then. right let's let's be having this elevator let's go down this lift Oh, we never climbed down the rope again, did we? In Yawn's uh, piano room. Oh, oh, there was this as well, wasn't there? It was the dark corner of herb growth. I mean, if you can trust anything, it's herbs growing in a dark, damp corner of a mansion. Uh, sure, why not? Let's. No, I want to go back to the thing. I want to go back to Yawn's piano room. Uh, this way. Ooh, tank controls. Ooh, tank controls. Right. I I genuinely um, have given this some thought, Camus. So Camus has raised a very good point. Now, I wonder about iconography. Like, what would be a proper, recognisable icon for saving for newer generations? Because a floppy disk would mean nothing to most youngsters nowadays. There was a viral video a, a while ago. I, I don't know how real it was, but there was a viral video where people showed youngsters. I say youngsters. Uh, people of the... Uh, is it? No, I'm not Gen Z. Um, yeah, maybe it is Gen Z. I can't remember. People who were basically in high school, right? School and high school, they showed them a floppy disk from like an old, an old uh, like Amiga or something like that on PC. I say Amiga because that was my first personal computer, right? Don't, don't judge me. Don't at me. Um, and they were like, oh, why have you 3D printed the save icon? Like, that's what they recognize as the save icon. Uh, ah, you still have a video too? Good. I'm not making it up. Fantastic. See, chat? <laughs> See, internet? I don't make this stuff up. I just embellish. That's what I do. I embellish. Let's just see if we can nip in here. Um, so I, that, I work in tech research, right? Uh, so I, I think about this sort of stuff every now and then. And I'm thinking, I'm wondering if it's going to be the... You know, the download symbol, like there's just an arrow pointing to like a, a, a parentheses on its on its back, basically is the only way I can just describe it. I think that's going to be the new save icon, um, because if you're on an iDevice, that's the save icon. That's just the icon you use to save. Uh, and I think that's going to be, um, there's going to be a phasing out of the save icon because developers now making very big software very big very uh, well used software will use the save icon as we know and love it but future generations let's say in 15 years right not even that give them enough time to graduate get their degrees graduate um get a job in tech and become a lead developer on a project for a software company that, that runs the world like adobe or sony or something like that right or apple suddenly there's going to be a new refresh of icons because those icons will be meaningless. So yeah, I think it's going to be whatever Apple have as the save icon is I think that's that's going to be what, what people will use. Right, well, that felt very serious. <laughs> uh, now let's get back to fun and frivolity, shall we? Uh, fun and frolics and shooting zombies in bollocks. Uh, right, where are we going? Oh, I'm going back to Yon's room. That's what I'm doing. Thanks, guys. 
Thank you. Uh, should we let these go back all the way? What if I go up there and around there? Did I come through? Yes, I came through the main hall upstairs when uh, Whiskey Pits was here. So that should be clear. Well, that one side should be clear of hunters. So if I go upstairs here. Honest to God, thought the noise I just heard was a cat trying to get into the room. It's not. It's the disc in the PlayStation going absolutely mental. <laughs> and these are good headphones as well. Like, I, I can't... I can't really hear anything outside of these headphones, but I can certainly hear that disc. <laughs> That's why the title of the stream is for better or worse, because at one point, one of these games is going to die on us. I can feel it. Either the disc or the... Um, station itself. But I mean it's holding out so far, so Right, quick oh no, I know I'm going up. Go this way. Cross my fingers and my toes. Yeah suck it, hunter boy. You're a shit triple H ripoff. You're only one H go through here then go through that door and then i think yeah i think i know where i'm going one of the things that blew my mind when i played the remaster was not having loading screens on um the stairs <laughs> i was just like that's insane <laughs> i'm so conditioned to having them uh now i need to go that away yes Second door on the right, round the corner. Good. No! Fuck off, you bastard. I'm having none of this. What? No loading screens on doors? Oh, Jesus. Wait. You respawn? You shit! Did I did I not come this way originally? I don't think I came this way. Did I? I think I'm fucked. I think I fucked myself. <laughs> well, let's find out. Three, four. It's four. It's four. Is how many you need? Never mind a double tap, you just need four in the back. Uh that means No, we killed we killed the... Oh no, we didn't kill that one, did we? I didn't want to waste the ammo. That was it. That sounds like a smart move. That sounds like a Smith tactic. Like a Smith strategy. Right, I wanna know what's down this hole. Because now I can't remember. <laughs> They respawned with their bums facing you, so you're standing downwind from danger. I'll take the back end rather than the front end of a hunter any day. <laughs> ah, there's a rope. Cool. So you can still climb down it once Barry's rescued you. That's good. Good, good. What this? There's a switch below. Will you push it? Sure. Why is there what looks like a tomb buried underneath this piano room? There's a ladder. Sure. What is the rope tied to? And why why wasn't the first one tied around it? Yeah. <laughs> oh no. This is not good music. Oh hi. I'm gonna I'm gonna go back here so I get a better depth perception. Say cheese. Say suck a shotgun. This music is unnecessarily tense. I'm not gonna lie, this music is very unnecessarily tense. <laughs> There another one? There's another one. Gotcha. 
hot tip for you there. If you're close to a zombie with a shotgun, just point up and you'll get a headshot nearly every time. Ah, gun food. Just what I needed. My shotgun was getting peckish. Speaking of a shotgun, uh, combine a Shellius. The, the, the spell you cast in uh, Resident Evil to reload. It's not really, I'm making it up. You can tell I'm, I'm nervous. I'm walking instead of running. Go through the door. Dumb, 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 dumb. Oh, oh, good. Squishy noise. Oh, good. Another squishy noise. Oh. You guys seem busy. Ow. Absolutely f get fogged. Hello. Excuse me, sir. Sir? Sir? I'd like to talk to you. Have you uh, been injured at work recently? Would you like to? <laughs> Good. Herbs that have definitely not been splattered with zombie blood. Definitely not been splattered copiously with zombie blood. Let's just take those. Let's just eat those. They'll be fine for us. They were. They were in sync. They were definitely in sync with their with their nomming. Um, Zomnoms. Uh, let's go this way, I guess. Oh, oh, sorry, my mistake, Captain. It's been splattered with human blood by zombies. <laughs> It's the difference between cooking humans and cooking for humans. <laughs> it's an excellent ancient Simpsons reference for you there. This is a very bright room. I have a feeling something's gonna try and kill me in here. What's in here? It's a dusty, it's dusty. No, it's a dusty, <laughs> it's dusty. It has not been used for a long time, okay. Would you quit with the tense music? Cooking for humans could be laborious. Yeah, absolutely. An oven. It's badly rusted and does not seem to work. It's not an oven. It's a microwave. Uh, well, I guess they are called microwave ovens, aren't they? So. Oh, good. Good. A cutscene. I was going to say, it's locked. You can't come in. Is that a hunter? I had very big fingers for a hunter, no claws. Oh, it's just a zombie! Fuck <laughs> hell. <laughs> Who cooks for humans anyway? I always cook them. I like them with garlic sauce. Everything goes well with garlic sauce. <laughs> Everything. A freezer it has not been used in a long time. Why is there a carpet on that? Go into open doors. Your safe rooms are now perilous. Oh, that reminds me of the Resident Evil 3 remake where the, there was a rumor when it was coming out that the tyrant, the nemesis, could open the safe room doors. Because the nemesis is an enemy, for anyone who doesn't know, in uh, Resident Evil 3 that follows you through doors. Groundbreaking stuff for Resident Evil, especially when you, you realize, actually, I'm now terrified of this because this has broken every trope that I know, every mechanical trope I know of Resident Evil so far. Um, yeah, there was, a, there was a rumor that it could open the doors. And there is one bit where you're in the safe room and it opens the door and leans in and then leans out and closes the door. And it scared the shit out of me when I first had that happen. Because <laughs> I'm like, you're not allowed in here. This is a safe space. Wasn't the Resident Evil 2 Tyrant similar? It's been. I think the Resident Evil 2... So the Nemesis was definitely Resident Evil 3 because it's called Resident Evil 3 Nemesis. I knew you were alive, you fucking prick. And now you're dead. Mr. X. Yes, it might have been Mr. X. It was definitely a... Oh, oh, this is where we were. We we're stupid. This is where we, where we were earlier. It's, um... But no, the Nemesis was... I think Mr. X is new for the remake, I believe. 
I don't think there was a Mr. X in the original. There was a tyrant. There was a nemesis, which is different to Mr. X. I think. I can't remember. We'll find out while we play it, to be honest with you. I'm very surprised I didn't have a cutscene. That didn't have a thingy. Where are we now? And there's no, no enemies in this bit. And there's also no lighting either. So I don't know if there's stuff trapped in corners. Uh, the elevator doesn't seem to stop on this floor. Oh, okay. Fine. Mr. X was a really good inclusion in the Resident Evil 2 remake. Like, that was that was good, because you would definitely... Uh, there was definitely a Mr. X in the OG Resident Evil 2. Was there really? Yeah, I'm obviously just misremembering it. Oh, I, I gotta go. I don't know where I'm going, but I don't want to fight that hunter. What's that? I don't remember Mr. X in RE2. You just watched RE2? Oh, wow. I... I've no problem being wrong. It's been decades since I played it. It's been decades since I played this, so. Oh, I don't want to fight this thing. Two. Three. Damn it. Oh, there's two of them. Run, 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 run. This is too dangerous. This is too dangerous. We don't have the guns. We don't have the weaponry. We are out. That corridor is now burned to us. We just use that. We'll be fine. We don't... That corridor doesn't exist. <laughs> we can never go back in that corridor. Oh, we're right near the Magnum. Uh, where's the nearest safe room? The nearest safe room is over there. Okay. Uh, reload. Reload shotgun. Oh, I forgot there's one in here. Ow. No, you don't. Two. Come on, bullets. Come on, bullets. No, go into the menu. Reload that way. Go, quick, go. Menu. Take the herb. Ow. You made of, like, Kevlar, you bastard. I got two more of you. I'm just gonna have to run past these. Genuinely, I'm just gonna have to run past them. Hope for the best. Hope for the best. Hope for the best. Prep for the worst. Go. It's officially squeaky bum time. We reached that point. It is officially squeaky bum time. Uh, right, what are we doing? We're doing the red jewel. Thank you, thank you. Thanks, Brian. If I recall correctly, the time Mr. X Monaco wasn't in game. It was just a nickname uh, in other materials. So there was a a tyrant that followed you from room to room in Resident Evil Two. Uh, what the fuck am I doing? Uh, Resident Evil Two was Bob and Tim. <laughs> I'm getting the Magnum. And I'm also questioning many life choices in regards to these fucking hunters. <laughs> Combino Patronus. Combino Patronus. I also need to heal as well, because I'm dying. Oh, no. I'm not dying, dying. I need some mixed herbs. Give me some mixed herbs. That'll do. Yoink. Also, a little chocolate. Katmus, I'm so glad you're here. I genuinely am. I just sometimes I do I do genuinely think sometimes chat's main purpose in doing these streams is to keep me fucking alive. <laughs> uh whoa, hello. How? Uh, bye bye. Ow my ankles. Oh I love I never oh, I've obviously noticed this before, but I never realised they get like blood on their claws when they attack you. That's a nice touch. There's not one in here now because I killed it. Oh, I missed an item, didn't I? Oh, I missed the 
grenade rounds, the bazooka rounds, and the other bit. What a fluff nugget. Right, use that. Yep, pick that up. Thanks. Oh, and the battery! Oh, God damn it. Completely forgot about the battery. Right, let's go Let's go back there now. Because we can get there reasonably easy from here. I've just got to go through that horrible corridor. Not that horrible corridor, a different horrible corridor. Because most of the corridors are horrible, but... Ah, well. Uh, we just need to go through the corridor with two of them, which actually is a good, be a good road test for the python, uh, for the cold python. Because I'm pretty sure this might be a one-hit kill thing for most, for most enemies. I remember if you complete it in under an hour and a half, you get unlimited ammunition for the cold python. You fucker! I'm out. It's not one hit kill. <laughs> it's not one hit kill, and I turn like I've got a broken wheel. <laughs> I'm out completely. And now I'm on caution. Now I have no heals. You fuck. Uh, this is the elevator that doesn't go this way. Right. Okay. And this is the way to the kitchen. And the kitchen... The kitchen bone is connected to the lift bone. The lift bone is connected to the battery bone. Never follow me for anatomical advice. Um, it's this way. And then this way. Because we went in this earlier. But I need to go back in this now because it takes back to where I was. I know. I, 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 we got this. I know what I'm doing. You know what you're doing. I know what I'm doing. We we got this. Good door. Um. Uh, right. I think it was this way. I think. No, it wasn't. How else would a cat learn human anatomy? <laughs> it was this way. It was in the little room that I hoped was a save room and wasn't. This one. That's where it was. It's in here. Un battery. battery and boom rounds which is exactly what we need to kill some hunters I can't believe I wasted three magnum bullets it must just be two bullets for them with a magnum uh, we got the ink ribbon in the clip from the library Got the disc. Yeah. I think that's everything here, isn't it? This might be the clearest way. I'm going to go put these 
rounds away because we're going to pass a storeroom in a second. Again, two tents. This this is two tents, guys. Uh, is it this way? No. Yes. No. Maybe. Now I'm lost. <laughs> No, it was this way. No, no, no. This is where the ladder is. Yes, I'll climb it. Go on. Go, go on, then. Seems you've given me literally no other option. Hey, dangly rope. PNG. There's a rope. We climb it. Yeah, sure. This is mysteriously connected rope. Good, good. So that really is just a shortcut, right? That's what that is. Jum 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 jum. All I can hear is the the disc moving. Actually got hold of the silver shroud costume for Fallout 4, which really looks like Mr. Ace's trench coat. Nice. Uh, right, storeroom. It's amazing. Since up upgrading my PC's CPU, I've had no errors on OBS. So, oh, that's the content you tune in for, isn't it? Jeez, I bet you're all excited about that. Oh. Uh, let's go sort our inventory out. Now, where am I going? Um, I'm going to go back to the courtyard because I have the battery. But I think I also need the crank. Something is telling me I need the crank. Uh, no, I need that. Atmos, for fuck's sake. <laughs> Uh, I've completely lost my train of thought. I don't know what I'm doing now. I need the crank. Not a word, Gamus. <laughs> uh, crank, right. There we go. This is the square crank, right? Because there's more than one. Its end is square shaped. I would see a doctor about that. Right. Yes, sure. We don't really have a lot of grenade rounds left, I'll be honest with you. Are you posting on Discord? Excellent. I'll check it out a bit. Thank you, Echo. And obviously, if anyone new is here and would like to join the Discord, you're more than welcome to. It's a pretty chill place to hang out in between uh, in between streams. Um, there is a command, exclamation mark, uh, Discord, so you can check that out. Thank you, Echo. I appreciate that. How do I get to the thing? Uh, uh, I need to get back to the shed. How do I get to the shed? I need to get... <laughs> this feels far too complicated. Where is it? Cameras, there's no, there's absolutely no pressure to join the Discord server. People just like being able to not just chat with each other, but, you know, it's where I'll post um, pictures of retro game finds and just pictures of the cats as well, that sort of thing. Uh, it's the best place. I, I use that rather than social media, but I can completely understand. I'm a member of like three or four Discord servers and that feels quite hectic to me. So I can only understand that if you've got, a, if every streamer has a Discord server, then it's going to be, it's going to be pretty headache inducing. So there's no, there's absolutely no pressure for anyone to join. Um, we go that away. And then that away. No, that's that's the path to Dick Bittington, um, the guy who got bit by the snake. You're on twelve servers already. That's mental. I mean, obviously you you have joined them for reasons, right? Uh, mine's normally like tech support stuff. Weirdly, um, I'm a member of the analog server, um, and uh, the there's an Evercade server as well for people who. Uh, 
this is super boring stuff but people who write homebrew games for newer consoles i am learning to write a homebrew game and it's that's not something that i'm announcing it's just i am i am working on a game at the minute uh and it's i'm learning stuff from people in the industry on that server so it's one of those things that i'll check in every now and then i'll just catch up and then i'll just kind of i'll ignore it for three months um shed that's what i need i need the shed where's the shed 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 is there oh so i went the wrong way ha 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 ah silly smith silly silly smith Richard Aiken. Yeah, bit dick. Bit dick. That's what I said. Nothing else. <laughs> Bitus dickus. Oh, God. I've lost my uh, ability to check maps in my head now. It is this way. Oh, there's our hunter here, isn't there? Unless I killed it. Oh, I killed it. Lovely. Wow. Well. Oh, and I just fancy. Ah, uh, the dog noises. Lovely. Lovely, lovely. I am in 73 servers. My God, Echo. My God. That is, you take the award for most Discord servers ever. I'm in nowhere near that. Uh, this way? We're gonna go round. I need to. I might need to kill these dogs. Someone likes pain. These these dogs will get in my way quite considerably if I try and do this. Not these dogs. These dogs are fine. These doggos can stay there. Nineteen of the MMO related. That I don't pay too much attention to MMO related. Wow. Do you play a lot of MMOs, Echo? You could have just taken the ladder like a normal person, then. That would have been an option as well. Oh, snacks. 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 Badoom. Star Wars, Elder Scrolls, and WoW. I never played WoW. Right, where does this battery go? Is it? Is this the other lift I need? No, that's not the other lift I need. It? It's these dogs that are going to be pain with that. Pain with them. Come here, bum pain pop. Sorry. Got him. Oh, which is good, because I'm about to die. That's the... That's the badger. The battery is pulled out. God, put the battery in there. Oh, So we're now in uncharted territory. It's a map of the garden. Sure. Why not? Is this the garden? This is the garden. Lovely. I have just come in there. It's a doggo. Oh, I'm here. I'm near the shed. Can I pick these up without you killing me? Please. I Oh it's blue. No, why are you blue? Don't be blue. I gotta run now. <laughs> that dog was super chill. Like I I expected to die there, I'm not gonna lie. I suppose I could need two servers. Uh one was for Outer Wilds. Outer Wilds? What a game Outer Wilds is. Oh. 
Uh, and another sort of funding campaign for a kitty with cancer. Oh no. Oh no. Oh. That gave me a little sad. I am dicing with death right here. Do I have the bullets for this? Yeah, I should do. My god, right. Is this other one a green herb? Or are you both blue? Dabba dee dabba die. You're both blue, you're both shit. Go get fucked. Uh Wait, what, what? What is my end game here? Oh, I, I think I know. So now I've cleared all that out. Oh my god, this is so dark. Are there any other herbs in corners? Herbs in corners. Hello and welcome back to Herbs in Corners. Today we find Jill Valentine desperately searching for something to heal the great gaping wound in her side. A simple green herb will do. Maybe some basil or some oregano. Just a sprinkle on the wound, season it if you will, and to heal her right up. Oh, I didn't turn the corner. Right, crank it real good. The other nine are Twitch and YouTube content creators, and the final one is... Tectonica, a game currently in development. Hello, sir, citizen unknown. How you doing? Good to have you here. So that raises the water again, which is, I mean, I guess fine. Dogs are still going off on one. Now I can go back. <coughs> and now there's no doggies here, which is good. There's also no heal Healy Bobs, which is bad, because I'm at danger level definite. Good. I honestly didn't even know this was here. Um, right, now I can take this down, go back. There we go. So what's down here now? Now that I've turned that off. Oh, that will stop the waterfall, won't it? God, we're smart. Yeah, that will stop the water. Wait, hang on. Now the, the dogs aren't a thing anymore. Are there any any herbs? Um, I could do with an herb. Just, I mean, one will do me. I'm, I'm one stubbed toe away from death. Nope, apparently not. Okay, there's a ladder. Will you descend it? Sure thing. This seems like... Don't miss a rung, Jill. You'll die. <laughs> I have a horrible feeling about this. A horrible, horrible feeling. I think I know what's down here. Oh, Jill, what good timing. Not you. A moment ago, I heard someone's voice coming from this hole. Let's go together since it's dark and we can't see very well. I don't think I ever had this. Okay, sure. let's go. Okay, then I'm going to cover you. Let's hurry. He's here since I waited for him on right? the poop. I can go first if you want me to. Really? That's a story thing. No, I'm good. Okay, let's go, Barry. I'm depending on you. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, Buzzer. If he didn't wait, he wouldn't be here. Really? I had no idea that was a thing. Fucking, I've just remembered there's different endings to this. <laughs> Literally, I've just remembered there's multiple endings. This must be a branching thing. 
Like, this must have something to do with the different endings. In one of them, everyone's... Everyone's... Oh, my God. Uh, right, which way am I going? Um, let's go this way. There's, there's not a lot of any monsters this way. Come on, Bazaar. feels ominous. It feels turbo ominous. Oh, good. Good lad, Barry. So it is two magnum bullets. Good. Oh, man. This is this has unlocked a new appreciation of Barry. I remember seeing an ending where Jill, Barry, Chris, and Rebecca are escaping alive, along with Brad, of course. Oh, I'm scared of this corner. This feels like a Is bad that Jill? Moment. Is that voice Enrico's? I forgot about Enrico. Yeah? You're alive! Wait there! Are you with anybody, Jill? What? Oh, yes. Enrico. So, Barry and Jill together. Are you all right, Enrico? The stars are doomed. Someone is a traitor. Dun, dun, dun. Everything was plotted from the start by Umbrella. Ha! What the fuck? <gasps> Enrico! Did he just... Did he just do what I think he did? Oh no, someone... Okay, someone shot him. He couldn't have moved because of this injury. He's holding something. <laughs> Loot that buddy. Loot that buddy. Loot that buddy. He's not going to need it. Loot that buddy. Barry is investigating. Good. Barry is investigating. Nothing else? Okay. Like how they don't bother to go immediately check the direction of the shotgun. Yeah, no, th there's no sort of like, who's there? Hold, don't, don't go anywhere. No, nothing like that. I have to now go do that without Barry's assistance, without my Burton shield. I swear to Christ. If oh, hello. I was going to say, if there's a hunter in here, I'm just going to run back. <laughs> Must have been the wind. <laughs> Will you take the crank? Yes. Not only want to take the crank, I will investigate the crank. No, not combine. I'm not I'm not cranking twice. Not a word. Uh the end is hex shaped. There we go. Uh, that uh, differentiates those two. Oh, right. Well, is it is, can I go get Barry now? Is he coming with me? I, I quite like his unlimited ammo. Barry's investigating. No, fine. Okay. I'm on my own. Let's hope I just accidentally stumble across a box full of fade sprays. Better doubt it. Shit. Fuck! Run! Run, 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 run! <laughs> Hello. 
reload them. Primus. Oh, there is one in there. There is. Shit. No. No. Okay, so. Let's do a bit of a recap. We had what I would consider to be one of our worst sessions last time, right? And it's okay to say that. It's okay to own that. But basically, we went about 40 minutes forward and then died because I was greedy and I didn't realize I was quite that far forward. Um, so we had to do loads of backtracking and loads of catching up. And now we're in a position where we, funnily enough, are back where we were before we died. So we're now kind of, it's not like the last time didn't happen, but it's, we're now back to a good reset point. The bad thing about that is that there's no ink ribbons. Almost at all. <laughs> I checked a guide. I was like, last session, I was like, okay, I'll come off and then I will go and I'll get off stream. I'll go and get an ink ribbon. Loaded up. Had a wander around. No ink ribbons. Had a look on a guide. Searched for the term ink ribbon. No ink ribbons nearby. Uh, in fact, I think we may have collected them all and I think we may have used them all. <laughs> nice. I like it. Question results. I like it a lot. So, what we're going to do this time? Yes, excuse me. I'm I'm just snacking on chocolate chocolate peanuts because they are they are crack. Good evening, sir. How are you? I trust everyone's doing well. How's that sound, wise? That sound that looks like it sounds okay. It might be a bit quiet, actually. Oh, it might just be quiet in my ears. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I've got this. He's got it. He's not got it. <laughs> He's got it. <laughs> We've cracked it. We've cracked the code. That looks that looks all right, doesn't it? Turn it down in my ears, though. Okay, so sound synced, lovely. We figured that out last time. We figured that out. All I need to do is I need to go into the source in OBS, double click it, click deactivate, so it goes away, and then reactivate, and it comes back, and it should all be synced. Ta-da! Which is amazing. I didn't realize it was that simple. Um, okay, where, where, where are we actually going now? We were going to the caves. That's what we're going. We're going to caves. We're going to go splunking. That's what we're doing. And we just met Enrico. That was it. Right. Let's do some good old fashioned box inventory management. And let's just see if we've got any ink ribbons. So shells, shells. Right. Combine Yoshelius. How many of these can I can have at the same time? Apparently more than 38. 39 at least. Right, this is all stuff I'm going to pick back up, so that's, that's okay. Have we got any more shells? Any more shells? Shells. Any more shells? Shells. Got any shells? Any shells? Anyone got any shells? Look for some shells. Got any shells, man? Uh, no. So that's that's our allotment of shells. So that's fine. Oh, God. Come on. Cold Python. Mo disk Magnum rounds. Now, I know we've got Magnum rounds somewhere else as well. Why do I still have the Doom book when I took the metal out of it? Ah, fuck. I don't think I did. I think I was on one of our many retries. Clip as well. Clip. Explosive. Oh, no. Those are the ones I'm taking with me, aren't they? So that's our... That should be our thingy. That's all our ammo. Yeah, that's all our ammo. <laughs> 
question results now going through all of the commands to make sure everything's right. <laughs> Excellent. Thank you. <laughs> At some point, I need to make that automated. I currently need to uh, hard code the date of the next D&D with GOG stream and also the next GOGCOM stream for Layers of Fear or GOGCOM Horror game stream. I need to somehow rejig that. Uh, I've forgotten how to go into the menu. That's how I go into the menu. Combine and then combine. Good. And then combine and then combine. Lovely stuff. Right. Okay. Do you like how I put UK time on the schedule? Not GMT or BST. That's so I don't need to change it. Think smarter, not harder. <laughs> I've never been accused of thinking too hard. Uh, right, so explosive rounds, shotgun. The shotguns are back up anyway, so that's fine. Um, mixed herbs, we probably want to take that because we were desperately low on healing items last time. The bazooka, I hate this inventory placement already. I don't like it. Maybe that's what put me off last time. No, no, I don't. I'm just going to take bullets. I'm just going to throw bullets at the enemy. That's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to throw bullets at zombies and just hope they, hope they stick. No. Bad, bad gel. Uh, right. So I want my... Where's my shotgun? There it is. My shotgun. In here, I want my shells. In here, I want my bazooka. And here, I want my rounds. Oh, my God. Right. Now I need a crank. Don't need a lighter at the minute. Uh, I, I have some green herbs. I've got the MOD. I've got quite a few green herbs, actually. I'll take that one because that's sort of healy and I think it's anti-poison as well. I'm actually not sure. Um, and now we're going to go to the thing. Good. That did nothing but uh, combine ammo, so we should be fine. And all of the... Was there something on the floor there? No, gardening tools. Nothing useful. Okay, cool. Well, I don't know. You, I, I take a shovel at this point. Um, oh, in fairness, I have a combat knife in case I need one. No. Right, this should be dead. Good. Just some more important ones. Getting a replacement keyboard from the other office. That's fair enough. My keyboard keeps doing something weird, you know. It keeps it keeps like forgetting how to use certain letters. And it's not, it's a, it's a Bluetooth keyboard, it's new as well, but it's only sporadic, and I'm not sure what, what happens with it. It's like certain keys do weird things. And like, I feel like I've activated um, some sort of setting, and I'm not sure what it is. You can fuck off, mate. <clears throat> oh, God, it takes totally off. I'm warm already. It's been really cold in the house today. Oh, no, I'm in the shed, it's fine. I'm fine, I'm fine, I'm in the shed. Nope. Nearly had a bit more than you could handle then. Oh, dear me. Oh, lordy. Right. Got our proper gamer pants on today, so we're going to go and we're going to go and do as much as we can. Um, so, specifically for YouTube, Different day for us, same video for yourself. This is going to be the mega edited version. We There are no more ink ribbons, but we have got no more ink ribbons. Um, so we're just going to have to not die at all throughout all of the boss fights that are upcoming um, and all of the horrible stuff that's on, that's on the horizon. We just have to completely YOLO it uh, and just hope for the best. What's the worst that could happen, eh? Think. Oh no, I didn't kill these. Run! Wait a minute. I, I forgot to do the thing. That's why I've got the square crank on me. Because we did that. We did that. Then we went down there. And then I said I was going to save. We saved, did that, and then I said I was going to go away, go away off stream and save, and there was no thingies. There was no ink ribbons, so we couldn't. Get off.
Good. Still got the dogs. Excellent stuff. But at least we've got the battery in the thing. So that's good. There is a square hole. Put the square peg in the square hole. Peg it. Hey, fuck what I think I know. How you doing? I've not seen you for a while. You finally get to join one of the streams. It's good to have you, friend. It's good to have you. Going right so far. We're completely having cribbins. We're poorly prepared, but we're just going to have to not die for the rest of the game. So what's the worst that could happen? <laughs> Part four, where it all goes wrong. Oh, yeah, I do. I do think I, I I brought some bad energy, some bad juju with me on uh, on Friday. Just gone. Uh, a, a bad resource management. Bad cartography skills. And just general, like, I wasn't happy with the way everything went. Go down! <laughs> Get down! As Arnold would say. So now, stream-wise, all that's on my to-do list is to make some uh, commands for moderators, which is on the to-do list, and also um, change my notification graphic. Don't bite me, don't bite me, don't bite me, don't bite me! There's a lie there. We just end it. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Throw myself bodily down the hole so the dog doesn't bite me. And then we're, we're golden. Make a few changes to the GOG and D&D &D commands, and that's about it. Right. Now, we went this way, didn't we? This is where we meet. This is where we meet Daddy Burton. You've been really busy with work. I feel that, friend. I feel that. Pretty easy today. Pretty easy oh, day today. Jill. Nice. What good timing. A moment ago, I heard someone's voice coming from this hole. Let's go together since it's dark and we can't see very well. The tense music for no reason. Yeah, sure. Okay, let's go. Okay, then I'm going to cover you. Let's hurry. Hey, are you all right? I can go first if you want me to. Uh, no, I'm good, okay. thank you. Let's go, Barry. I'm depending on you. <laughs> oh, questionable results. <laughs> Playing Ari without healing items is the way I always play it because I get hurt so much and I always <laughs> run out. Yeah, that's fair. Uh, right, Baza, we're going to go this way first because, uh, actually, no, we went that way first last time, didn't we? I want to go this way first because I'd really like that F8 spray. Was there something over here? No, there was no. Oh, I think I've gone the wrong way. Is this the bad corridor? No. Good. This is the Le Le generator room. Oh, hello. Are you coming up? You want to join us? Oh. Oh, God, you are such a muffin. You really are. You are such a chungus. Hello, sir, citizen unknown. How are you doing? Sorry, I have to pay the cat tax whenever he... Oh, you, oh, you don't. Okay, cool. Now, you're not allowed that. You're not allowed to eat that. No. Because it's, it's my plate from earlier. Actually, don't tell anyone. It's my plate from breakfast. So... Uh, right. Jenny... Jenny Rita. She's good lasses, Jenny. Jenny Rita. This is that uh, fabled first aid spray that we lost 40 minutes of gameplay because we didn't have. Nope, don't like that. Nope. <laughs> don't like that. It's got Chipotle on it. Uh, Sriracha on it, even. I'm going to have to cover this up. <laughs> You're so food motivated. Come here. Ugh. You're also such a lump. Cover this up. One of the things about our cats is Phoenix is very food motivated. And by food motivated, I mean he's a greedy bastard. So he takes after me. But. Yeah, hello, Sir Citizen. How are you doing? How are you doing today? Uh, this isn't a battery, is it? No, it's more rounds. Good. 
But he smells so good. I know, but he, he's like me. He has the, the cat version of IBS, so he can't have uh, sriracha. I, I can't have, I shouldn't have sriracha. No, it's a very important distinction then. But I like, I like spicy breakfasts, so. <laughs> right, so there's nothing down there. That generator is not powered. Cool, cool, cool. What's down here? A uh, path. What's down here? Oh, a door. I'd quite like to explore this stuff. Oh, good. Barry, get him. Oh, that, this is where Enrico is. Cheers, buzzer. Oh. I wanted to confirm that before you just, you, you took away my options, but whatever. He's gone away now. He realised I covered up the plate. He's not interested in me. Is that Jill? Is that voice Enrico's? It's something. Yeah? You're alive! Wait there! Are you with anybody, Jill? Well, I'm seeing someone at the moment. <laughs> what? Are oh, yes! Serious? Enrico! So, Barry and Jill together. Are you all right, Enrico? The stars are doomed. Someone is a traitor. Everything was plotted from the start by Umbrella. Ha! Two very important facts pop out there. One, no one seems to be bothered with the fact that someone just shot their friend. Two, he reacted to the shot before the bullet actually hit him. <laughs> and now we know what time it is. Loot that buddy. Loot that buddy. <laughs> Loot that buddy. He couldn't have moved, but he's holding something. Pry it out of his cold, dead hand. He's not going to need it. What? It's true. All right, Barry, you stay there. I would really like to replace... I wish I could... I wish I could unload this gun. Like, I really want these flame rounds for Black Tiger. I'm going to use this because I think I'm going to need to. Um, I could do with them for the spider, but... Oh, look, another crank. If only there was a way to distinguish the two... Like, I don't understand curtains. Yeah, and it's square shaped. Good. This is so my. No, don't combine them. You can't, you can't combine them. Not to make some sort of super crank. The end is hex shaped. I'm sorry, did I say hex full stop hyphen shaped? Nothing important. No, that bit's important. The end is, yeah, hex. Oh, because, of course, because hex is an abbreviate, is a shortened version. I understand. I mean, that's probably not how you should say it, but I understand. Right. Now we've got Billy Billy Bad Times stood in here, haven't we? We've got Hunter Hurst, please don't fucking decapitate me. One. Two. Run away, run away, run away, run away, run away. Oh, a machine! No, I'm out. <laughs> there was one I'd have taken the victory, but no, I'm, I'm not. I'm not doing that at all. Oh, good. Oh, Jill. Oh, Jill. Ouch. Ouch. Run. Run, 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 run. Nope, this way, this way, run this way, run this way, run this way. It has a, a bit of my skin on its claws and I don't like it. I hate hunters. I hate them. 
I think because they can kill you in one shot. I think that's why I hate them so much. Right, so we hadn't been down this way. How's our health? Eh, we've been better. Oh. It's an old typewriter. If I had an ink ribbon, I could save my progress. Well, we are out of luck. Because we are out of ink ribbons. Where's this way? Aha, I see. There's a hexagon shaped hole. Poke it with your finger. This cave is so structurally unsound. Oh, I don't get to stop it, apparently. I thought, I genuinely thought I got to stop. Ah, now. There's an indie bit, isn't there? There's an Indiana Jones moment. Because having this elaborate puzzle isn't enough. There also has to be... Yeah, thanks. There also has to be a trap. Oh, maybe I'm, maybe I'm wrong. Oh, okay. Maybe I'm wrong. Now, if I use it again, what happens? What happens? Is there something over here? Is there something over here? Nope. Okay. It's been a while since I played this. Use it. I can't use it here. It, it's literally where it's used. <coughs> Excuse me. There's a hexagon hole. Okay. Yes. Are you just going to go out that way now? Oh, no, you are going that way. Good. Maybe it happens now. I'm sure there's a boulder somewhere. Well, I mean, I've been wrong before, so who knows. Keep forgetting the things. <laughs> yes, Fog Horizon. Yes. Someone was very paranoid when they built this. I think in one of the, the fan books that I read ages ago, um, there was a uh, there was some law that said uh, it, it's made by a certain architect, but as he was but who was known for building like elaborate like contraptions in houses and stuff like that, but um, he also started to go mad as he built it. So he was like, he started to get more paranoid and more schizophrenic and all this sort of stuff and just started to layer traps on traps on traps. Hmm. What this? Nothing. Hello, hey, no. Oh, hello. This is what I'm looking for, isn't it? Do I examine this? No. Run. Run. <laughs> All together now. Da, 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 da. Copyright. Right. Oh, I. Oh, it's gone through there. Oh, hello. Ouch. Get off, you tart. Oh, I didn't think that was going to hit. Right. Uh, we, we've been better. Just spray some glue on it. Uh, don't suppose you remember the name of the book, do you? It was a bunch of them. I'll see if I can dig them out. I'll stick one Discord. Um, but I remember downloading a big sort of collection of, like, free PDF books or free ebooks to my Kindle at one point. And I, I didn't know that there was going to be Resident Evil books on there. And there was. But they weren't like canon books. They were reimaginings of them. Um, so like certain characters that 
don't die in the first one did die in the first one, that sort of thing. But it was a very interesting read. It was very, I think it was very well made, uh, very well written. So, but yeah, it might be. Oh, Black Tiger. Ow. Ow. I could do with uh, not dying like that. Roll on back. Oh, also what we need to do, just for anyone who's new to this, is whenever the game restarts, I need to just deactivate my source and reactivate my source, and then it should sync the audio, which is lovely. Right. Note to self, don't do that again. Unfortunately, it means we've got to do the whole Enrico shot in the face in Glacius bit again. It'll be fine, don't worry about it. Be fine. It'll be re that was the that was the stretch. I mean, don't don't worry about it. <clears throat> Welcome to Resident Evil, folks. Can you go back and get the ribbons you left behind? I don't think there are any. Although I could, I mean, I could be wrong. <clears throat> I don't, I don't think I left any anywhere. Oh, hang on. Oh, no. That's fine. 14 is fine. Square crank, yes. Excuse me. Goodness. <clears throat> I just gotta avoid you. Ha <laughs> get fucked. All I've got to do is kill it before it kills me. It's a very easy play. There's one in the first session you left because you hadn't the space. Question results furiously scrubbing through the first session. No, thank you all. Not today, pups. Not today. Or tomorrow. Or the next day. Or any day, really. Excuse me. Yum. Good. We've got dog chorus back. Lovely. That's what we need. Ah, oh, something in my throat. Maybe it's the delicious taste of Lipton peach iced tea in a can. Hashtag not sponsored. <laughs> I'm out of simple taste. There's only a few things I would actually sell out for. Free iced tea would be one of them. Oh, I've got my thing on, have I? Oh, sorry. Bear with, bear with, bear with. Oh, God. <laughs> I just... There, they just got to do something stream-related. Just leave myself at the mercy of some dogs. Uh, duh, duh, activity feed. That's what I need. How will I know when no one follows me if I'm not got my activity feed up? There we go. Pew, pew. You're starting to sound like Yubi Tips now. To avoid a game over, be sure to kill the enemy before they kill you. Get good, friend. Get good. <laughs> uh, probably shouldn't have gone this way. I mean, this feels like a mistake now. Away with you, skin dogs. I don't know what their hitbox is like, so I'm just not... I'm not going to go near the edge of that. <clears throat> but yeah, it'd be easy, right? We just got to kill three bosses and not die. That's all we got to do. 
and survive hunters. The room's full of hunters that can kill you in one swipe. Um, what else have we got? Is that it? Liquors aren't in this one, are they? Liquors are in two. Um, I, think I, I think I might be it. We'll be fine. Be absolutely fine. Oh, no, not that way. This way. Big Barry. Big Daddy Burton. Oh, Jill. What good timing. I know. A moment ago, I heard someone's voice coming from this hole. It was me screaming as Let's I died. together since it's dark and we can't see very well. Yeah, well, uh, you can't. <laughs> I can. Okay, let's go. Okay, then I'm going to cover you. Let's hurry. Your faith is all I need, Folklorize 999. I feel empowered. I feel hey, filled with determination. All right. I can go first if you want me to. Okay, let's go, Barry. I'm depending on you. Uh, no, we're going this way first, aren't we? To get the items. Items? Item. Items? Items. Plural, singular. Plural, singular. I can't remember. Yeah. This is a weird hole. Oh, hang on. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I know it's a power generator. Hey, Darcy Sue, how you doing? Good to see you, friend. Good to see you. Yeah, I would quite like the flare. The flare rounds are really good against Black Tiger, the giant spider. Which I don't know if that's just rhyming slang or something, but I'm pretty sure that's the canonical name for it. Although we had this discussion about um Game. 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 Well, that's your show, folks. <laughs> original games and original hardware, for better or worse. Game. Game. Can I do the soft reset thing? I'm pretty sure I put it in the hole, right? I'm pretty sure I stuck it in the right hole as well. Broke the game. I might have broken the console. Yes, yes, Retro Tink, I know. There's no signal. There's no signal. The second, like the second I turn it off. Mum. At least you all get to experience that. Oh, that's a cool thing, right? Deactivate. Reactivate. Go. <laughs> God. I'll just wait until it's the main screen. Because it keeps disconnecting the signal. <clears throat> wow, that would be a delay. Holy shit. Right, deactivate and reactivate. Well, this is what we signed up for, folks. Good. That, I mean, it's very rough that I'd be able to tell from just those two screens, those two noises that it was uh, uh, delayed or not, but I think it's okay. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's okay. You have once again entered... The world of survival horror. Good luck. You're going to fucking need it. Right. Anyway. So where were we? <laughs> Got a love OG hardware. OG hardware I bought off eBay. Uh, right. Good luck, Resident Mike. Thank you. Thank you. Shells. Shells.
combine us. I'm just going to take those with me just in case. All right. <clears throat> now, where were we? Oh, yeah. We were winning the game. That's what we were doing. We were winning the game. Hey, Greeny Green, how you doing? It's nice of you to do a planned restart if the stream uh, the stream for late comes. It's fine. It, it's going to be a restart every time I die because we've got zero ink ribbons and I'm not certain there's many left in the game. <laughs> we just got to not die, which is great when you're facing against enemies that can kill you in one shot. The shotgun's more of a distraction technique for the hunters, I feel. <laughs> How you doing, Greeny Greens? Good to see you. So now we've just got to get back down to the caves. And then we've got to do that bit with Enrico again. And then do that bit with the boulder again. Not die to Black Tiger this time. Um, and then we'll be fine. Oh, i got to do this bit right, though, first, haven't I? And not get e eaten to death by dogs. Nope. No, thank you, bacon dog. They look like they're made out of bacon. They do. They look like they're made out of bacon. <laughs> Lonely, depressed, and cold. I'm sorry. I'm also cold. I'm sorry you feel that way. There is a square hole. Poke your finger in it. You hope I rebuilt it. I did take it apart and clean it, like, pretty thoroughly. It was in a pretty poor state when I got it. Also, Greeny Green, you can't be lonely because you're here with all of us. You have company. That's the thing, right? The depression bit. I hope it's not as I hope it's not too bad. But if there is, if it is, reach out. Like we are IRL friends, so please reach out. Retro consoles are always in a poor state. That's my experience anyway. Yes. Yeah. What's the worst one I got? Um I got a SNES that I had to give away. Because, well, two reasons. One, <coughs> God damn. Uh, two reasons. One, I got the analog version, uh, which is the upscale, upscaler um, by the company analog. And two was it was in such a poor state that some of the, what are they called? The receiver pins? There's oh, cartridge Jill. slot. Shut what up. Good timing. Cartridge slot. A moment ago, I heard someone's voice coming from this hole. Let's go together it since it's dark and we can't mean. see very well. Yes. Okay, let's go. Okay, then I'm going to cover you. Let's hurry. Hey, are you all right? I can go first if you want me to. Do you want to go first? No. Okay, let's go, Barry. I I'm want the good ending. You. <laughs> Even though I've never actually gotten the good ending. Uh, right, let's get the items out of the way first. I'm going to not give it too many things to think about at once. I, I think I may have broken its 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 brain by, by picking up two items in very quick succession. Oh, yeah, the Mega Drive. My Mega Drive, when I got that. Um, so I got a Mega Drive, and then like a month after, got the analog version of the Mega Drive, which is really cool. It's a, it's a dinky console by the company called Analog, who make, um, like, it's uh, it's called FPGA emulation. It is emulation, but it's not emulation. It's reproduction hardware, basically. But it plays original uh, original cartridges. But it upscales them to 1080p, 60 frames a second, that sort of thing. Or 60 hertz, I should say. Um, and it works flawlessly. Like That's what we're playing Pokemon on. So, uh, uh, But because I didn't know... They were on back order for like two years. Um, 
and so will the next one as well because the next one's the N64 which I'm incredibly excited about they um I, so I got an original Mega Drive there was like a dead fly in it like two or three dead flies in it it was horrible everyone cross your fingers Whew. there we go I think it's because I gave it a second to think about it alright Bazaar let's go now we gotta go this way to Enrico and Glacias. Oh, I don't have to fight that hunter that comes in here next. Do I just run straight and then go around? Yeah, it's not very nice at all. It's awful. As if the state of retro gaming wasn't bad enough with prices the way they are. I'm going to... Uh, I'm going away for the weekend. Next weekend. And I'm going to a place with a very well-renowned retro game shop. And I, I can feel my wallet crying in anticipation of this. <laughs> Is that Jill? Is that How do you know from the feet? God, never mind. Yeah. You're alive. Wait there. Are you with anybody, Jill? What? Oh yes. <clears throat> Enrico. So Barry and Jill together. Barry and Jill, sitting in a tree. Are you all right, Enrico? K-I-L-L-I-N-G. The stars are doomed. Someone is a traitor. That would be the traitor. <laughs> Everything was plotted from the start by Umbrella. Ha! Legitimately thought he shot himself first time <sighs> I saw that. Barry just didn't give a shit. He couldn't care less. I'm not going to pick up that clip. I'm, I know I'm a loot goblin, but I'm not going to pick up that clip because I don't have a clip on my inventory, and it's going to take up the space that the hex key would take up. Give me that key. Give me that. Okay. Wrench. Crank. Crank. Give me that crank. Now I need to differentiate the two. Check it. There we go. End is hex shaped. Lovely. Also, no. No, no, I don't need to check the shotgun ammo. Thanks. I need to reload my shotgun in my incredibly poorly managed inventory. So now I should just be able to go straight and then round and then avoid that one completely. <clears throat> Excuse me. And then we can go do Boulder Bill. Boulder Will, yep. Yeah. Is there going to be another one in here? Yep, yeah, there is. Of course there is. Of course there is. Ah, bye bye. I thought the door was in the middle. I nearly got, I nearly got my face taken off. Hunter. Right, what's my thing you like? I'm fine. Wait, hang on. Warning shot. Missed it. Ah, uh, oh! This fucking game. That was just in RE2 and beyond. RE2 and beyond. Which we may, before Halloween, get to. Who knows? Start. I'll start the game and then I'll restart the, the audio sync. So bear with me. I know it's, I know it's going to be desynced. Do not panic, all right? Do not panic. I hate this game. I don't really. I'm just over it. Only if you stop dying. Thanks for Clara's name, I know. Just gonna, just gonna take a quick call. I'm just gonna. A call from the Burns unit, apparently. <laughs> Click. There should be a ribbon next to the typewriter by Enrico. Are you having a laugh? Are you... I know it's hard to think. Don't panic. 
No one panic. All right, everyone just hold on to your horses. Wherever your horses are, make sure you know where they are and then hold on to them. All right. They still have faith. You just killed that diet, man. Ah, you foolish, foolish friend. You thought I was good at video games. I used to be a games journalist. I'm terrible at video games. Uh, right. Uh, beep, boop. Deactivate. Reactivate. Okay. You are literally looking at a map. Good lad. Oh, he's a good lad, that questionable result. Oh. Right, let's go. Good. You can be my man in the van. <laughs> Especially as you've gotten older. I just like, I love, um, like, actual proper story experiences now. But not like really long ones. I like the... It's weird. I used to think to myself, oh, that's only a 10-hour game. That's worthless. How is that How is that possibly worth it? Now, although I'm not paying like full whack for... <laughs> fuck off. I'm not paying full whack for like 10-hour experiences or something like that. But like if I want... If I'm paying like 50, 60, 70 quid for a game, which is mega rare, like mega rare, I want it to last a while. But otherwise, I've got no problem paying... Up to and including twelve ninety nine for a game that only lasts five hours. I'm like, I'm all right with that. That's a good, that's a good couple of evenings, you know. I'm okay with this. So a good few evenings. Uh, nope. Bad bacon dog. I'm not saying it. I'm not saying it. Definitely not going to pass any commentary on how this run is going so far. But this feels like the one. It's going well, isn't it? Ah, <laughs> oh, the good, the wrath of the curse. All right, let's go. I'm going to get absolutely munched on on my way back now. And it's going to be your fault, Dusty Sue, because, I mean, I'm, I'm fucking flawless, so it's not my fault. I am what they call a gift. Uh, right, let's go this way. This is a bad way. Oh, this is fine. This is better than I thought, actually. No, you don't. Oh, wait, that's on the remake map. Questionable results! I'm going to need your mod gun and your mod badge. <laughs> Some of the best games I've ever played have been six to eight hour experiences. Or, Ori, yeah. I've still not played Ori. It feels like it would be right up my alley. I've still not played it. It's still on the backlog. Uh, the ladder. Will you descend it? Face first, if necessary, friend. Face first. Maybe I should have just brought the Colt Python with me. Maybe that was like the, the great equalizer in this. Right, let's go. I wonder what's in here. I wonder who could be hiding in this corridor. <laughs> oh, it was oh Jill, what good timing. A moment ago, I heard someone's voice coming from this hole. Let's go together since it's dark and we can't see very well. I, I miss skipping, skippable cutscenes. Uh, do you wish to go with him? Yes. Okay, let's go. Okay, then I'm going to cover you. Let's hurry. Hey, are you all right? I can go first if you want me to. You want me to go first? Nah, I okay. got this. Let's go, Barry. I'm depending on you. Oh, good. Question results. Good. There's a ribbon in the Black Tiger room, so uh, good luck. So all I gotta do is kill the spider first, and then just get the item. Fine. Uh, where's the... Where is the... Ladder? No. Typewriter near Enrico. Uh... It's in the other room, isn't it? It is in the other room. Can you believe, right? Can I just take a second to, to mention? Can you believe I've been on Twitch 10 years this Halloween? 10 years. I mean, in fairness, I've only taken it seriously for two of those because it's my two year, 10 year anniversary, two year affiliate anniversary, which is mental. 
absolutely mental. Yes, I will say this. Please don't crash. Yay. Yes, I will say this. Please don't crash. Oh, you can run it at 120 FPS on the Series X. That's really cool. What was the game I was trying to run a higher frame rate on the Series X? Oh, uh, Elden Ring. I couldn't play Elden Ring not in 60 frames a second. Oh boy, I tried to play it at 30. It was a horrific experience. <laughs> now I realize it. I really Now I've got a TV that can like take like 60 and 100, 100 FP, 120 FPS. I'm like, wow, this is, this, this is pretty good. Uh, I went the wrong way then. Um, oh, fuck. I'm, I'm not paying attention. This is how we died. This is genuinely how we died. Mm, yeah, it's been it's been a solid 15 years, to be honest with you, Focal Horizon. It's been a lengthy ass time. Because uh, I was working on some gamer... I was in games media not long after we moved to this part of the country. Get him, Barry. Can I just borrow you for the Black Tiger fight? Is that all right? Um, and that was 10... Yeah, 15 years ago. Yeah, so probably 15, 14 or 15 years, give or take. It's been a long time. Right, should we go see who's down here? See if there's anyone. There could be no one. Who knows? Is that Jill? Is that voice Enrico's? Poor Enrico. I have to yeah. point through this every You're time. Alive. Wait there. Are you with anybody, Jill? What's this? Oh, it's a pin. What? Oh, yes. The pin badge has fallen off. Interesting. Enrico. So, Barry and Jill together. Are you all right, Enrico? The stars are doomed. Someone is a traitor. Someone is. Someone is. Everything was plotted from the start by Umbrella. Ha! Ah! <gasps> Enrico! He does sound jealous when he's like, are you with anyone? It's like he's bleeding to death from a zombie wound. He's like, so, seeing anyone? Wait, what what time do you what time do you get off? <laughs> you doing anything after work? Oh no, I don't want to oh I've done it. I've done it. I've done it dumb. Hey, he's holding something. It's bullets that I don't want. No. Thanks, bye. Uh, wait, I, no, I don't need to reload that. That's fine. Uh, oh, it's here. <laughs> Starting to lo genuinely lose my memory now. Um, will you take the crank? Yes, why not? Sure. That seems like a fine, fine thing to do. Now we'll go this way. i got to focus now, otherwise I'm going to die. I need to shoot it with a shotgun to distract it and then run past it. Got it. Run, 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 run. Same with this one. Shoot with a shotgun to distract it, then run past it. No, I left it too late. Oh my god. Oh, that noise. That noise is so. That is the decap attack. Right, so now we're here. Okay, so now there's a typewriter here. But oh, no, I need to go back. Is there an actual thingy here? It's an old typewriter. If I had an encrypt and I could save my progress. No, not this side. No, I don't think there is. Curses. Curses! Yes, I'm also not playing the director's cut. I'm playing the original, original. Because the, the director's cut wasn't available. <laughs> it's a hexagonal hole. Use the hexagonal crank. And try not to bloody die this time. Okay, so we're in better health 
uh, condition than we were. That sounds really loud. That sounds slightly better. We're in better health condition than we were. Uh, cheers. And now... I think we have two healing items. Actually, I might have turned that down a bit too much. Sorry. So I was... There we go. So now... I just... I forgot. I can turn that down on my headphones and not, not the stream. So now, run away. Don't get squished by the ball, bro. I'd be so embarrassing if we got squashed by the boulder. Right, I'm not going to go down there because, well, one, there's a hunter down there, and two, I don't want to right now. What is down here? What was I hiding? Uh, -huh. excuse me. And pod on, monsieur? Ow! You fucking ow! Fuck off! Fuck off! Fuck off! Fuck off! Fuck off! Fuck off! Fuck off. <laughs> Bravely running away. Hey, Echo Alpha, how you doing? It's good to see you, friend. It's good to see you. Right, let's just patch that up. No. Nope. Equipius Bernius. Now, where are you? Gotcha. Mmm, crispy. Regrouping. Wait, is there another one? There? Oh, yeah, there will be one there. There's another one near the boulder. Right, what's this? <gasps> Flam rounds. Yay, flame rounds. Is there anything else? Is that it? That's all I got. Really do with a save right now. This would be an ideal moment for a save, but we just don't have one. Are you? No, am I just gonna have to? Oh, you're not actually there. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Fingers crossed, everyone. Fingers crossed. No. That's a combat knife. I don't want a combat knife. I want the egg grabber so I can run away again and save the game. I can't remember what health we were on. Ow. 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 Fucking. No, I missed. I'm on danger. Oh, that was close. Right in the face. <laughs> yeah. Fucking spiders. That's how I take care of spiders in, in our house. Mmm, lovely. Can't can't wait for these to try and kill me. I'm going to kill you and your children. Also how I take care of my enemies. Right, where is this? Oh, thank Christ. Hey, Almadin, how are you doing? <laughs> Poor spider, evening Jill sandwich. <laughs> uh, I am going to need that. That uh, uh, combat knife. You are correct, game. But not right this second. You guys are. Making me nervous. There's another one there. I can see it glitching out. Uh save, 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 save. Please don't die. Please let me save. Please don't die. Please let me save. Please don't die. Please let me save. I'm praying to my god. The god of safe states. Oh my god, I overshot the door. 
I missed quick saves. <laughs> this is one of the first times I've been like, I really should have just emulated this. It would have been a lot easier. <laughs> you watched the Ari movie yesterday. It's absolutely nothing like this. I can imagine. I can absolutely imagine. This is obviously the superior product. <laughs> Wait, hang on. Pause a second. If you down now, die now, I'm going to die. <laughs> Death by typewriter. It's a mimic. <laughs> Just ding, 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 go. Yes, overwrite it. <laughs> you know that means, don't you? We got one more save. That's it. Uh, yeah, so yeah, sorry, Ahmad. Um, you watched the Resident Evil movie yesterday. Do you mean the original one with Mila... Mila... Jakovic. He says hoping... Yeah, that one. I actually really enjoyed that one. It was nuts, don't get me wrong. And when I watched it, I expected it to be more like the game than it was. But I I definitely uh, I enjoyed it more than I thought I would. I enjoy it more now than I did at the time. At the time, I wanted it to be more like the game, right? And I was like, this is not like the game. This is insane. But now I'm like, no, it's a reimagining of it. I can understand this now. Will you take the combat knife? Sure thing. Why not? Because apparently this is the only way of getting rid of these spider webs. That's the worst implementation of a combat knife ever. <laughs> I can't even get rid of it now. It's stuck in my inventory. I'm taking this because I'm taking zero chances. They are, yeah, no, they are all crap. I'll be honest with it. They're all, they feel like modern day B-movies, which I appreciate. Right, now where am I going? What's down here? Oh, a map. Oh, ah. No, that's not a map. That's a plaque. I, uh, it's one of those big metal maps. They're bullshit. <laughs> so, how do you really feel, Echo? Tell us, tell us what you really think. About it. Uh, right. So, so that's multiple, multiple ways. I've saved now. I've become brave, and I'm just like, let's just go here. Let's go here. Let's go here. What's down here? Oh, there's a snake. There's more snakes. Good. I'm, I'm pleased with this. Fantastic. More snakes. Good. Good, good. A save room with another ink ribbon. I think. It's another ink ribbon. I'm swimming in saves. We're saved, people. Get it? We're saved. <laughs> Oh, I now I now get the love. I once again get the love of that uh, that music, the savory music. Makes me feel like I'm not gonna get hurt. It's a good uh, a good banker's light there. I'm not quite sure why everyone needs a banker's light. No cranks, not for me. Did I not recognise one of them? No, I didn't. Uh, put that away. Well, I'm not going to save. We've literally just saved, all right? We've literally just saved. We'll do nothing decent between now and then. Uh, what I am going to do is I'm going to just disable my preview because otherwise I'm going to keep looking at my face. I'm so handsome. Uh... Oh, excuse me. Cool. But the laser the laser room was awful. I mean, it was great, but it was awful. We were looking at um, B movies to watch over uh, over Halloween, and there's uh, oh, I'm gonna watch the finally gonna watch Uzumaki, the Junji Ito uh, movie. Junji Ito does a lot of um, uh, manga horror that I really really like, and 
he bought a movie out in like 99 or 2009 I can't remember, early uh, years ago right and it's a proper kind of original ring slash original grudge looking um, Japanese horror movie and I'm really excited for it and we're going to watch the uh, Blair Witch Project because my wife has never seen it and if I have to live through it so does she <laughs> sharing is caring uh, right what do I want I could do with a Healy. Oh, there's a Healy on the table. The shotgun's my backup weapon. I've got some bazooka ammo. And that's about it. I'm going to combine those so no one panic. I said don't panic. And I'm pretty sure I need one of these as well at this point. Although now... Oh, don't combine it. Check it. Although now I'm not quite sure which one it is. It's not this one. Of course it's not. Nope. Smith. Open. I should watch Velosa Pasta. Velosa Pasta. Velosa Pastor. And Robocroc. They sound amazing and terrible. <laughs> I both love and hate these recommendations. Larmageddon, I've heard, is amazingly bad. I think we saw an advert for that on, I think it was Netflix. Um, and it looked it looked awful. And my problem is I just don't give myself time to actually sit and watch movies. Like, I don't, again, I don't know why I keep trying to check this ammunition. There we go. Lovely stuff. And we'll grab a healing item as well. Oh, what's this? What is? Is this? That's blue herb. Right. There's a lot of snakes in here, isn't there? I'm not going to leave that fade spray there. I'm going to take that with us. Uh, I'm not going to take it with us, sorry. I'm going to motion very awkwardly around it. Will you take the first aid spray? It's just spray glue. Just glues you back together. She's in horrific condition at the at the minute. She's got minutes to live. She's put a brave face on it. Very high tolerance for pain, Argel. Um, I take a blue herb and a green herb and I'm going to smash them together eventually. There we go. And I'm going to make a anti-poison Healy concoction. Will you mix the herbs? Yeah, sure, why not? So, there's another analog console coming out. I don't know if anybody knows uh, the analog consoles, but bear with me. You've heard my Zoogram impression. Oh. Right. So there's a company called Analog that make retro consoles. And this is the Mega Drive, which takes actual cartridges. And this is the SNES, which takes actual cartridges, right? They also do, or did, uh, an NES version and they've recently produced a Neo Geo version and a reproduction Game Boy which is like really nice screen you know has adapters for things like Game Gear and things like that um, but today they announced that they were doing an N64 version which I don't know if anybody knows too much about N64 tech is pretty mind-blowing stuff because the tech that was used in N64 has not really been well replicated since. Even emulators can't replicate it. So being able to not only replicate it, but upscale it, make it smoother, that sort of thing is really, really good. Um, it's one of the reasons, actually one of the reasons why I haven't uh, been streaming N64 games, even though I've got them, is because the way my uh, setup upscales it is dog shit. <laughs> it makes it look awful. Um, so I'm very excited. That's not the one I'm looking for, is it? Where am I going? Uh, yeah, they look all black. All the pixels look really blurry. It looks really muddy, and it doesn't look very nice at all. So I'm really, really excited to uh, to get my hands on one of those. But it's probably going to be like a year, 18 months before it actually gets delivered. So but I'm on the waiting list. So fingers crossed, people. Fingers crossed. Um...
Is this just gonna come and roll down here? What is this? What's what's going on here? There's a hexagonal hole. I knew I needed this here somewhere. Can I go in here? Nope. What this? What this do? What the hole doing? And now we play the Wazing Goon. Uh, but Perfect Dark and Goldeneye and uh, Banjui, Kazooie and, and Tui. I will, however, not mention Donkey Kong 64 and The Rap. That's fair enough. I didn't like Donkey Kong 64. I didn't think it was very good. I'm not big into Donkey Kong games, I'll be honest with you. I don't. I think they're a bit overrated. <laughs> I hope in remakes that room spins quicker. Well, at one point we'll find out. This Halloween. I'll probably still play through the remakes though. I tell you what, whatever we get through, right? One, two, three, that sort of thing. I'll play the remakes as well. Uh, I need to use a skip. So then we can see what they're like. No, I didn't say when. I just said I'd play them. I think another boulder drops here. I think this, this dupes you. Right, now do I run away? Is it now? Something, there's a weird combination of... I could get through both remakes in the same stream. I could get through this in one stream. It's a, to speed run, it's only like an hour and a half, but clearly not. <laughs> Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I don't think I'm going to reach this. I think this is a trick. I think I've been... I need one of those Twitch for Dummies books. What's the term? Is it... Wait, let me get my Twitch for Dummies book. My streamers for Dummies book. I'm about to be jabated. That's the word. I think I... Have done it wrong. That's what the kids say, isn't it? Jabated. I don't know. I don't know slang. Right, so it was there. Hour and a half. Which hour and a half? Apparently, speedrunning it is not very long. Did you not get... Was there not an achievement? I say achievement. Was there not a cheat for completing this game in under an hour or something like that? There's definitely one of those where you got, like, the rocket launcher with unlimited ammunition if you completed it in under, like, an hour. I'm sure of it. Questionable results. You're my uh, resident researcher and also unpaid intern. Go find out. <laughs> Is this? Aha! This is where I need to go. Aye, aye. Right, now run away from this. Now that starts moving. There we go. Now I duck in here. Because otherwise that would have squished me. Oh, I love it when a plan comes together. There's a map of the underground. Will you take it? There's more of it. Am I sure I want to take it? <gasps> it's the Moo Disc. <laughs> was that a door as well? No, it wasn't a door. Has this broken a hole in something? Oh, hello. What's... Oh, no, it hasn't. It's just blocked it. Cool. Uh, let's go through here then. This feels like a puzzle. Uh, right. 
What do you do? What do you do? What this? What's this? That looks like a panel. This looks like a switch. Oh, hello. Oh, I see. I see. What does this do? There's a button. There's a hexagonal hole. Use the hexagonal hole. Oh, got it. Everyone, let's roll it back, people. Roll it back. Roll it back. Just leave the room. Reset it. Come back in. We figured it out. We figured it. We need to push the statue in front of that first. Oh no! Can I just push this? Is this a no? Apparently not. Curses! Right. Uh, well, fuck. Uh, let's assume we can just. Aha! That's how we do it. Should have known. I should have known. Under three hours. Yeah, that's still only one stream. <laughs> this is part four. <laughs> We're going to stretch to the 12-hour mark. It'll make a lengthy video, though, let's be honest. So what's going to happen with these videos? I've mentioned this before, and I'm sorry, YouTube, if you get bored of it, but this is different days, different months even for some people. Um, what we're doing is all the raw VODs are going to go up on the Peripheral Mic channel, and a full edited playthrough is going to go up on the Screaming at a Joypad and the Peripheral Mic and the Retro Game Nerd channel. So all three channels there, uh, just to confuse people. I know there's a hazard in a hole. I'm trying to use it. This is that universe where people learn to push but not pull, indeed. This is that universe where no one trained their shoulders. <laughs> They've just got noodle shoulders, that's it. Incredible leg strength, no arms. I'm surprised when she uses the shotgun, she doesn't rip her shoulders off. Oh, I can't get any more items. Of course I can't. Fine. Oh, I don't need to y'all get... Go fuck yourself. <laughs> I will be the judge of this. <laughs> I can't believe I've done this. Uh, there's nothing I can get rid of. There's absolutely... Unless I waste four bazooka rounds, and I, I feels real irresponsible to waste two hunter deaths. Oh, Echo Alpha, I need to go get some food. Well, I'm, I am got questions for Echo Alpha when they come back. Uh, right, let's go this way and let's go this way. We did just pass a save room, though, so... This one. Uh, this probably answers my question. Uh, do all save rooms have the same door? No, I don't think they do. Oh, no. Ah! 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 Snacks! Snacks in a cave. No. Oh, the snacks are only in that part of the cave as well. Although I probably said that a little too early, to be honest with you. I probably just ruined myself. Uh, right. No. I might not need that now. Definitely don't need that right now. Probably need that. Do I need that? I can't remember. I'm at the point where I need those medals. I remember that much. So I might need those medals. Right, we're going to get this. We're going to come back. We're going to save. Dare I save. Because uh, we've done a thing and we've killed some stuff. So we're going to do a save. And then we're going to go in the other direction that we've not been in yet. It's a masterful dodge. Masterful, masterful dodge. Uh, it this way. Now this way. Sorry, I was checking out my cat. Just making sure he was okay. I think he's just... What time is it? Oh yeah, he's just eating. I was like, he's licking a lot. I'm so paranoid about our cats. Uh, oh, don't make me do it again. I need the crank back. I'd already done this. 
Fuck. This game. Oh, don't don't reset the room when I go out and go back in. Oh, no. Don't do that. But, yeah, reset it when I actually go and put the item back that makes me fucking... Stupid Capcom. No wonder you went out of business. If you, only, if you only hadn't made such a beloved game franchise, I could... They just appeared out of the wall. Then that feels utterly unfair. They didn't drop. They just appeared out of the wall. All right. Do this. Grab this. We'll do a cheeky save now. And then go and get the thing. Because I feel like I'm playing Russian roulette with those snakes. Uh, did I just pass the ink ribbon, or am I dumb? Uh, there it is. Cheeky save. Oh, crank. Crank handle. Not that one. That one. You can save your progress with this. Yes. Will you use the increment? Probably. Mm. No, actually. Now I've had a trademark change of heart. No, I, but I definitely need that. <laughs> Uh, I'm definitely going to need that. So take those. I need that. We're going to... A little bit of caution to the wind. Little bit. Not much. Little bit. And it's not greed. Okay, it's not greed. It's vague memory. Definitely not the greed that will get me. Don't you dare. <laughs> I have no time for your shenanigans, snake. Your snake shenanigans. Uh, right, this way. Then this way, and then this way. Ah, I'm stuck on geometry. I'm stuck in polygons. Right. Now, do this. Do it proper this time. That looks about right. There's a hexagonal hole. Don't stick your pee-pee in it. Could hurt. Oh, yes, thank you. Now, go. No, you were facing the right way a second ago. Now, do this. How heavy are these statues? Are these made out of, like... Nibbler shit or something. Right, grab this. Yes. A Doom Book 2. Good, good, good. Excellent. Now. I don't know why I'm staring at chat. You've been no help. Um, I'm joking. Uh... This is my, I'm not sure if I'm going the right way noise, um, which I've, I've used before. I think this is the fountain now. Wow. Loads of herbs. Oh, I should have emptied my inventory first. It is the fountain. Excellent. Now, I think there's something horrible here. Uh, a picture of an eagle is carved in the round hollow. Good. Uh, check this book. Check out this book, man. There is a medal in it. Take out the medal. Medal from the first Doom book. Eagle medal. Medal from the first book. Yes, thank you. No, don't check it. <laughs> Go back. Go up one. Use. Eagle. Clonk. Good. 
Uh, stuck. Wait, is that something in the corner? Do you know what I miss? Shiny collectibles. <laughs> just a faint twinkle. Just a little sparkly twinkle. That's all I wanted. Uh, a picture of a wolf is carved in the round hollow. Good, 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 good. Check. There was a medal in it. Shocker. You got the wolf medal. Yep. Thank you. Use. And this. Yeah! It should be the fountain cutscene. Nice. Oh, I just had a, a fear of it crashing then. Um, uh, so what's through here? Oh, it's welded and doesn't open. Got it. Exactly. Also, they should stop defacing quite so many books, to be honest with you. Uh, I will take that herb. I don't think I care about the blue herbs nearly as much as you do, game. But, I mean, I've got some in my inventory already, so I'm I'm probably just going to mix these. And then I've got a double green herb. Probably. Well, I tell you what, I can mix two green and a blue, I think. Because you mix up to three, I believe. Now, the blue herbs... The red herb increases the potency of other herbs. But the blue herb heals poison, if I remember. Check. That's what I'm going with, anyway. Uh, it's a local herb. Amazing. Thanks. Don't use the information you gained earlier in the actual botany book. Botany book. Um, if you mix a herb with a herb that recovers physical the green one recovers physical strength, the blue one neutralizes natural toxins, while the red herb does not have any effect by itself. The red herb only effective when it's mixed with other herbs. Okay, so that is definitely. So now we've got a strong, a strengthened um, uh, anti poison. Good, and our blue hope can stay there because it likes the it likes the scenery. So either there's nothing down here but a save point, or it's horrific down here, and I should have saved. But we'll find out together, right? That's what this is all. I get smashed in the face by that lift, but I'm not careful. There's no way this would be working if it was underwater. <laughs> Absolutely no way. Who... Did they just murder all the contractors that built this? And now, ladies and gentlemen, we've made it to the lab. Uh, that's the lab. Wait, I think that's, that's shut off, isn't it? Oh, God, there's a ladder. I have a horrible feeling about this. I think I've made a grave error in judgment. Oh, no, I haven't. Good. There's a save point. Uh, actually, no, there's not. There's a box. Shit. Whoops. There's not a save, but we're going to have to go back and save. Uh, I might not need the crank handle. I want that. Are there any hunters in the lab? Probably. <laughs> and a Healy Bob. Uh, but we'll replace that Healy Bob with. 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 Well, actually, we'll take a green herb and a red herb. That gives us a, a pretty powerful Healy Bob. Uh, red herb. Will you combine the herbs? Yes. Sure, why not? Yeah, I'm gonna go back and save it. 
because I remember there being a box in the lab in the early bit of the lab but I thought there was a save point there as well I'm wrong it's it's been it's been known to happen once or twice uh, so I'm gonna oh that's a that's a terrible noise you ain't tap shoes we're gonna do that I'm gonna grab a drink two seconds hang on let me just see if there's any horrible monsters waiting for me just in case it's, it's pre-populated with nasties no I think we're I think we're okay okay one sec now ready good now we can have picture in picture cat cam uh, right down here. Good, good. And there's a save point just through here. Hopefully, there's nothing horrific waiting for me. I was too busy reading chat. I nearly got bit by a snake. Oh, God. Oh, God. There's plenty of space above me in chat. That's true. That is that is true. Especially for retro games. Yes, that is very true. Or classic quality games like Bad Flesh that only run in 60 by 9. Uh, right. Ink a ribbon. A ribbon. Ink a ribbon. Yours the ink ribbon. Tari was way up there. <laughs> this now just reminds me, every time I see my, uh, I've got the Lego typewriter downstairs. Every time I see it, I now just think I should have like a uh, save sheet in it. <laughs> Or a uh, uh, makeshift ink ribbon next to it, or something. Okay, so we've saved, which is great. Now we're gonna go back to the lab and see what's on the slab. Wah! Make sure we don't get bit by snakes. No, thank you. Not today, snake poo. Not today. I need to think of some more point redeem stuff so people can redeem things. Although playing Pokemon with no glasses was pretty was pretty epic, I won't lie. I do not want to play po well, I do not want to play Resident Evil with no glasses. <laughs> I may have to make that like specifically that for non po for action games like this, like a bits thing. Like I'll do it, but for money, because everyone's got price, right? And so it begins. So my heel turn begins. Uh... Let's go. Go down there. There we go. All right, so we're in the lab. Oh, the door is tightly locked, okay. There is a plate on the right-hand side. Is there? Oh, will not open unless under first-class emergency. Remember that, folks. Remember that. There's a ladder. Will you descend it? Sure, why not? Okay, so I think I have everything I might need. Guns, guns, and heels. Yeah. 
a secret laboratory under the Spencer Mansion. Dun dun dun. Who funded this? Oh, it's zombies. Hello. 100% uh, don't need to kill you with the uh, grenade launcher. Uh, depth perception might be a bit off, but cheese. Yeah. Suck it. Ooh, herbs. More herbs. Uh, camera? Oh, hey! <laughs> Watch yourself, buddy. Definitely didn't get any of that on her. Or in her mouth, or in her eyes, or anything. Will you take the green herb? Sure, sure. Why not? Why not? Over here. Oh, a desk. What's the desk? Is this a desk for the master of unlocking? What is this? It's another moo disc. It's a third moo disc. Is this like a? Is this a phone? <coughs> even for an even for a phone, that's pretty big. Visual data room. There's a plate. Visual data room. Thanks. <laughs> uh, I am out of inventory space, so I need... Oh, no, wait. I can mix those herbs, can't I? Which gives me a whole space back. Yeah. Will you mix herbs? Yeah, sure. A whole space. Oh. It's electronically locked. Oh, I see. I'm just locked. Power locked. That's what that is. Just gonna make a horrible clanky noise. <gasps> oh, hello. You appear to be naked. You are turbo nude. Bye bye. I think there's another one down here. Well, far enough away that it's not my problem. Hi, <laughs> hi. That's all right, then. No, apparently, that's nothing. Yeah, thank you. Why is there a weird green light? Is this like an emergency light? Oh, it's locked. What's this? A passcode panel. You don't know the passcode. Brilliant. I kind of like and kind of don't like that they did that. Because surely if you played the game before, you know the passcodes, right? Unless they're automatically generated, which I doubt. But I also kind of like it because it means you don't get to cheese it. Uh, there's a switch. Will you push it? Yeah. Am I going to regret this? I feel like I'm going to regret this. Uh, map? Oh, research the letter. Good. Uh, June 8th, 1998. Dear Ada. It's a name to remember for next time. Dear Ada. Ada, by the time you read this, I'll be something different. Today's test turned out to be positive, just as I expected. It's COVID again. Uh, I feel like going crazy when I think about becoming one of them. Ada, you're not infected, and I hope you never will be. In case you're the last one left, take the material in the visual data room and go to the power room to operate the triggering system before you escape. And make all this public through the media. If everything is in order, all the locks can be opened by the security system. You can access the system if you log in with my name from the terminal in the small lab and enter the password. The password is your name. Uh, to unlock the door at B2, where the visual data room is located, you'll first need to access with our names first, with our names first, and then enter another password. I've written the code below. I'm sure you'll understand it easily. 
And this is and this is my last hope. If you find me completely changed, please kill me yourself. Password. Runes. Uh, yours, John. I can vaguely remember what the password is. I think it's Mole. John. Ada. Cool. Thanks. What's in the box? What is in the box? It's a clip. I will not take the clip. <laughs> Yours, some Viking. <laughs> oh, look at that. Something is written on the picture. Now I remember why there's a switch. Is this an herb? Right, I'm not going to move that yet. What's the play on the wall? Nothing. Can I open the drawer? Nothing. Right. There's a switch on the wall. Will you push it? Yes, go for it. Too dark to see anything. So what's back here then? Oh, it's another switch. <laughs> There's a switch. Will you push it? Yes. Oh, it's UV. We're looking for fingerprints. <laughs> Tree, apple, man, woman. <laughs> that's not an apple. That's a fruit. I don't know, like a phone to me. Uh, right. Let me just double check it is what I think it is. Will you push it? Yes. Sure thing, people. Sure thing. Right. Um. There's my file. Keep style. Re researchers. No. Researchers. No. That's what I want. Researchers letter. There we go. Jump, 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 jump. Uh. M. A. T. M. M with extra bits. Extra M. It's wonky A. Uh, T and or R and M. So M, man, that's an M. Uh, we need an extra A. O, which is the O in woman. Uh, the T, A, P, P, L, M, O, L. And tree, so the two M's at the end of tree is M, is E. So, mole. Mole, 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 mole. We were all thinking it. We're all thinking it. I just said it. Volleyball. God damn it. <laughs> That's electronically locked. Think so, buddy. I do. I did not expect that to hit. I'll be perfectly honest with you. What's in this? It's an equipment that I can't carry. Yay! Make a note. Someone make a note. <laughs> Quick. There's an ink ribbon in this room. It's electronically locked. What's in here? Oh, power room. The door is tightly locked. Hi. Yeah, you know I mate. Mean? Oh shit! I missed. I missed. No! Get off. Uh, I still have bullets left. Ink ribbon in the room. Thanks. Thanks, that too. I'm glad you're looking after me. Go away. As if. Yeah, absolutely knotted, mate. I'm sorry. Where do you guys keep coming from? Did 
You're not one of these two, are you? No, you're not one of these two. Okay. Is this just a big ring? This is just a big ring. So, in the big ring room, <laughs> there's an ink, there's a ribbon in the big ring room. All right. Oh, good. The only door I can go in. Excellent. Fancy door. I'm just going to reload. This feels dangerous. Come back. Oh, no. I'm <laughs> trying to reload a shotgun with grenade ammo. Uh, right. This computer is used to open the electronic locks. Will you turn it on? Sure. Umbrella! Oh, my God. Am I playing Vessel Blue again? <laughs> Uh, login. Uh, it, Ada John, right? Um, password. Ada. I can't remember if that's right or not. Was it, was it just John? Yes! Nice. Excellent stuff. Hacking unsuccessful. <laughs> yeah, that's exactly the password deco. <laughs> Uh, door unlock operation, uh, two. Accessing, accessing, accessing. We're in the matrix, guys. We're in the matrix. Oh, uh, we know this one. This is the worst layout of keyboard I've ever seen in my life. I do at work. <laughs> Whenever I do something, all right. <laughs> Unlocked. Good. Step four. Three. Just not lock everything. Why not? What's the worst that could happen? Done it. We've hacked it. We've hacked the planet. Nice. Right, so that's all we need here. Uh, yes, quit. And don't forget to shut down your computer properly so it gives you that little, your PC, your computer is now safe to turn off notification. Nothing special. Well, I think everything is a bit special. Uh, various chemicals used for research. Nothing useful, though. You're not a chemist. Nothing special. Nothing special. Nothing. Oh, various devices and chemicals. Nothing useful. I just assumed it said nothing special. What about the whatever this is with the hazard tape on it? No. Okay. Nothing special. What this? Nothing. Nothing. <laughs> nothing special. Okay. Some bed. Nothing special. Right. Cool. Pick up this then. It's stuff I can't carry. Yay. Let's use one of these. Lovely. Let's pick this up. The slides. Oh, we're going to see someone's holiday photos. How exciting. Right, is that us? Right, it might be us. To the visual data room. Upstairs, correct. Uh, what the fuck? Why do you guys keep respawning? You're just bullet sponges. Don't like that. Don't like that at all. Clank, 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 clank.
ominous. It's unlocked. We've unlocked it. Right, lovely. Now what's in here? A phone, an intercom, does not seem to be operative. Operative? Don't think that's the word you wanted to use there. Operational, yeah. Operative? Maybe not. Oh, what's this? Security system. Basement level one. Helicopter ports. Executive and government officials only on helicopter ports. This restriction may not apply in case of an accident. Or maybe an emergency. Passage to the helicopter. No one is allowed to enter unless they are attended by a research consultant or security director. All others will be shot on sight. Space. Full stop. Elevator. The elevator stops during emergencies. Space. Full stop. <laughs> I'll stop doing that now. Uh, Basement level 2. Visual data room. Visual data room is within the control of the special research division. Keith Arving. Good old Keith. The room manager is designated to have jurisdiction over room usage. Prison. Sanitation division controls the usage of the prison. Consultant researchers E. Smith, S. Ross, and A. Wesker must be present if virus is used. Triple lock door. No one is allowed to enter unless he presents all passcode documents. Or she, sexist bastard. Uh, passcode documents must be created on the specialized output machine by the chief researcher of each block. Only headquarters supervisors may enter the power room. This restriction may not apply if the consultant researcher has received special instructions. Very special instructions. Passcode output machine. No one is allowed to use a passcode output machine but the chief researchers. And basement four, top secret. Regarding the progress of tyrants after the use of T virus, remaining documents are unreadable. <laughs> oh, juicy law, look at that. Om nom 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 nom. She's not going to make any comment about A Wesker, is she? Not one comment. There's a panel. Will you open it? Not right now, no. Not right this second. I'm afraid of snakes. <laughs> What's this? Unfamiliar physics symbols are written here. Any physics symbol is unfamiliar to me. Oh, hello. What's this? Oh. Oh, maybe that's that. There's a panel here. Will you open it? Sure. There's a big red button. Will you press it? Yeah, sure. Why not? Ah, oh, goody. A hidden bookcase. Copies of Fifty Shades of Grey. An occasional copy of Cosmo. These researchers were pretty boring. Oh, there's a car key. Uh, I need to use the slides. I need to use the slides. Slides. Lovely. Let's have a look, shall we? Umbrella ink. Bioweapon materials. Oh, I haven't got me popcorn. The Cerberus, the MA-39 Cerberus. FI-3 Neptune, also known as Shaki Boy. Uh, MA-121, The Hunter, also known as Prick. Uh, T-002, The Tyrant. Blank slide. This slide left intentionally blank. Bioweapon Research Institutes, R&D staff. That's absolutely not what R&D staff really look like. <gasps> oh no. It's it's your friend and, and, and comrade, Albert Wesker. He's the traitor. Oh no, he was working for Umbrella this whole time. We've pieced it together without exposition. <gasps> da 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 I thought I heard something walking then. Uh, right, what have I got with me? I've got MO disc. Does this say anything? Seems to be a stop disc. That's it. Okay, cool. 
Uh, well, let's, let's hope I don't need to pick anything else up right now. Down we go. Was this door open before or was it locked? I can't remember. I now can't remember what's been... Oh, no. This, so this was open. Uh, so, yeah, this was open. Th Wait, was this locked? Yeah, I'm now completely... Yeah, yeah, no, we've done that bit. I could probably check the map because that at least tells me if I've been in a room or not. <laughs> So now let's go... This was electronic cool lock, which should now be open. Yeah. Oh, yeah. There's a, there's a good number of you. Oh, there actually is a good number of you. More than one is a good number. Uh, it's what I say. It's what I, I class as good numbers for viewers. More than, more than none. Oh, God, there's none. No, get off me. Get off me, you naked, skinless freak. Get off. Wait, this, this is a fax to General Manager of Sanitation Division from Special Committee of Disasters Raccoon... To Special Committee on Disasters, Raccoon Special Research Departments. This memorandum is strictly confidential and must be destroyed as soon as it is understood. As soon as it is understood. I, I, I should never destroy it. Regarding the T-virus outbreak which occurred recently, this committee conducted a field survey. According to the survey results, estimates on the amount of damage caused by the accident uh, are considerably greater than reported earlier. First, although it is very difficult to obtain accurate data in terms of actual numbers, it is thought that more than half of the researchers died after exposure to the T-virus. The body count will most likely increase, since nearly all of the survivors show symptoms peculiar, particular, particular to the T-virus. Second, our security system is still in operation. However, our special security guard squad has been nearly destroyed. <laughs> Great, we're all fucked. Uh, because of that, research information considered by our company to be top secret has been made available to outsiders. Countermeasures should be taken as soon as possible. Finally, many of the subjects from the experiment have escaped and are now out of control. Why does it always go like this? Why is it always like day one, the experiments are going well. Day two, we've provoked all of the experiment researchers, all the experiments. Day three, they've overrun the facility. We're all doomed. Uh, we believe that some researchers were killed by those subjects and their bodies were mutilated. By a curious coincidence, these events are proof of the success of our research. However, there is also a very high risk that this news may be leaked to the press if we don't act immediately. The condition is very serious. Our operation to cover up the situation is difficult to attain. However, we hope the problem will be solved quickly. We are especially concerned that the state fleet and stars are intervening too quickly. We need to act on this situation as well. Facts has been added. There's a sparkly in the corner. A switch for the air conditioner. Oh, there's not a sparkly in the corner. There's a there's a glitchy pixel in the corner. Um, what am I even doing? It's a passcode output machine. If I had a Mo disk, I could get the code. Good job, I've got a Mo disk. Clock. Passcode one. Cool. <laughs> I swear by myself, declares the Lord, uh, that because you have done this and not withheld your son, only your only son, Genesis twenty two sixteen. Wow, I mean, this is this is a bit crazy. <laughs> Nothing special. Okay, cool. Anything on here? Most of them are fictional books. Interesting. This is like a break room then. Let's hope I don't need to come back into here because there's a lot of zombies in here. Right, I think I now need the other two discs as well. So I'm going to nip back and get the other discs.
That scene looks exactly like a screenshot I've seen somewhere else. I don't know where. Oh, it's every horror game. I remember now. Right, let me go swizz back and get some... Which I think it's just here, actually. Uh, get the other discs. the one. Uh, yeah, I'll pop that in here. Now, should we save? That's the question. We have two saves. Let's, we will say, there, ah, there was a save in the thing, wasn't there? There was a save in the thing. Oh, there's no, oh shit, there's no typewriter, is there? We can't save. Oh, crap. I don't want that. Where's the other Moodisk? The other... Oh, there it is. Right. Let's hope it doesn't crash. We could run back and save, but... Let's do that. Um, unless we get to time, and then we will need to, but... I'm feeling pretty good about the next 45 minutes. I'm not going to lie. Yeah, you guys are fucking horrible, aren't you? Um, oh, you've used lab key. Cool. I was going to try that other door first, but whatever. Uh, oh, this key is useless now. Discard. Excellent. That's an extra inventory space I didn't know I wanted. I also would just like to not have... I would like to have more than one shotgun shell in my shotgun. Thanks very much. That's a bit ominous. Oh, fuck it. Let's just nip in here. It's fine. <laughs> I think those are those are uh, thingies, uh, gas vents, and that's a gas vent button in the middle of them too. My guess is I need in that vent or something in that vent. Uh, so is this going to be as easy as this? I certainly hope so. Apparently not, because tank controls. Wait, how am I pushing this back down? Oh, that's how. I should just do this. I can still get behind this, right? Yeah, I can still get behind that. Good. Now, so do this, and then do this. Uh, maybe a tiny bit more? I might be taking the long way around here, but it's what my brain told me to do, so... Right, okay, so that's fine. <laughs> Just annoyed with those stairs now. So now move that very slightly. See if, oh, chill. See if I can push this. I can. Good. Now I may have pushed that too far, but whatever. Uh, can do this. Yeah, because I can just push that back, can't I? So push this down. 
And now there's this way. Good. And now this one down. Uh, hang on. I'm about to get myself stuck. I can feel people typing in chat already. Saying, no, don't do that yet. Don't worry about it. <gasps> Poison gas has escaped. What the fuck? I closed that vent. I'm in danger. No, I'm not in danger anymore. No, I am dying, though. There's an air shaft. Will you enter it? Yes. <laughs> and hopefully... Oh, no! There's poison gas in here, too! No! Don't do this to me! I solved that puzzle! You fuck. You gassy fuck. I sealed that up and solved the puzzle. I God, I hate this game. Rip. Okay. I knew I should have gone back and saved. But now we can skip all that boring shit. So. Yes, you are desynced. Load. Uh, now I know I need to take the other discs as well. And weirdly, I don't think I need to take the bazooka. So. Knew I should have saved. But what did I say to myself? What did I say to you guys? What's the worst that could happen? Welcome once again to the world of survival horror. Right. Proper proper strats now. So there was a save room next to the gas. Was there really? Oh, no. The, the room I didn't go in. <laughs> uh, let me just remove this and remove this. And remove this. So we're now going back into that thing, aren't we? So let's take the moo discs. Cool. Oh, yeah, let's... Uh, where is it? There it is. Deactivate. Reactivate. That's so the sound is synced. Uh, and then just equip the shotgun. Right. Quick strats now, quick strats. Let's go. Let's go and hopefully not break the game while we do it. That would be lovely if we don't break the game. Okay, whoop, stacks. I forgot where we were. Genuinely forgot where we were. I can't believe there's a save room next to the gas room. Jesus. God damn it. It must be so frustrating watching me play games like this. <laughs> I hope you all enjoy it. Right, down here. Yes, doggy, we know. We know. We know. All right, so, oops, completely missed the ladder. Completely missed it. I missed these the first time around and seeing them with mic filter on his phone. <laughs> At least we know we're not going to waste ammo on the skinless zombies. We know they regenerate, which is fine. Unfair, but fine. And we know that these guys 
have no shotgun resistance. So, there we go. Take care of you. We got a couple of uh, herbs here, uh, which we will leave at the moment. Don't you dare vomit on me, you horror. That's just too cold for. That's not sanitary. So, now I've got the other Moo Disc, which is great. I know it's not called a Moo Disc, but yeah, I, I like to call it a Moo Disc. Uh, we don't... Well, we do need the visual data room because we need the lab key to get the other code. That's what we need. We also need quicker loading screens. Right. This is open, I think, right? We need to go in and get the code, the mole code, because we apparently don't know what it is. So we'll do this. We'll grab the letter. Click that switch. Push that button. Push that button. Oh, wait, no. I wonder if this is something we actually need to do or not. Because we can physically type in the, the code, can't we? I don't think there's anything else in here. Oh, there might be something in here, actually. What was in here? A clip. I'm not taking a clip. I'm not taking a clip anymore. This is just an info room, isn't it? Like, this just gives you information. And an and herb as well, which we'll pick up. So, herbs on the top of the stairs. Herb in the code room. Her, uh, what was it? Herbs in the code room. Herbs at the top of the stairs. Ink ribbon in the ring room. That's what we know. That is what we know. We definitely know that for a fact. Is it this way? Let's go with this way. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> Say that way. It actually was this way. Excellent. Uh, there is a computer used to do the electronics. <laughs> tappy, 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 tappy. At least it's a fun, fun splash screen. How many people are playing this put that on their Windows 98 machine? <laughs> uh, John? John? Or are you going to be like, no, that's not right. I don't know this yet. John Ada. Dappy, 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 dappy. We're master. We're master hackers. Accessing. 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 Access denied. Please enter the password. Boop. It is... Ball. Which is a rubbish password. Like, proper bad. There's no special characters in there. <laughs> Finger guns. There's no special characters in there. There's no uppercase, lowercase. There's no differentiation. There's no numbers. No nothing. Right. Password security is very lax on Umbrella HQ. Cha-ching. There we go. Cool. That's it. That's all I wanted. Thanks. Uh, yes, really quick. Well, how they, they turn the PC off. <laughs> They're being very conscious. Get the slides. I don't know if this is important or not, but we're just going to zip through them. And then we leave. We don't need this room anymore. Can you imagine how quick a second playthrough this would be? Oh, oh boy. Oh, lordy. Right. Go back up the stairs. What do these monsters remind me of? I cannot... Cannot for the life of me. I think they might remind me of mannequins. I'm not sure. Like really weird mannequins. I'm sure they remind me of an enemy from another game. Good. This is now open. Now we push that button. I cannot believe that gas was not, that vent was not covered. Utterly unbelievable. I've got the wrong way. 
big boops. Just wreck the place. Uh, yep. There's a switch. Will you push it? I'm sure. That's the worst thing that can happen. Have I got any inventory space left? I do have inventory space left. Let's quickly do this. Ah. Do the slides. Yours. Umbrella Inc. Zombies. 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 More zombies. Evil douchebags. Some of them have got to be the original developers' photos. <laughs> Lab key. Definitely looks like a car key. Like an old car key. Right. Let's get out of here. So now... Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. There we go. Tank controls. Thank you. Down the stairs, we'll go into the room on the right first because that's now unlocked. Then we'll go into the lab because that's got gas in it. Um, which I think then leads to the morgue. We'll also see if there's a save room as well. Right, so this room's now... Oh, God. This room's now unlocked, which has a lot of zombies in, but I might be able to just loop them. I might be able to run around them. It might not be worth running around them, though. It might just be worth actually killing them. I'm, I'm not low on ammo, so... Right, there's three. I'm pretty sure there was four. Yep, there's four. Thank you. Don't care about the facts right now. I want to grab this first. Good. Get my print out. I swear by myself, declares the Lord. That because, yeah, that's cool. That's the same one. Cool. So we've got passcode number one. Now grab the fax. Yep, yeah, excellent. We all read that, right? Yeah, we can all speed read. Now we're going to see if there is actually a thingy. You redeemed hydrate. Uh, I, I do have a bit left, actually. Thank you. <sighs> Lovely. And stretch. I can stretch during a... Oh, that felt good. I can stretch during a thingy. <sighs> oh, can't stretch now. Good Lord. Out the way, mate. Out the way. So, is it one of these? Is it this one? No, it's not you. It's not you. It's not you. You're another guy, friend. You're another guy. Uh, is it it's this this one? No, it's locked from inside. Do go away. Posh check. That's a good shout. I am slouching. So get off. Oh, chill. Thank God. I had real worry there. Um, okay, so... Ink ribbon, all important. Posture, yes. That's a very good job. Thank you. Ah. Ink ribbon. Now we're going to go to the gas room, which is over here, right? Wham. <laughs> yep, that's not useless. Cool, discard that. So I was so close with that puzzle earlier. Save him straight ahead. Well, straight ahead of here. In here. In here, he says. It is a save room. Fantastic. Bloody brilliant. Right. Cheeky save. You can save your progress with this. Radio yours and increment. Sure. But sure. Darn toot. No, well. Damn right. OK, 
Okay, I'm not too fussed about looting this room right now. What I'd really like to do is I'd like to go and do that gas room. Now we've saved. Go do that gas room so we never have to do that again. Um, and then we can see what is going on with the rest of this place. Go do this. Because I think this is for a code, I think. Okay, so... How many inventory spaces have I got? I've got two. We've got a red herb here, which is actually pretty important because they boost other herbs. Uh, yep, take that. I don't think you can have two red and one green. I don't think that's how it works. I think you can have one red and two green as an operating table. I don't care about the operating table. I care about the shotgun shells on the operating table. <laughs> will you take the shells? Yes, I will indeed take the shells. Thank you. Now, let's just double check we're doing this right. So this was that one. I wonder if this one needs to be up a smidge, but I'm sure, I'm pretty sure it was the bottom one that was leaking. Like, it looks like the bottom one that was leaking, right? Try not to step on the button. I assume if I step on the button, I die. Right. And then... I'm going to push... Can go past it, right? Oh my god. I'm gonna push this up a bit. And then I'm gonna push this up a bit. And then I'm gonna go round here, hopefully not hitting that box on the stairs now. Nope, I'm hitting the box on the stairs. Brilliant. Can I get through there actually? Is that a thing I can do? I can! Brilliant. Right. Very tiny nudge there. Can still get... Oh, no, no, I can't get past here. Aha, I see. So now I've understood the problem. There we go. Okay, put that there. Now I'll go over here. Okay, now that's, I mean, that can't not be on that vent now, right? It's definitely on that vent. It can't not be on the vent. <laughs> There's no way this gas is getting out. Absolutely no way. Wait, let me just pop a heel first. <laughs> No, we're fine, right? We're absolutely golden. Cool. There is an air shaft. Will you enter it? Sure, why not? I'm trying to die this time. Oh, lovely. It's the morgue. I think this bit was a bit spooky when I first played it. I can't remember what happens. Uh, ooh, magnum ammo. Oh, 100% do not. Oh, sorry, Will. I will 100%. I didn't put the fucking ink ribbon back, did I? What a numpty. Oh, there's a passcode output machine. Cool. If I had a modisk, I could get a code. Mo code. Passcode number two. I will surely bless you and make your descendants as numerous as the stars in the sky and as the sand on the seashore. Your descendants will take possession of the cities and their enemies. Genesis 22.17. God, the Bible's a cheery book, isn't it? Right, so that's... Aha, I've unlocked it, which is the, I presume, the door with the green light above it from the O room. Hooray! Go back in here. <laughs> so we've done that bit. Now what's over here? Come here, you. Bye. Oh. There's no reaction. It has no power. Oh, okay. Power house. That's what that is. Power house. Oh my god, what are they? 
Oh no. Oh no. Oh lord. What's this? A power panel. Some areas do not have power. Will you activate the blacked out areas? Yes. No, I gotta go. Bye. I gotta leave. I gotta reset the room. <laughs> I gotta go. <laughs> I don't know if that's what I needed to do. <laughs> I hope there's nothing dead important in there. There's no reaction. It has no power. Fuck. <laughs> right. Let me... Yeah, let me save. I don't want to die to something that looks like it has blades for hands. Oh, no, that's not the save room. That's the, that's the gas room. Also, I still have... Oh, no, is this our last... No, it's not our last one. Good. This is not our last one, people. Not our last one. Uh, you can see your progress here with this. Will you use the ink ribbon? Yes. I will indeed. I will indeed. Boop, boop, boop. now. Uh, so I don't have a thing ribbon anymore. No, good. If I just gather this, hoover yeah. some loot. Oh, look. A blue herb. And blue herb. At least those things can't chase me out of that room, he says. Famous last words. Uh, actually, no, I'll take that and that. Yeah, I'll take some Heelys. Combino? Yes. Combino? Yes. So, I just activated a switch. I ran away from the camera and activated a switch. Now, if I run towards the camera... <laughs> What's going to happen? Death. Dismemberment. Really loud noise. This way? No. Yes. No. No. That's a dead end. Ow. Oh, there's a door. Good. Oh, I wonder if there's another panel somewhere. Oh, good. Bye bye. Nope, I gotta go, you little creepy bastard. <laughs> right. I think I saw something there. Right. Go back here. Go back here. Yes, yes, yes. Am I in danger? I'm actually fine. It was not nearly as deadly as I thought. There's a way here. Aha! There's a passcode output machine. If only I had a modisk, I could get the code. Quick! <laughs> passcode three. And through your offspring, all nations on Earth will be blessed because you have obeyed me. Cool, excellent stuff. Right, passcode number three is in file. Now run the fuck away. Keep it behind you at all times. Uh, and caution. I probably. I'll, I'll, I'll use it. <laughs> uh, no thanks. No thanks. No thanks. No thanks. No thanks. No thanks. Bye. It's <laughs> getting worse. Oh, hello. Uh, it's triggering system activation. It's quite big. What? Activator. It's quite big. Cool. Cool. Oh, maybe... It's, is it this turn? Now? 
What do I need to do? In here. The power connection, the elevator power is off. Will you connect? Oh, yeah, please. Cool. Nice. Do I need to do anything with this? Oh my god, that noise. Nope, I'm out. We are leaving. Time to leave. No, you don't. No, you don't. A uh, bye bye. Uh, is this where I need to go? Oh, God. God can't help me here. Oh, that noise. Oh, man. Man alive, that noise. Oh. The lift. The lift is... There's no reaction. It has no power. What? There's a switch. We push it. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Jill. Jill. You're here, too. Yes, you're here too? We're all here. Look, uh, I lost my way. Let's get going. <laughs> I'm here too. <laughs> Everyone's here. Oh, hello, Wesker. You did a fine job, Barry. Just as I thought. Barry, no. I think you should stay away from Barry, Jill. I hear that his wife and two daughters will be in danger if he doesn't do everything I tell him to. Bastard. You are so cruel. Well, you don't have to worry about anything, because you'll be free from this world very soon, Jill. Why do you have to destroy stars? That's Umbrella's intention. This laboratory has been engaging in dangerous experiments, and recently an accident has occurred. Anyway, this disaster cannot be made public. Oh, that's why having stars nosing about is so inconvenient. So you're a slave of Umbrella now, along Barry with these no. virus monsters. I think you misunderstand me, Joe. To me, the monsters you mentioned mean nothing. I'm going to burn all of them together with this entire laboratory. I must complete my mission as ordered by Umbrella. Barry, go up on the ground and wait there. Barry! Barry's such a fool. He'll be under the control of Umbrella forever. How come both Umbrella and you can intimidate him by taking his family as hostages? Umbrella? Well, I intimidated him, but it had nothing to do with Umbrella. I just used him for my personal purposes, though both you and Barry seem to think I was following orders from Umbrella. So you're planning something else? If you succeeded in developing the world's most powerful biological weapon, what would you do? What if you were in charge? You must stop this now. You're a brave girl. But if I were you, I wouldn't give up such a big discovery. You guys are idiots. No one understands its real value. So, you're going to steal all the research? <laughs> Better yet, I'm going to show you the tyrant. Oh! Ah, Barry! Barry! Sorry, Jill. How is your family? Uh, I was listening to what you and Wesker were talking about. I wish I realized it earlier. I thought it must have something to do with Umbrella, you know. So it's all been masterminded by him. 
But it's good that you know that now. Anyway, let's get out of this house first. Jill! Yes, what? Do you have any idea what Wesker was going to show you at the back of this place? <laughs> well, he was talking about the world's most powerful biological weapon, called Tyrant or something, I, I think. Do you think we could see Tyrant now? Barry, <laughs> you're so optimistic. It would look bad for stars if we let such a dangerous creature run loose. Maybe you're right. Let's go then. <laughs> oh no, I'm not actually going to go in the room. I've not got my bazooka or my coat or anything. <laughs> I've just got my shotgun. I didn't realize this was a, sc a whole scripted thing. I'm not even saved. Oh, I'm so dead. I'm so dead. Cutscene time? Yeah, cutscene time. Twitching hand. Nice. Classic. If only it had a gl big thumping weak Can spot. Can a creature like this really be the ultimate biological weapon? Really? Wesker is a crazy man. Tyrant is not completely developed. But we can't let it live. Yeah, green, green. That must be the computer for monitoring this creature. I'm so dead. <laughs> I don't want to die because I then have to do that bloody power room again. Barry, stop pressing buttons. Barry, stop pressing buttons. That's what happens when old people use computers. <laughs> oh, now you've torn it. <laughs> well, strong glass. Well, oh, shit. Damn you! <laughs> Oof. Insta kill. Soon to be a double kill. Can't control what it does. Gotta go by. <laughs> I don't have my bazooka with you. No, I don't. Okay, sweet. Wait, can you lunge at this point? This is awful. I cannot believe I'm stuck here fighting the tyrant with a shotgun. It could be worse. It could be the Beretta. I gotta go by. Barry, can I have your coal? Is that... I don't think I can do. Does anybody know roughly how many shotgun shells it takes to kill a tyrant? Like, if you had to say between 1 and 40... Oh shit, I missed. Gotta go. <laughs> you gotta go. I need to reload. Ah, quick reload. Lovely. Oh, oh. <gasps> no way! Shotgun, all of the ammunition in storage, and we did it with a goddamn shotgun. Barry? Barry? <laughs> oh, I can't believe we did that. <laughs> You're alive. Uh, 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 I'm really embarrassed. I was clumsy. Let's get going. Yeah, let's leave. Let's, let's just go, shall we? <laughs> thank you very much. Thank you, everyone. <laughs> right, yeah, let's go. Let's just, we, don't, we don't need to be here anymore. Let's leave. <laughs> no, 
I have agency and control over it. <laughs> I can't believe we did that. Ah, oh, Wesker's gone. What happened to Wesker? Scurried away. <gasps> Wesker must have set it off. There's not much time left for us. Absolute tune, though. Uh, I need the thing. Ink ribbon. Oh, second to last. Fucking save. Oh, you can save your progress here with this. Where are you using it? Yes. Oh, good now I forgot about this bit. Wait, this is live? No, it's all pre-recorded, Darcy. I'm just really good at predicting what people say. <laughs> Great predictions. I'm like Mystic Meg. Uh, right, put that there. Put that there. I need a fucking screen. Where's I need a screen? I'm tr I'm pan I'm stressed now. It's stressing me out. Right, put that. Uh, let's... Oh, hang on. Hang on. Good, I've got my notifications on, which is good. Uh, that way, good clip, wasn't it? Um, right. We've got to go save Chris again, haven't we? Because we've, we've got the pages and we haven't got anything else. So go save, go save Chris. Then come back here, stock up. Actually, we can stock up now, to be honest, and then just leave. Because I'm pretty sure we've done everything. Sorry. I'm in a weird mood. Oh my god, oh my god. Right, there. As good as that was, I'm probably going to take the Magnum. Let's just accumulate our Magnum rounds now, because this is our last hurrah. Magnum rounds. Have we got any more Magnum rounds? Have we got any more Magnum rounds? I got that. I got any more Magnum rounds? Uh, was that Magnum rounds? No, that was mixed herbs. And the Colt Python. I said Colt Python. What what bazooka -y doodars have we got? We got flame rounds. We got explosive rounds. Ooh, lots of explosive rounds. Lovely. We got the bazooka. Combat knife only. <laughs> Two combat knives. Yatta! Coming for you, tyrant. Not today. <laughs> there is a run like that. This is not that run. Right, I need I need to just uh, pull some stuff. Combino Boomius. Dharma Sire of my magic. She's <laughs> going knives akimbo. I wish she could do that, actually. I probably would do that if I could. Uh, right, what we got, what we got, what we got? Fade spray, that'll do. And let's take... Oh my god, this inventory management. Mixed herbs. 
What other mixed herbs have we got? We got any other herbs? We got those. That'll probably do. I got anything better? So empty bottles. I should chuck empty bottles at it. Uh, more mixed herbs. No, I'm good. Right, I think it's us. How many bullets can this thing hold? Only six. Okay. Also, hi, Dasisu. How are you doing? Good to see you. I haven't got anything else so far. Uh, let's go with the bazooka. Let's go with the coal python because it's a fucking fun gun. Then we we can be Baby Burton. Baby Barry Burton. No one puts Baby Barry Burton in the corner. Right, it was... This way? Oh, look at me like that. It's been days since I've played it. <laughs> oh, yeah. So, for the purpose of YouTube... Wow! Anyway, for the purpose of YouTube... Um, different day for you. Sorry, back up. Different day for us. Same video for yourself. There's going to be a big bumper uh, episode to go on this. We're now back. We've got all of the passcodes. And I think we're now going to go and rescue um, Chris Redfield. Because I think he's trapped. And I think that gives us the best ending. Which I personally have never gotten ever in my life. I mean, I've, only, I've not played this tons, but I've played it enough, and I've never gotten that ending, so. The alarm doesn't reach here. Only the techno spa music. Oh, Jill! Oh, oh Chris. Chris! So you're okay! Yeah, you too! What happened to Wesker? Let's talk about it later. Let's get out of here. Right, let's go. Let's go. We've got, we've got tyrants to kill. I mean, we don't have tyrants to kill. Hashtag spoilers. All right. Come on, Redfield. What are you waiting for? Fucking invitation. Jesus. Get moving, mate. Get moving. Create a dashboard. Stream manager. There we go. Let's go. Well, I'm trying, mate. I'm trying. I'm doing my best. The something system has now been activated. All something something to the something 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 something. Uh, <laughs> I gotta go. See you later, cameras. It was fun while it lasted. The triggering system has now been activated. Everyone has been triggered. Everyone has been triggered. Come here. Pow! <laughs> I love this gun. Oh, you are nowhere near me. Oh, herbs. Herb. Ah. Ow, you fucker! Pow! Pow! God, I love this gun. <laughs> Dust CC. Don't listen to mine, because that's taking the same day for us. Oh, I can't carry those. Okay. <laughs> I knew you'd come to that echo. I knew you captured that. That was an excellent moment. For the purpose of YouTube. <laughs> and for someone who has, who has been planning YouTube content for the last, like, couple of days. Yeah, that's exactly right. That's exactly how I feel about it. I would really like just a nice way of uh, scheduling stuff that isn't the awful, awful YouTube scheduler. Ugh, it's terrible. We gotta go. Hurry. Hey, two spots together. All right, I'm hurrying. Come on. To the chopper. Fucking this this emergency rave music just won't stop. All right, come on, lads. What are you looking at me for? Good old Brad. He's got a bright future ahead of him, is our Brad. 
there is Ziggy Zag. Hello, what's this? Are you, are you fucking joking me? Are you joking me? I need an inventory space. I'm going to hate myself for this. Oh, that's not even going to work. Because that's not going to empty that, is it? Fucking hell. Uh, fine, use that. Get myself up to full. This game. This actual game. I wonder who, who could have possibly just pulled the battery out and chucked it to one side. Making us use one of our precious, precious inventory spaces. Wesker! Until explosion. Oh. Oh no, you must be kidding. After we've come all the way here. Ladies first. Go first, Jill. But Chris. Give me a chance to play nice guy. Okay, I leave it <laughs> to you. See you again at the heliport. See you guys at the heliport. <laughs> See you later, suckers. Three minutes until explosion. 40 seconds of that has been wasted with these knuckleheads exchanging pleasantries. <laughs> great, great. How you doing? It's good to see you, man. I heard Final Fantasy VII bombing music as soon as the timer came up. Yeah. Aye, aye. aye. What's this? What are you? Will you take the flare? Ch sure. I don't quite remember what it's for, but... Oh, wait. Now I remember what it's for. <laughs> you can just carry the battery in your hands to the distance without putting your inventory first. No, apparently not. Darth CC, apparently not. That's not how it works. <laughs> I didn't know this. That's not how it works. <gasps> I hear a chopper. Now there's only two minutes left because of all this fucking around. Oh... Thank God there's not a giant monster trying to kill us. God, I'd be so annoyed if there was a giant monster trying to ruin our day. Especially one with already, we'd already fought and pumped full of shotgun shells. What on earth could that be? Oh, it's a giant monster trying to kill us that's full of shotgun shells. Oh. Not me. See ya. Come on. Do your... Do your chop-chop slide. Or don't. Nope. Now I gotta go. I gotta run. Oh. That's not how physics works. I don't, I don't think I killed him then. Whoop. How's my health? I'm fine. 50 seconds. Maybe if we didn't stand around flapping our gums for so long. Ow. Get me out of a corner. No one puts baby Burton in a corner. Uh, however, people can, you know marginally eviscerate me if you do trap me in a corner and you happen to have razor blades for fingers. But, you know. Oh, fucking hell. Oh, Jill. Come on. I gotta go. Oh, shit. Yep, right. Yep, this is it. Kill that monster, quick. You've only got seven seconds. Ow. Four, three, two. Take the rocket launcher. Yes. Quickly go into inventory because that freezes time. Equip the rocket launcher. Point blank shot, I'm 100% jam on the floor. There's no... 
<laughs> There's no way. Also, that bomb has definitely gone off. <laughs> There's no way with that blast back, I am not missed. <laughs> Red mist. Jill jam. I'm 100% jam at this point. I'm just, I'm dead. The shockwave alone would have just completely blew me apart. Oh, now I've got to fucking deactivate it and reactivate it again, haven't I? Right, deactivate, reactivate quick. There we go. Oh. All right, Brad, bit of a wobbly landing there, mate. I bet having never flown a helicopter, I'm sure it's very easy. I've played Elite Dangerous a couple of times. How, how diff, more different than that? Ah. Oh. I had another two or three minutes there. There was no need for that sort of that sort of pressure. There we are. We're safe. I don't know where Barry is. There he is, Big Daddy Burton. Now, question: Where's Rebecca? Because Rebecca's in this as well, isn't she? Is that do 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 we just gloss over the fact that she's now dead? Because I don't know if Jill meets her. <laughs> no, no surnames. You don't get any surnames. You just... <laughs> GG, everyone. GG. I'd have quite liked there to have been like outtakes of the live action stuff in this. <laughs> that would have been quite cool. <laughs> Kabow! Are you going to see me get eaten? Because that definitely happened. Thanks so much, question results. I appreciate that. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for the uh, 13 months. Holy shit. That's amazing. Um, Brian, you'll be, you'll be pleased to know the reason I paused there is because Brian was screaming down my ear. I really must have a word. He's on his third warning, so I might just uh, I might have to uh, have a word with his, his uh, uh, attitude. Film crew. I don't know if you'd want your name on that. <laughs> Wabash Karate Chop! <laughs> Oh, yeah. Ending theme, still dawn. That's factually incorrect. We had a shotgun. Thank you. I think you'll find. And we definitely didn't have that long to wander around and fire the rocket launcher. Pchow! Resident Evil. Come on, let's get to the stats. You took 36 hours. Total time, 6 hours, 49 minutes. That's not bad. Number of saves, 19. Eh, could live with that. Honestly, I am super proud of us for getting this far and completing Resident Evil 1. On original hardware, we had a couple of hardware bumps and lumps over the, over the course of the journey. Uh, but I fucking loved this. I, oh, I pump this feeling into my veins. But playing retro games, retro horror games, just absolutely. Um, nom, 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 nom. Give me more, please. So, Next time, we're going to be playing Resident Evil 2 because this year's Spooky Season Streams, we are playing retro... We are playing series of um, horror games, and this series just happens to be Resident Evil. So... Thank you very much for watching. Screaming at a joypad or peripheral mic or retro gamer nerd, wherever I happen to be posting this. You can find all of those channels on the YouTubes. And uh, stay safe, stay spooky, stay awesome. And I'll catch you next time for Resident Evil 2. Thanks very much. <laughs>